What's up, homies? Welcome to the stream, dudes. Got Chris in here, Coffee, Robbie, Nathan, Miguel, Pally, Steven's in here. What's up, broskies? Welcome, welcome, welcome. This stream could go for an indefinite amount of time, Vinny, but uh, Trav has been very lucrative so far. Very. <laughs> has been suspiciously generous so far. I've, uh, as you can see, I've already done 450 runs, so I'm not starting from the first run, although I should have, because that would have been a huge idea. If I'd known how lucky I would have been so far, then I would have, but uh, you just never know. You just never know, Billy. You just never know. Let me show you guys what I've got <laughs> in 450 runs. <laughs> it's insane. It's insane. Ch Chickity, check this out. And then I'll go over the gear and stuff. Pre-recorded, honestly, bro. These drops have been so cooked. They've been insane. Check this out. So, 450 runs. I found a Jar rune. I found a Low rune. I found two Vex runes. I found four Shakos that I all traded for Ist runes. The Vex, the other Vex I got from, like, trading a Gull and a 5-5 Fire Facet. It's been nutty, James. Absolutely nutty, bro. Freaking this this is just nuts. 450 runs, jar rune, low rune, two vex runes. It's P it's P1. It's on ladder. We're on ladder. P1. We got the magic find top top left up here. It's been around 200 the whole time. Not that it matters for this stuff. But it does matter for the freaking four shakos I've found. Mad hacks. Dude, it's suspicious, bro. It's fucking suspicious, Nicholas. I'm worried I'm gonna get banned for this shit. Honestly, like that you'll we'll make a video out of this of course and you'll see me being like dude I'm genuinely concerned. I'm gonna get banned <laughs> A metal grid I found a metal grid as well <laughs> You're banned dude This has been the most fried drops I've ever had in my life Like this has been nuts Like someone said the other day on stream they're like oh I think they've increased rune drop rates And I was like nah man no, no shot. But now I'm kind of like, oh, maybe. <laughs> maybe. Who's in it? Who's in it, Blizzard? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm a mole. We got a rat. <laughs> we got a rat. All right. What I'll do is I will, um, I'm going to wait 15 seconds and then I'm going to go over the gear and then I'll just put a little timestamp in the description just for anyone that's curious. In, uh, four... Five. Wait, that's not how you count. Three, two, one. Here's the gear, boys. So we had the grief that we made on stream the other day. I have Immortal Kings with just a couple of Tapaz in there. Wearing a treachery. I'm going to be completely honest. I've got no idea what IS breakpoints we're on right now. But uh, it's just a lot of bonus attack speed. Plus the fade's kind of useful, you know, from time to time. We have Metal Grid, which with a really good roll. I didn't know how this rolled, so I didn't realize at the time how good this rolled, but this is a really good roll. I think it's 350 to 450, 300 to 350, and then like 25 to 35. So really good roll. And like gives us a whopping attack rating boost. It goes up once we've got our boo on, it's like almost 4k boost in attack rating. Got a rhyme for the can't be frozen. We're wearing three piece immortal kings. We've got a dwarf star and a 27 nagel. So we're still kind of like gearing up from the start of ladder, but obviously we've got some some good stuff already, like the grief. On switch, I just have two spirits for the Hawken. That's probably better to have, I don't know. I don't know what people have on switch, like Heart of the Oaks and maybe like an Alibaba or something. And down here we have our glorious Barbarian Torch. We've got a 1815 Annie. And then most of these are like crappy magic find ones, except for this one, with like attack rating and survivability ones. And this shitty Geeds. 26 Geeds. And we can thank G-Stacks for this one. Thank you, G-Stacks. So that's it. I'll just timestamp this because um, naturally 
everyone's curious about the gear, myself included. Uh, let's put it here. Gear check. I think that should work. If one of you bros wouldn't mind clicking on the timestamp in the description to let me know it works, that'll be awesome. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Giga Chad, what's up, man? Welcome to the stream, dog. Keep to Enigma to rap, boys. <laughs> Good stream today. Dude, like, oh, man. I was so prepared. I was so freaking prepared, Billy, to run Trav like 3,000 times. Like, emotionally prepared, physically prepared. And then last night, I found a Java rune, and I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> this is going to be a short video. <laughs> it doesn't work. Damn, really? That sucks. I don't know how I can make it work. I guess I could just tell people just, just to go three minutes into this dram. Oh well. Description is for chapters. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh right, well, I'll just get. I guess I'll just tell people three minutes into the stream. Yeah. I'm sure they can figure it out. <laughs> Schmuck is back on. Welcome to the stream, Toby. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Should we get bloody rolling, bros? Get rolling. Get rolling, rolling, rolling. What? Did you guys watch the uh, campfire chat this morning? I was just listening to it then because I was sleeping when I was on. And dare I say it, dare I say it, lads, I am optimistic. I should be cautiously optimistic, but I'm just flat out optimistic about uh, season, season two of D4. W changes, right? Right? And the two bros they bought, brought in were like really good. Um, they were really articulate and they sounded like they played the game, which is insane. I especially like the guy on the left. Like far left. Did I get this? So here, I'm hunting for a freaking 40 magic climb ring, which allegedly exists, although I've never seen anything over. Over 30. Don't convince me to buy it. No, no, no. If you haven't bought it yet, don't buy it yet. You know? Don't buy it yet. But uh, if you've already got it, I am definitely going to give Season 2 a crack. See what's up. It exists. You had a 39 last season. Hell yeah, dude. Yeah, like, if you, if you haven't bought it already, like, no reason to jump into it now. May, may as well wait until it's like confirmed good which i think you're who said it yeah like maybe season three season four like right now if you're if you were to buy it now it would just be a gamber again because like need to actually see how it plays you know they said a lot of good things but like need to get your hands on it <clears throat> you were hyped last week this stream had me cautiously optimistic really really i mean why why are you less excited after watching this stream St steven just out, out of curiosity what's up funky good to see you dog Back in the stream, man. Oh, man. Ooh, Smolly. Grief. <laughs> Grief is just so nice. I remember I did like 20 runs with like an unbending will. And then I tried a couple of other things. I tried obedience. I tried... I tried, um... <laughs> oh, excuse me. I tried full Immortal Kings. And it's like, oh, man. It feels so good to be just smacking dudes with the Grief. And Billy with the gifted membership. Thank you, man. Thank you so much, dude. I really appreciate it, dog. Smally, Flaggy, Flawless. In the bin. Doubly in the bin. I wonder if they'll add drop bears for this game in the future like they did in PoE. <laughs> I love that they're in PoE. <laughs> Freaking drop drop bears. 
<laughs> that is the most oceanic thing ever. So I thought for this video I'll do... Because you know how I put the table at the end? I thought I'd also include like how many of each P gem I got. And um, how many rails I got and stuff like that. Just because I'm, I'm curious in that sort of stuff. I don't know if you guys give a fuck, but... I'm interested in that stuff. More data. Give me more... Give me more numbers. Do you have 49 on Hawk or just one pointer? Yeah, I can, um... I'll show you the skills. It's it's not min-maxed at all. But I'll show you what I'm rolling with... Uh, after this run. Yeah, great question. I've got, like... Three into Hawk, and then, like, four into Fine Potion. Or something... Something nonsensical like that. And I think I'm, like... 51 or 52 percent hawk like with the boo and with the spirits oh i missed one come here you the rat bag oh and G giga chat and uh shackle spy thank you guys so much man i really appreciate it dudes thank you so much hope you're having a blessed uh blessed season start and some legends on the receiving end of the um, the gifted their shackle spy. Thank you so much, dude. All right, here are the skills. So, max berserk, obviously. Then I max the two synergies. Battle orders, how? Uh, one into battle command. I've got one into battle cry, even though I'm not actually using it. But I did use it a little bit when we were doing ubers with this character. So we could save two two points there uh max sword mastery one into each of these one hit wonders and then i've got four into find item and three into find potion doesn't really make sense but that's i've just been watching i've just been looking at like the next level upgrade and whichever would give me more percentage boost into the chance to hit a hawk then i'll just go into whichever one it was so like an extra pointer to find item or an extra pointer to find potion so find potion you get a guaranteed one percent but for the first few levels of leveling up find item it goes up more than one percent and then you reach a certain point i'm not sure exactly where it is where it's like two levels is one percent at least i think so so this this could be min max more and then there's two skill points here we could we could yoink, but uh, if we ever want to do Ubers with this character, it's, it's not not bad to have a point into battle cry. And Giga Chat again, dog, you're the man, bro. Thanks, thanks so much, dude. You're right, I am the man. You're right. Regular old hero over here, cleansing cleansing spiders from uh, from damsels in distress. Thanks so much, man. Five kilometers every high road. Bro, I'd be an ultra marathon runner by by now. Been so, so lucrative. <laughs> like, it was already insane. It was already so insane. And then that jar rune dropped last night. And I was like, what? You have got to be kidding me. That was like the sir rune from running the running the countdown. That's just that's just half a video right, right there. You're welcome, brother. Thank you, man. Thank you so much again, dude. Flawless. I've identified... You know what's crazy? I've probably identified, like... Honestly, over 30. Maybe even... Um, maybe even over 40 Grand Charms. And none of them have been remotely good. I've got one Skiller. And it was a Druid Summoning Skiller. Greetings from the US. Hey, welcome to the stream, man. What time is it over there? I was checking the gear and you asked what to have on swap. Cheap options, two blades of Alibaba. Yeah, true. Yeah, true, 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 true. Yeah, I don't... <laughs> I don't... I obviously don't know much about how to play barbs. But one thing I've, I've wondered before is... What do you prioritize on Switch? Do you prioritize more magic find? Or do you prioritize more skills so you, then you get a higher percentage of Hawken? And also... 
having the FCR on the spirits is really nice as well. Just for quality of life. I mean, one thing we could for sure do is like have an Alibaba offhand. But then we'd need the can't be frozen somewhere. Or, or it'd be nice to have the can't be frozen somewhere. Which... Which, like, if we were to put a Raven Frost on, then we'd do cold damage and would shatter shatter corpses. And I don't have, like, a Chamaroon or a Trang's Belt yet. Ooh, Grandy. But I don't know how much we actually need Can't Be Frozen. Like, it's nice to have. The bear would drop in no time. Well, we the thing is, we almost have enough runes to trade for bear. Like, at the moment, or at least last night on Tradery, I haven't checked this morning. Bear runes are going for, like, two lows and two vexes. So it's kind of like, we can almost trade for one. Which is insane. Skills for Hawk and runes. Magic find for uniques. Alibaba for Hawk and if you want to magic find the Hawk. Yeah, true, true. I guess it's just what your prioritizing hey feeble yeah that's that's a really good way of articulating that i guess since we're trav and i think trav is level i could be wrong here but is trav like a level 83 area i should probably look this up before i sink thousands of hours into running somewhere then i probably want to prioritize runes here but if we were like pits which is 85 then maybe prioritize magic finding more. Also, I don't have Alibaba's. But that, that'd be cheap as chips if I wanted to trade for one. Any good drops yet? Insane drops, bro. Insane drops. None yet today, because we've only been gone for like 10 minutes. But this has been the luckiest 450 runs that I've ever had. Genuinely. I insane. Like, absolutely nutty. It's 82. Okay, sweet. Do you not live in the US? No, I'm from Australia. I just say my R's funny sometimes. So, just to throw you off the scent. <laughs> yeah. Don't ask why I do that. Does he sound like he's in the US? Sometimes, sometimes I do. Like, some of my R's are very, very US of A. <clears throat> Can you say water? Water. Earth. Fire. Long ago, the four nations lived in harmony. Oh, you set me off. You set me off, man. <laughs> oh, fire damage. Is there anything I'm missing here? No. Can you say crikey? <laughs> crikey, mate. Put some shrimps on the barbie. They're called prawns. <laughs> you don't even call them shrimps. <laughs> Schmuck's a pirate with the R's. Hey, what's up, infantry? Welcome to the stream, man. She love. Oh, man. I love how that lives on, man. I got this one friend who... Like, he would be looking down on us from heaven being... um, That would bring the biggest smile to his face. The fact that people are still calling me that. You have a question about streaming? Fire away, dog. Yeah, fire away. I mean, I feel like I should put a little dis disclaimer that I have no idea what I'm doing. You know, I am definitely a newbie to this whole streaming landscape, but I'll try and answer as best I can. Good morning from Europe. Welcome to the stream, man. Hope you, hope you slept well. Oh, I saw the happy color down there. What is it? Oh, light crossbow. Oh, heavy boots. Nice. What a roller coaster. Pretty good fire res on that, hey? I mean, I sure all of you know this already, but the the max roll is 40 on resistances on red boots. So 39 is good, but we need more than that. We need more than that. What's up, Lego? Welcome to the stream, man. Uh, you've been streaming for like six and a half years. Hot damn, man. Good on ya. Not plugging anything. Oh, that's, that's okay, dude. 
Just wanted to know if you ever feel a pang of guilt when you get big donations. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, it's a, it's, it's a really surreal feeling to, to get big donations. And it's, it's not something that goes away. Especially if, I mean, you would know this, of course. Especially if you, like everyone, have just worked shitty jobs. You know what I mean? Just working just the, the absolute worst job for minimum wage. And you remember what that feels like. And then you're just sitting on your ass playing video games. And then someone donates to you what you would make in a day. Like, that's, it's, it's not just you, dog. <clears throat> yeah, honestly, I was go. I, I would go as far to say, I think everyone that's not like an out of touch douche, douche douchebag would feel the same. Yeah, like it's. I feel extremely grateful, but there is. It, it's it's a it's a weird feeling. It's a really surreal feeling. Yeah, for sure. It sounds brutal. Yeah, I know. It's so brutal <laughs> playing video games and people donating you money. I'm glad that that came across. Thank you for reading between the lines. Yep. Oh, you fucking... You rat bag. Oh, bro. Thank you so much. He is a lifetime of schmucky. Exhibit A, dude. Fucking exhibit A, man. Bro, thank you so much, dog. Thank you for, um, thank you for, uh, making me feel guilty as hell, Giga Chad. Yeah, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Right, thank you, man. Thank you so much. So, like, yeah, like, that's, you know, that's a day's work for a lot of people right there. You know, that's, so it's, it's, it's nonsensical. Thank, thank you so much, man. I really do appreciate it. Gladius, I guess we look at this just to see if it's max roll. I think that's max on the mastery. Immediate ramp back comment, I know. Clip it! <laughs> Clip it! <laughs> Clip it and take it completely out of context. <laughs> You're welcome, bud. Th thank you so much, man. Honestly. High class good sack incoming. Bro, I haven't I haven't actually drank um. I haven't actually drank in like over a week now, which is normal for a lot of people, but for me it's not normal. So um, basically, I'm fishing for praise. I'm fishing for praise for being a normal human being. Is exactly what's happening right now. Can you dress up for a Halloween stream? Uh, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, you guys taught me when Halloween was. End of October, if anyone was wondering. Yeah, October 31st. <clears throat> um, yeah, it's a possibility. Maybe I'll uh, dress up as a barb. Shave my head, dress up as, as a barb. Although, I did... Uh, I did actually book a little holiday. I haven't been overseas in over six years. And then I had these travel credits for lights that i had in covid bro liberal dude thank you man dude thank you so much dog liberal chad the fucking silent assassin thank you dude who recently bought a house and should not be donating money because the man's got a mortgage now what a fucking rat bag right brian <laughs> thank you so much man I, I appreciate it so much dude thank you man yeah, I, uh, I had these travel credits because I had flights in um, COVID time that obviously got cancelled. And then I just, I forgot about them. And then I got an email from Virgin being like, your travel credits expire in like two months. So I was like, fuck it. Let's go to Bali for a week. Yeah. So <laughs> there will be a week. It's not in, it's not in October. It's like the start of December where I might disappear for a week. But I'm going to come back. I'm going to come back probably feeling worse than I did before I left. You know? I feel like that's... <clears throat> that's to be expected. But I, I might have a, a bitch in tan. 
And we got interwoven here as well. Here's a modicum of guilt. You found it. Bro, thank you so much, man. I really appreciate it, dude. Thank you, dog. You're actually going to Bali. I know. And you know the worst part? Is... It's like around the time of schoolies as well. It's like the, so bad. But I have a friend... I have a friend that was going then with his girlfriend. So I was like, oh, wait, what, uh, where are you guys going? I'll, I'll go at a similar time. Basically just, just, uh, crash their romantic getaway is the plan. And I'm doing that, just that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was looking at, uh, I was looking at, um, like hostels and like all of the reviews are like, this is right next to a nightclub. You know, it's uns 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 until 6 a.m. Invite yourself. That's exactly what I did, dog. Although there's there's only a three-day overlap, so they'll they'll get me for a couple of days. And then the rest they can like, I don't know, get engaged or something. Do you do you sell find a nigger? No 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 no. So we're on ladder, so we're I'm I'm trading. Like I found I mean we found the jar rune. I found the jar rune last night. I mean, if we get the bear rune, then that's almost self-found. We just need the, the ith rune in the base. But I found four shakos, and I traded each of those for an ist rune. Probably could have got a bit more, but if you list them for an ist rune, then they sell instantly. Um, and I found a 5-5 five, five fire facet, which I traded that and a gal rune for a vex rune. And I think that's all the trades I've done. Brandy. I think. Ooh. Wait, we'll probably actually make space for this. I think maybe... Maybe instead of... Like this one? Nine more magic find with life is just a, just a bonus. The charms are like pretty crap. You know, lots of threes. Yep. <clears throat> Still gearing up over here. Am I missing anything? I'll ID this for you guys. Pretty decent. 27 lightning res. Kind of cool grand charm. Yeah, it's pretty good for where we're at now. So I think instead of this one... <clears throat> This one's kind of good in its in and of itself. It means we run over there more quickly with that big old attack rating boost. Might keep that one, but we need to update the magic find thumb. So <coughs> oh, excuse me. So now we're 232. We're right around plateau territory now, aren't we? Which is pretty good. Matthew, welcome to the stream, man. Doing Trav Runs Without Loot Filter is like speed reading contest, right? Dude, like this is one of the areas where a loot filter would really come in handy. Yeah. Like this for sure is one of the areas. This, LK, Cows, maybe Chaos as well. Oh, Josh, thank you so much, man. Keep on keeping on, brother. Dude, thank you so much for the sweet words as well, dude. Yeah. And congratulations on your first ever dono. Oh! We got the Ithrone, Josh! We got the Ithrone! Alright, a crucial component. We didn't actually have an Ithrone. So, now we just need a bear rune and the base. Hell yeah, dog. We're 50% uh, of the way there. Nine fire rays isn't quite good enough for us. Thank you so much again, Josh. I, I really do appreciate it, man. And... Um, let's get those as well. Twelve? Just 28 shy. Put the base in the chainmail. Honestly, okay. Okay, here's... Here's a way to really metagame, Jacob. If you wanted... To really optimize engagement on YouTube. I wouldn't actually do this, but it's something people that are conniving would do. 
is if you did something like that intentionally because and then you made a video out of it and then everyone everyone would comment about you putting the enigma in a chain mail and then your engagement on that video would go through the roof how's that for calculated but then you have to wear around with enigma in a chain mail so it's kind of balances itself out You should start a YouTube channel, is basically what I'm trying to say, Jacob. You've got the mind for it. You've got the mind for it, baby. <clears throat> it's still Nigma. Yeah, you're still teleporting. Yeah. What weapons are we rocking? We got a... We got a, gr a grief. <coughs> Excuse me, dudes. We've got a grief with a rhyme on the offhand. They can't be frozen and then when i'm hawking i've just got two spirits yep two two other stuff would be better like two heart of the oaks two alibabas as uh joppy suggested but uh then we got to spend the vex runes you know what i mean Sorry, i might actually just get this table up because we just found the diggler then didn't we Dig the Diggler, just Diggler, just earns a spot on the table. Just. In a sacred armor, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now, I did that in, um, I haven't, Lord forgive me for my sins. I made an enigma in a royal shield once. It was a 45 all res, sorry, exile, exile and a royal shield. It was a 45 all res ethereal royal shield that we solo self found. But uh, I I got in big trouble for it. Big trouble for not making it in an, a, uh, an elite base. Enigma and Wormhide or Dust Shroud for the homeless look, right? <laughs> My first ever Enigma was in a Wormhide, just in case anyone was wondering about that. It was a gift. It was a gift from some, from from some random stranger on Battle.net when I was like ten years old. One of the best days of my life. Unironically. Sincerely. All right, small charm. Oh man, I don't know about you dudes, but identifying small charms is so exciting for me. Like, this is one of my favorite things to ID. Not not that one, but in general. Because it's like, there are so many good things that it could be. It could be a godlike 320-20 worth 100 bear runes. It could be 7 MF. It could be some insane life mana thing or some insane 11 res thing. It There's just so many big hits. It's, it's a really nice level pull, you know what I'm saying? And it's not unrealistic that you find something really good. It's 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 plausible. I feel like when when you ID like J mods, for example, or blue monarchs, it's kinda like the chance of you hitting the uh the J mod is so low that it's less exciting. But with the small charm, it's like, well this you know, this could be it. This could be my golden ticket. Ooh. Oh, double! Speak of the devil! Double dopamine, baby. Oh, and it fell. Nice. Just yoink that. Absolutely yoink that. Hit recovery. I would have kept that last week, but I want something else on there now. Attack rating, life steal, fire poison. Only required level 10. It's not terrible. <clears throat> You're a degenerate. Put it in full plate mail because it looks the best, dude. I love, I love your style, Zags. I love that, dude. Playing uh, fashion souls over here. I just gotta refresh you, bros. I think you might be frozen. Add that, or you're just being quiet, which is also fine. Oh, you're back. You're back. <laughs> hey, Chin. You're back. Epic fell. Thanks. 
<laughs> Failed blog. You need a video idea TC88 small charms or re-rolling. True. I mean, we do have a lot of... Is it Lance Spire of Lazarus? No, no, not Spire of Lazarus. Oh, what is the Lance again? Oh, what is that? Oh my god, it's right there. What? Oh, what is that? It's not Ariox. What? What is the Lance? A Lance? Spire of Honor! Oh, so close. Spire of Honor. Yeah, 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 yeah. Spire of Lazarus is the freaking stuff. Spire of Honor. Yeah. We'll add that to the table for sure. Yes. <laughs> cool color on that pelt. D4 good? I mean... D4 seems to be heading in a really good direction. As in, the trajectory seems to be upwards with D4. Um, I'm optimistic about Season 2, but it's got a long way to go, right? Spire of Honor. My word always thinks I'm spelling Honor wrong. Because we spell Honor differently in... in uh, Australia. <clears throat> Yeah. You're waiting for this for a long time. This is a good day. Oh, welcome to the stream, man. Welcome, welcome. May I ask which weapons you're using? Sure, dude. Yeah, we got... So, we've got a Grief and a Rhyme. And then on Switch, we've just got two Spirits. We spell it the honorable way. <laughs> Wait, do you spell... Wait, do you spell honorable with a U? Honorable. Because it'd be weird if you spelled honor without a U and you spelled honor honorable with a U. You know what I'm saying? That's kind of like admitting you're, you're wrong. Thanks for showing. Oh, good dog. Yeah, if you're, if you're curious about the rest, three minutes into the stream, we... Quickly went over it as well. You want to snoop the rest of the gear. <clears throat> I mean, really, it's all about the, <laughs> it's all about the grip. <laughs> Why not wear a Shaco? Yeah, I thought about it. I thought about it, but because we've I found four Shakos and I've traded them all for Ist runes. But then I was like. They're basically the same, almost, as Shaco and Immortal Kings. The difference is Immortal Kings looks way cooler, infinitely cooler, and I could trade the Shakos for an Isrood. I couldn't trade the Immortal King for an Isrood. Because, like, they give us the same magic find. It'll be... Or maybe this is, like, 2% more or something. And then, I mean, we'd do more damage with the Shaco because we'd have two to all skills, not just two to war cries. But the Hawking percentage would be the same. Yeah. So, I, I mean, yeah, you're right. A, a Shaco would be better, but I've just traded all the Shakos that I've found. But this, this just looks so much cooler, dog. Looks so much cooler. Probably what would be best would be a champed Shaco, and then we could have an Alibaba on sw on offhand. I think that would probably be best, right? But I don't. I just don't have a cham or an Alibaba. What the hell is Hawking? I'm new. Hey, welcome, dude. Hawking is a term for using find item. Yeah, that's just what people call it. So this skill here, when there's a corpse on the ground. We can use find item on it, which is me. It's me thrusting all the time at the end. You'll, you'll see it. I'll show you. And it gives us a 50% chance for them to drop us more loot. Um, but which will be 51% when we use our, our war cry. Should be 51. Oh, 52% now. Oh, damn. Yeah, this is all this thrusting. Whoop, whoop, whoop. That's the Hawk, baby. Welcome to the Hawk Nation. Population. 
Drunsky. Hey, Ralvern. Our 15th Ralvern. For those wondering. So apparently these runs, I think that'd be a lot quicker or a bit quicker if we're using Whirlwind instead of Berserk. I don't know how we'd kill the, there's a physical immune bro here. I don't know how we'd kill him with Whirlwind. Maybe you just skip him, but I just like using Berserk. Just a, um, just a creature of habit. And I really don't like. I really don't like using Whirlwind. Just like controlling it and stuff. It's just like, oh. Just can't be fucked, you know what I mean? Whirlwind sucks, yeah. <laughs> it's just annoying. It's just annoying to use. 15th Rail Rune. Only need one skill point in Berserk. True. Yeah, I mean, that's... I kind of just winged it with the skills. So I didn't even look what subsequent skill points were giving me like it looks like they've given me more attack rating and magic damage oh but if you're all oh, right i see i see i see i see if you were well winding then you would berserk the physical immune is what you're saying yeah 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 that makes sense that makes sense <laughs> this, I love this energy. <laughs> Technically, a word true whirlwind does suck from the bottom to the top because of the different air pressures. <laughs> yes. That's my people right there. That's my people. <clears throat> Gold Strike just laying there. Was that the bow? I probably should have picked that up and added it to the table, hey. Just got a unique scourge! Oh! Identify it off street or else it'll be 100% horizons. I'm a curse on those things. Uh, I don't think... Oh, I guess we'll get the Largy. Not even in a Colossus Blade, nah. Cause we're using this for, this is the, the account wide grief. Yeah. So I'm gonna use this for like my Smiter as well. Yeah. And it means we don't have to repair, it's just. Did I miss a video with the first 400 runners is? No, 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 I was, um, I just did them yesterday and the day before off stream. Yeah, just, uh, just running Trav and watching Dragon Ball Z on the side. So I've been pretty busy. <laughs> no, I had, a, I had a couple of other life things to do as well. Like, I had to re renew my passport. Um, which actually wasn't that difficult. Actually, it wasn't that difficult, it's just fucking expensive, man. But I guess it's the only time I'll have to do it for the next ten years. I'll stream, you monster. <laughs> you monster. And my cup, my cup was, uh, I know I don't have to explain this stuff, but my, my social tank was just, was running low. I was running on fumes and now I'm recharged, baby. I'm recharged, ready to go. Ready to make crappy small talk. What I do best. Was beefing, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Needed to cool off. <laughs> Need to cool off. Need to join a boxing dream. Just in case, start training. Um, that's funny. <laughs> Bit of an overreaction on my part. Just a smidge. Bit of a sensitive, uh, I was a sensitive schmuck that day. Alright. What do we need for the Enigma? Oh, yeah, we need a Bear Rune and a Mage Plate. Uh, I'm gonna make make it in Mage Plate. Just, it's my personal preference, especially if we're using it across 
like multiple characters unless we find a sick unless we find a sick base oh no on eight plate a sick base for um like if we found like a three socket dust shroud with a bit of ed or like a sweet ap then i'd make it in that just because we found it ourselves in the bin i know why did i throw that on the ground i'm running past rocks you know that's 35k <laughs> why it was in the inventory already. It would have fucking taken me half a second. Boop, 35k. This is why I'm always broke. Even when we're in the Hawk Nation, dog. Um, armor. Griswolds. Griswolds. Armor. What's up, mister? Welcome to the stream, dog. You got a three second main fight if you want it. Oh, thanks, dude. I might actually... I've been snooping on tradery with mage plates. And I think I could get a 15 ED one for a Vex room. So, I was just having a snoop around last night. So, I, I kind of want to trade for it, like, in theme of the video. But uh, thank you so much, dog. Amy, out of here. Uh, ooh, cryptic actually could be good. I mean, it is four sockets, but I kind of seeps with it unless it's ethereal. Wait, did I lose the thing? There was a there was a rare amulet there, right? Am I just tripping balls? Oh, there it is. Nope. Source, lightning, magic find. It's got to be two on the skills, though. To even be in contention, right? Or with, like, 10 FCR on there. Thanks, Hyperion. Thank you, man. Given much thought of what cost to play next this season? Uh, I haven't really. Originally, I wanted to get a Boas on online. But. And just like melt chaos with multi shot. You know what I mean? But I don't know. Yeah, I really don't know. Because. Forgive me for my sins. I will be playing season 2 of D4. Which is in. What's that? In six days' time. Yeah. Just to check it out, see what's up. Very, very much like the resistance changes. They actually work now. Allegedly. Smally. <laughs> Boo, you whore. <laughs> Yo, D4. <laughs> hey, gotta check it out, man. Gots to do it. I don't gots to do it. I just want to do it. He'll be back in a week's time to D2R, no worries. I mean, if Path's performance is at all an ind indication of future performance, SERP, then that's a very real possibility. That's a very real possibility. But I really want to check out all of the, um, like, Uber Dural and stuff. Sounds fun. And I'm probably going to go Barbie Boo for... God, we're playing so much Barb recently. Because I haven't really gone deep on Barb in, uh, in D4 yet. Looks like they're finally listening. Yeah, I mean the last two campfire talks have been been uh, been wins, man. They, they've been they've been big wins. Yeah, it kind of feels like they played the game. You know what I'm saying? Great. Nah, I'm being ridiculous. Now I'm reaching. Sabre. We'll snoop that tiara. Don't worry, boys. Don't worry, boys. We'll snoop it. Huanins. I think that's the fourth Huanins. Yuck. Yuck. Let's walk down here. Office Sabre, I love it. 
I love that you know exactly where that's from. <laughs> it's our brain. Uh, that is fourth one is. <clears throat> Gonna be streaming a D4 gameplay? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, for sure. Oh god, we're running out of uh, gem space. Gonna have to clear out one of these tabs. Actually, we do have some freebies to give away, so maybe we do that. Maybe we'll do 22 more runs, and then we'll give away some freebies. Like, we've got some torches to give away. I got, like, a couple of G-faces and stuff like that. Nothing, like, too... Nothing too hectic, but... Got some stuff. Fast planned in D4. I th I'm thinking Bob. I haven't gone spin to win yet, Bob. I much prefer... I much prefer the Whirlwind in D4 than D2. Petrified one. This one? Karen Shard. What's the best boss to farm a Shaker? I've never had a Shaker. Mephisto. Hell Mephisto is where I'd go if I wanted to find a Shaker. And I would say... There's probably a... I mean, depending on your magic find, I'd say there's probably a 70% chance you'd get it within 500 runs. Would be my loose estimate. Or apparently here, because I've found four in less than 500 runs. But I've just got super lucky. But yeah, I'd, I'd, I'd say odds. Odds are on Mephisto. Yeah, Andy's another good one as well. Yeah. Yeah, Andy's another really good one. Yeah, Hell Andy or Hell Meth. Did you ever play Project Diablo 2? Yeah, I played it. I played it a little bit. Um, so we made a summons on, and we did ubers, hardcore ubers on the summons on, which was really fun. And then in the latest season, and we made a rabies druid, and I died to nightmare ancients. Yeah. But we'll, we'll play more of it in the future, just when the time's right. It was just uh, it was just bad timing for me personally this season. That's a fun mod, but it, it'll never be my main way of playing Diablo, you know. Like these graphics, it just looks so freaking hot. Look at this shit, honestly, honestly. Like the, look at these trails of blood. Look at that. Oh, it's just glorious. But I do like Project Diablo too. I love slamming Worldstone shards. Oh no, we need more. We need additional pylons. Goblin juice and mug of wine tonight. <laughs> we just got uh, goblin juice tonight. Good, uh, good question, man. Good question. Great update for the new arrivals. I would gladly show you. I would gladly, gladly show you. Chiggy, check this out. This is all from Trav. Four hundred and eighty runs. The East runes, I traded the four Shakos I found for these East runes. But the rest is found natty. Except for one Vex, I found a Gull and then traded a Facet and the Gull for a Vex. But like all... All of this is, is natty. And these are from trades from our finds. Isn't that insane? Like that's fucking suspicious behavior right there. That is suspicious activity. Natty Jar is is insane, right? And we didn't even hawk it either. It was just it wasn't even hawked. Yeah. When the jar dropped, my uh my jar dropped. You know what I'm saying? On stream? No, Jesse, that's why it's so even more suspicious. It was all off stream past two days. I was like, God damn. You gotta be flipping me, man. People are not gonna believe this shit. <laughs> Straight up hacks, bro. Straight up hacks, man. Um, oh well, what you gonna do? If you play, if you play as much as I do, then you're bound to get some just absolutely filthy luck from time to time. And the past two days have been filthy.
Pre recorded, bro. <laughs> Uh, can you farm this place you're farming with the sorceress? Absolutely, absolutely. Blizzard sorceress actually does really well here. There is one cold immune, or maybe two cold immunes, but you can knock him down with Sunder. Yeah. So Blizzard runs would be, depending on your gear, would be a bit faster than the runs we're doing now. Um, but you wouldn't be able to hawk, obviously. Yeah. So Blizzard does really well here. You can do Nova Source as well, for sure. But with Nova Source... Um, Nova Source, you kind of need better gear than the, than the Blizz Source, or else, oh, I didn't, I forgot to boo, or else it's not going to be as fun, it's not going to be as smooth, but yeah, absolutely, man. That's all the motivation I need to continue with ladder, um, Trav, bro, I've been sleeping on Trav big time, dog, like, big time, man, I haven't run Trav until I did the... My 1,000 subscriber special. That's how long it's been. Since I've like done like dedicated Trav running. This was here the whole time. The whole time. <laughs> I've been farming Countess. <laughs> this has just been sitting here. Uh, Ithrood, we got another Ithrood. For our second Enigma. I just love it in his own cows, that's all I do. That's awesome, man. I mean... I feel like we forget sometimes. Well, not... I forget sometimes that it's like... We're playing a game, you know what I mean? <laughs> Even if your odds of finding something is slightly higher somewhere else, just farm where you have the most fun, you know what I mean? And less min-maxing to the max is what's fun for you. How such way did you get a run counter? I so I'm controlling it manually with key commands. It's not like automatic or anything. Um, just FYI. But I discover it through a sweet fill video. So if you go into YouTube and you doodle sweet fill magic find counter, this video will pop up and it'll have a link in the description. So I've just got it on my second monitor and then through OBS, I'm kind of like overlaying it onto this screen so you guys can see it. It doesn't look as pretty as it as it does for you guys. Oh! Unique ring! Huge! Unique ring bros! And a flawless topaz. And a sash. And a crown will leave, but it would take the jewel. Alright, broskies. Alright, broskies. I've actually had pretty good luck with these so far. I've got a... I got a 243-16 Ravenfrost. Yeah. Come on, baby. Come on, now. Ooh! Perfect Dex Ravenfrost! Perfect Dex Ravenfrost. So this is so good for a caster. Because who cares about attack rating if you're a caster, bros? Wait, this is sick. We could flip this dip for something, for sure. Like, maybe a Malvern? Or maybe even an Isruin, Bruce. We could probably get an Isruin for this. Let's see. Bro, thank you so much, man. Hope you're doing well, mate. Dude, I'm doing real well. Thank you so much, dude. I really appreciate it. I'm doing even better after this Ravenfrost. Let's, uh, let's chuck this on, uh, Traitory, Brucey. Raven. I've already got a Ravenfrost up there. <clears throat> oh, no. No, no. I accepted a trade for it. Yep. Man. I cannot wait until Tradery freaking sponsors me, Bruce. I am shilling Tradery harder than anyone else. Um, add listing. Wait, wait. First, let's look at recent trades. First, let's look at recent trades. So, recent trades. Can you guys see this? That timer. Okay, someone got a Gull Rune for almost exactly the same. 171, 20 decks. Woo! What's ours? One seven two twenty decks. Let's put it for Gull, bros. Let's put it for Gull. Gull. Attack rating one seven two. Dexterity twenty. Easy mode. 
Freaking easy mode. Hell yeah, dog. That's sick. Let's clip that and ship that. Surely the one extra attack rating is worth going. It's Billy. <laughs> Billy, Billy, Billy. That's a fucking budding, budding entrepreneur right there. I like it. I like it. Know your worth. Know your worth of one attack rating. That could be the difference between missing and hitting. That's almost so good. 30 enhanced damage. Damage to demons. Attack rating against demons. Strength, fire res. I'm going to put that in the stash and then forget about it forever. It's almost good too. 175 with hit recovery. Can you get out of here, please? Magic jewel on the ground as well. Oh man, this... These drops have been... That's a crazy run. <clears throat> what the hell's that jewel? It's the sort of jewel that I, I, it's too good to sell, but I'm just never going to use it or trade it. You know what I mean? But let's just, let's just keep it here for the rest of the season. Hell yeah, dude. 20 decks, Raven Frost. That's so good. One seven five GG. It's pretty good that Lagi. It's pretty good. Like if that if that was like a week ago, I'd definitely keep it. You would sell that jewel on Tradery? Should we list it for um? Let's list it for make me an offer because I've got no idea what that's worth, Robbie. But let's see what um. Let's let's see what people offer us for it. That sort of thing I feel like is really hard to to offload. Let's chuck it up there. Alrighty. For a lamb. Oh, I mean if it's just gonna go for a lamb, then I won't bother. But I'm just curious what, what type of offers we get. So let's let's put it up there. Um, what did I chuck it here? I think it was required level 30. Let's go Jewel. Um, add a listing. It's a rare one. Level 57. Enhanced damage with 30. Oops, not 39. Then it had damage to demons, which was also 30. Then attack rating against demons, which was 43. Six strength. And then 14 fire res. Nope, not fire damage. Fire res. Make me an offer I can't refuse. Is that it? Beautiful. We'll see. I don't know if anyone's going to bite with that. Wait. Oh, level 37? Oh, man. I thought it was 57. Oh, I'm just an idiot. Again, classic. God, gotta do it all again. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Thanks, dudes. I don't know if you can put the color in here. You can put the color in for facets. But I don't know if you can put it in for regular jewels. So it's 37. And the enhanced damage was 13, 30, 32. Damage to demons was 30. And then attack rating against demons was 43, yeah. And then strength was 6. And then fire resist was 14. Make me an offer I can't refuse. 37, 30, 30, 43, 6, 14. Beautiful. Thanks, dude. It's good looking out, man. 
Good looking out. All right, let's get get rolling. Um, what's up, uh, Shaka? Hey, dudes, is a lightsaber a good weapon for a barb? It's that was my favorite childhood weapon. FYI, a bit of schmuck lore. It's a really good intermediate weapon. It's a really good intermediate weapon uh, until you get something better, basically. So it's good for the meantime before you get some sort of rune word online. And to be to be perfectly frank with you, I know there are some ex exceptions, but the vast majority of the time. You're gunning for this little sap sucker. Grief. So a low rune and a mal rune. That's the end goal. But lightsaber is really good for the meantime, for sure. Plus, it looks just so incredibly badass. Objectively. Straight up, I wouldn't take anything less than a bear plus extra for that jewel. No lights are big fine. Really? No shit. Man, I'm so out of my depth with jewels, man. I really have no idea. Five step jewels are like finding the GG Grail, and this is literally that's hard to find. Really, man. Holy shit. That's crazy. I had no idea. I mean, is it Is it five things you want though? Because it's like, surely the damage, surely the attack rating and damage to demons is kind of like, oh. Don't, it's like, it's not, it's not high priority, you know what I mean? Like, the enhanced damage for sure. Strength is nice, the fire resist is nice. IS would have been GG. Yeah, IS would have been god tier. <laughs> yeah, then would be, then would be rich. Then the video would be over. Then we'd have to change the video title. Running Enigma until... Running Travacil until I make five Enigmas. I have to pivot. <laughs> Just change the goalposts. Um, let's get this as well. Am I missing anything? No. No IS on Red Jewels. Yeah, I figured right. <clears throat> Show the jewel, please. This is the Red Jewelie. Um, where is it? Enhanced damage, damage against demons, attack rating against demons, strength and fire res. To me, my natural instincts, again, I've got no idea what I'm talking about, is this is a great drill, but uh, I just don't, I don't know if you'd ever be able to offload it, you know what I mean? Because, like, if you're in the market for jewels, surely, surely you don't. This is like a middleman, almost, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you're going to drop a rune on a jewel, get a god tier one. Who uses that, though? Yeah, like, what? in what situa situation would you use that over, over like, a 40-15? Yeah, yeah, it's a good question. Where's the market? Show us off your weapon. It'd be my pleasure. It would be my pleasure. We have an abysmally rolled grief. Oh. 35, uh, 347, wasn't it? The damage is there somewhere. It's a bad roll on the damage. Vinny, bro, thank you so much, man. Oh, just as you mentioned it, you had a five off perfect lightsaber drop. Hell yeah, man. That little baby schmuck would be losing his mind right now. Hell yeah, dog. I love me some lightsabers. Thanks so much, dude. I'm kind of with you, Fabian. I'm kind of with you, but that's just my intuition.
Whoops. What's up, Juicy, you devious dog? <laughs> That's me, baby. Uh, how's it going? What are we doing? Uh, going well. And we're just hawking up a storm in Trav, man. We're hawking up a storm in Trav. I did 450 runs, which honestly isn't isn't that much. You put things into perspective over the past two days, and it has been the most lucrative 10 hours of Diablo that I've ever had in my life. So, feeling good. Haven't had any huge finds yet today. Although, except we found a perfect Dex Ravenfrost today already, and we've only been gone for 37 runs. And a perfect Dex Ravenfrost recently sold for a Galbrood on Tradery. So, it's going to be a good day, boys. It's going to be a good day. Found a Jarvan last night. Natty Jarvan. Can you believe it? Can you believe I've never even used the Jacuzzi? Oh. <laughs> Imagine if that was enhanced damage. <laughs> um, That's kind. Found a jar, right? Yeah. <laughs> My jar dropped, baby. <laughs> so good. Didn't even hawk it, Juicy. Didn't even hawk it, dude. <laughs> um, let's put... Okay, we're getting really close to having to make a freebie game. Give away some of this stuff. Just got two griffins so far this season. What the flippery dippery? Two of them? Any of them good good roll? Please tell me everything. I'm so interested in um in griffins rolls. Because I've only ever found two griffins in my life. One of them was one off anti-perfect. And the other one with it was ethereal. So <laughs> the next one better be a 2015. Or or I'm quitting. I'm quitting Dab Diablo forever. Um, okay, dokey. Anything good here? I don't think so. There's lots of 35Ks there. In before anti-perfect ethereal griffins. Well, that's a thing. Because when you find an ethereal griffins, you want it to be a bad roll. You know? You don't want that to be a 2015. Can Trav drop a Griffins? I think so, right? Right? I think I can, right? Can Trav drop a Griffins? Griffins is item level 83, yeah? You guys will have to fact check me on it. Has anyone found a Griffins in Trav before? Can't actually remember what item level, like what monster level these bros are. Like, are these guys just level 82? Or are they higher? Because they're special. But they are super, super unique. I can't remember how super, super unique monsters work with, like, the, the area level. That makes sense. Counter members are idle item level 85. Oh, yeah. Sick. So they can. At least I'm pretty sure they can. I mean, if they can drop a jar, surely. Um, Maiden Javeloon. Should really be all over this shit, shouldn't I, boys? You know, one would think that I would have this unlock, but alas, <laughs> alas. <laughs> but that's why I have you guys. <laughs> you can answer fundamental, basic questions about how this game works. Grabs 82, but cancels 85. Yes, sick. Yeah, so they should be able to. They just can't drop the uh, TC 87s. <clears throat> They can, but they won't. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I mean, 
<laughs> Just because it's true, you don't have to say it. <laughs> Come on, prove him wrong. Prove him wrong, random council member. I was really hoping one would be just be on the ground right there. What's up, Bernadette? Welcome to the stream, dog. Ghoul on champs can. What's up, champ? Oh, this is where we need a freaking zoom in, bros. No, 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 no. Oh, there's... I guess we'll snoop this. Get that... Yoink that six boo. How far are you from Enigma? We are very close. We are very close. I found very close, but could also be very far. You know what I'm saying? So I found a jar rune last night. And these are the other runes that we have. So we could almost trade up to a bear rune. Like if we found another low, then that would be a bear. And then we just need to trade for the base. So we just need to find another low rune. Can I have all the trash? <laughs> trash being anything below Vex. Now we we're actually need to clear clear out the stash very soon. So we'll make a um we'll make a we'll make a free game in, in a couple of minutes. We've got a couple of crappy torches, we got um we got like G face, we got uh, like gold wraps and another little bits and bobs. We've got a Reaper's Toll there. No low straight up bear from cancel. That would be insane. Because then we'd have all of the leftover high runes. Then we might have to do a ladder high rune giveaway. Lawless. Bone Ash runs. Bruce. Bruce has got a uh, personal vendetta against Bone Ash. <laughs> Don't worry, Brucey. I got your back, man. I'll murder him 10,000 times to uh, to make up for whatever transgression he, uh, he wielded upon you. I would probably go for a bear this early. It's really close. It's really close, giant bear runes. Um... It's like, I think at the moment, it's kind of like jar and like an extra little treat. We trade for a bear rune. Like, uh, jar... Jar Vex, I think. At least that's how it was looking like it was heading last night. There's still people listing bear runes for two jar runes. I was just like, come on, no, bro. No one's gonna fucking do that. I take it so personal when people propose these outrageous trades on trade runes. Just insult me for some reason. Uh, I don't know how you do this so efficiently. It's it's honestly just having the grief, man. It's just... It's this. That's how. That's all it is. <laughs> it's grief is just so busted. Like, before that, it was, it was clunky. I tried it before the grief, and I was like, nah. It's just not going to be fun for me. It works. It's just not as fun. Um... Let's get this ring as well. Ah, oh, keep the 18 lifer. I might have died like eight times last stream, so may as well keep that. What servers are you on? I'm on the Americas, yep. Just saw a perfect griffin for 30 bear runes. Woo! That's a lot of bears, man. Where does one keep 30 brown bears? You know? Really didn't think that one through. Oath is good on a budget too. Yeah, people were telling me about Oath. Yeah, that's just got a Malrune in there, right? You make a bear mule. So like a druid. You legit have a bear mule on <laughs> soft gone down ladder. <laughs> Love it, dude. Just hold them. <laughs> Just hold them. Um, no, 
All right, let's get this jewel, this ring. Oh, what I accidentally pick up. Have we got any dings on tradery? No dice. No dice. I feel like trade has been. I know it's kind of later in the season than historically I've been wheeling and dealing on tradery, but I feel like it's much more quiet this season. There's much less action there. But I guess that kind of makes sense. No, no changes in all. Is there any way to end a channel membership? The bear John jokes are too much. <laughs> Game over. <laughs> that were pretty cringe, weren't they? <laughs> Absolutely, man. Of course, you're not locked into a lifelong contract. <laughs> you're a member forever. Even when I pivot into becoming a uh, financial advice guru YouTuber, you're still locked in. <laughs> Just cancel that shit, baby. When the kit, when the cringe overfloweth, the memberships decline. As the prophecy has foretold. Okay, find us a bed. I gotta go to bed soon. Hey, what's up, Freddy? Fuck this tree, man. I, I don't know. Either we find it soon, or we don't find it for ages, Freddy. Because then, uh, then we'll still be here tomorrow morning. Yeah. No middle ground. Basically, we're not allowed to complete the mission while Freddy's asleep. So... If we find one in like five hours time, just we'll chuck it in the cube. No one say anything. It'll be our little secret. Just our little secret between me and 346 other people. Yeah, that's all. What's up, Philip? Welcome to the stream, dog. Uh, have you seen Mr. Llama's new video about the Player 7 loot bag? I did. I did. Very interesting stuff. Also, what's the guy's name? Pavki? What a freaking legend, man. What a goat. Putting me to shame. Putting me to absolute shame. He's just like, oh yeah, I got this hypothesis. We could very clearly tell, you know, that some shenangs are going on if we did 100 runs. But let's just be sure about it and run 10,000 freaking runs <laughs> just to flex. <laughs> Not even going to farm it for YouTube views, Pavki. <laughs> oh, what a legend, man. Absolute legend. Yeah, that's sick. That's really sick. I mean, this only really seems to be of consequence for single player. I mean, I guess in theory you could do it on ladder, but man, that would just be so annoying to do it. With like so much organization. But uh, yeah, very interesting stuff. And I just love how we're still discovering things about this game 20 years later. Could have even done 1k. I know, right, Kenny? 1k would have been so, so fine. <laughs> he even rips out the 10k trap runs. God damn. Yeah. Um, and his notes were impeccable, right? I just, I just, ah, uh, just the passion, man. The freaking passion for this game is so, it's so beautiful, isn't it? You have to tell Enigma you're mad, my dude. I, I mean... It's a little bit of a misleading title. I've been running Trav for yesterday and the day before as well. I already did 450 runs. But uh, we're going to go until we get Enigma today. Yeah. Probably should have put in like day three or something. But then also... I mean, we are running Trav until Enigma. So we're doing exactly what the title says. But... I didn't realize it was so misleading until I saw you guys commenting. <clears throat> um... Oh, thanks for tuning in, Coffee. Yeah. Sleep well, my dog. Little schmuck smirk in his pain. <laughs> I mean, you gotta play the game a little bit. <laughs> you know, sometimes you just gotta play the game. And I think the thing is, like, if that it's it's there's a precedent. That's why. That's why it's misleading. It's misleading because it's a priest there's a precedent for for us doing those stupid streams, like one to Ubers and that sort of thing. That's why, that's the only reason why it's misleading, if that makes sense, you know? Because of our historic degeneracy.
you were le legit blown, blown away by his findings. Yeah, he's absolute legend, man. And it was so funny when um, I don't watch Lama's streams because I'm not really on Twitch, but I watch his YouTube, and like one of Lama's moderators was helping him with it, and he's meant to be working on Lama RPG, <laughs> and Lama's like, "What the fuck is this?" <laughs> you know. <laughs> You're meant to be working on on our game. What have you been up to? You know what I mean? Like I just found that so cute, so funny. Yeah. <laughs> oh no, Freddy, I haven't forgotten, dog. I haven't forgotten. I haven't forgotten. I should have printed it off. I'll I'll do it. I'll do it. Keep don't, you don't need to keep reminding me because I won't forget. But I literally, I, I literally still think about it. It's going to happen. It's going to happen. I've got the email there. We've got the bedside table perfectly. Like, that's where it belongs. Right there in front of that lamp. That's where the framed band email belongs. Warren, you bad boy. Yeah, that was him, Warren. <laughs> That's him. I watch all parts one and two of one to arm stream quality content. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> I love that. It's not one to Ubers, it's one to arm. Yeah. The real end boss. A mid rune. A mid rune that you want. Uh, I didn't, Billy. No, I didn't. And you're, you're bang on. I'm, I'm just an AFL simp. Yep. How did, um, how did the Wallabies go? How did we go? I should know this stuff, but I get all of my information from YouTube. So basically, I, I get no information. One day, hell, <laughs> yeah. Those were dark days. Those were freaking dark days, man. Running normal counters for a freaking L rune. That was brutal. I was not a happy schmuck then. Life minor fire res, hit recovery. Kinda dece. Still going in the bin. But kinda decent. Hey, thanks for tuning in, Anthony. How do you get through hell for a blizzard sorceress? Oh, great question. Um, what you do is if there's a cold immune, you just teleport past them. Yep, that's all it is. It's kind of like a mechanic that's pretty unique to Diablo 2. But if there's someone immune to your element, just, just don't kill them. And if it's someone you have to kill... For example, in the Chaos Sanctuary, there might one of the seals might be cold immune. Then your mercenary really helps. Usually, most commonly, people go with Act 2 mercenaries. And the skill static really helps as well. So you can static them down really low and let your mercenary finish them off. Yep. That's 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 the bulk of it and then once you beat hell you you might be able to yoink yourself a cold sunder charm and then you're then you're laughing um a lot a lot of people as well like well i wouldn't say a lot of people actually i think some people as well like to put points into another damage type like fireball or something but personally i don't do that i'm just all in on one element our 16th Ralvrune, and we've got Alders there as well. I think that's the third Alders. 16th Ralvrune. Fourth Alders. Yeah. yeah. I hope that helps, Felix. Yeah. Best of luck, man. Another thing you can do... Although, I don't, I don't want to overcomplicate it too much. But... 
if you static an enemy down, so they've got like 10% of their health left or whatever, and your mercenary is finishing them off, you can just spam telekinesis on them as well. You should have one point into telekinesis because it's the precursor to teleport. So if you just spam telekinesis on them, it will do next to no damage, but sometimes it can almost stun lock them just to help your mercenary kill them while they while he stays alive. Yeah. So you just like have telekinesis and then just like hold it down and just like continuously like knock the enemy into a wall, letting your um, merc uh, hit them freely. This helps out, helps out a little bit. Espadon. Another Griswold's armor. This is the slowy. Oh no, this. This one. Granite Knight Vormir. God, I am not familiar with that one at all. That is lowest life only to 50% in health. Really? Doesn't it depend on the enemy? <clears throat> is that for every enemy? Like for bosses, it'd be something like 50%, right? But is it is it the same for um, just like a normal enemy and stuff? Hey, we keep that. Three magic find. And you guys teach me so much. Cranite and Vormir. We'll add this to the table. Sell the Grizz. <laughs> uh, too many clicks. <laughs> too many clicks. Cranite. Vormir. And the second Griswold's armor. And we also got to add... Three here. 235. 50% for all monsters in hell. Oh, there you go. True. <laughs> Thanks, dude. You guys teach me so much. Well, there you go. <laughs> the, um... Yeah, the strat's still the same, but that's still re really useful for me to know, personally. Oh, now we've got... Now we've got to switch these around to make it look pretty. Better. That's just for you, Pally. I'm going to drop that one. 313. 13% fireball or miss. It's not a bad one. It's not terrible. I found a... Um, I found a teleport one. During these runs. Appreciate it. <laughs> I wasn't sure if you were still here, but I'm glad you are. <laughs> Give me a you. All right, we're 500 runs deep. Let's um, let's give away some some free. I.e., clear up some stash space. Jeez. Got the FCR on there. Okay, okay. So, let's see what we've got here. That almost was so heartbreaking. The thirteen percent hurts. The the thirteen percent hurts. Bang bang. Bang. So we've got a Amazon torch, a barbarian torch, and a paladin torch. So if you come into the game with one of these classes, the first of these classes to come into the game will receive thy torch. Hopefully you don't ever already have a torch. Yeah. So we're in the America server. The password is 7745. Schmuck1, password 7745. We've got an Amazon, a Barbarian, and a Paladin. Ooh, I think this guy was first, right? Prison? 
Bally. Sorry, so many Bally's in here. I think it was prison, yeah? Yeah, I think it was prison. Speed demon. Here you go, dog. Oh, what? Oh, true. We can swap a Rooney. Now we got a Druid one to give away as well. So Druid, Barbarian, and Amazon. Schmuck one. Password. 7745. Good luck to anyone who gets a torch. Hope you need it. Yeah. Oh, we got a barb in here. I love giving away barb torches. And here's a crappy barb torch. Barbosa. Nice. <laughs> Captain Barbosa. That's such a good name, dude. I'm jealous. All right. No Zons in here. Oh, my pleasure, man. And then what am I going to do? Is I'm just gonna make a new game and then I'm just gonna be chucking heaps of free on the ground It's not gonna be like super amazing stuff but like G face rip is tall that sort of stuff and I'll just touch chuck those torches on the ground as well the leftover torches so it's schmuck 2 no password I'm just gonna scatter it around act 1 all right so we've got the Zon Torch, got a couple of G faces, we've got a Kira's, we've got a Reaper's Toll, got some crappy Chanties, Storm Shield. Whoop! 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 Zon Torch over there, Reaper's Toll. What else we got? We got Sandstorm Trex, Marrow Walk, we got 48 Alders. Um, we've got a crappy Geed. We've got a White Monarch if someone still needs one of those. We've got a couple of Gold Wraps. And bam, 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 bam. we got Towels. So it's not like super amazing stuff, but just in case anyone needs... Anyone needs this stuff still. What else do we have here, Broskies? I guess there's a Five Socket Thresher if anyone needs that. Frosties, Immortal Kings. 16 nit man, I feel bad giving some of this stuff away. It's like not good. Um, but one man's trash is another man's treasure, you know what I'm saying? Got some pretty sweet jab gloves there. Look at the resist on those. 1130 with magic find. <clears throat> bang, 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 bang. And then here's a dodo torch. Okie dokie. Hopefully some of that stuff went to an okay home. Oh, there's a snow clash there as well. Beautiful. I'm not freaking giving you my Minalds though. Come on. You're dreaming. You're dreaming if you think I'm going to give you my Minalds. Sorry, that was Schmuck 2 was the game name. There's no password. Wasn't the fattest of loot, but hopefully something was useful. <laughs> the assassin's taken everything, but a legend. <laughs> exploit early, exploit often. <laughs> um, all right. Hey, what's what's up, Clara? Welcome to the stream. Let's uh let's get more loot for people, hey. Let's get 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 in better stuff. I mean if we find if we find a bear rune, that means we can give away like all of these, but like better. We can do like countess runs and stuff. Countess races. Beep 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 beep. beep, beep. Gotta get this all looking pretty for Pally. Um specifically for Pally. Beautiful. Beautiful. And then snoop the traitory, see if we got any dings. No dings. Alas, no dings. Alright, let's keep rolling, bros. That assassin fast as yet did he use burst of speed. 
<laughs> yeah. That was probably a better way that I could do that, but it wasn't like super amazing loot, was it? So. What are you trading or trading? We've got the main thing we have up there now is we've got a, a Raven Frost with 20 decks. So I'm trying to offload that for a Galrude. It's got low attack rating, but like if you're a caster, the attack rating doesn't matter, right? And we got Ava Waver in the house. What's up, dog? Welcome to stream, man. We've got four Isrins. Why not make a Crystal Sword with them? Good, good, um, good question. Another thing is like we could make Heart of the Oaks, the Vex runes, right? For the Switch. But I kind of want to keep them because the premise of the video is to run Trav until we can make an Enigma. And I kind of want to save them to trade rather than use them to upgrade our gear. But I did consider it, you know, like, oh man, it could be an investment. It could mean we got the Enigma faster if we just made our gear better. But I opted against it. You were the 30 second like on the video, just so we're glad you beat everyone after that. <laughs> Thanks for dropping a like, man. Thanks everyone for dropping a like. I hate hell mobs. It's it can be brutal, right, Felix? It can be brutal. Which which uh which act are you up to now? Smoked a science against the gamble. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> what happened? I'll tell you what happened, Ava Waver. Is I didn't know how lucky we'd get. You know what I mean? If I'd known, if I'd known that I'd just find a freaking jar rune, then I probably would have used like the Vexes to make Heart of the Oaks, right? But I was like, man, we could be running Trav for like thousands of runs. So I kind of want to keep everything I can get to trade. But uh, here we are. <laughs> Here we are, remarkably close considering, after only 500 runs. But I simply could not have known that we'd have such filthy, filthy, filthy luck. How was I to know? How was I to know? Check the jewels. Ah, uh, did I miss a jewel? Sorry. Was there a couple of jewels? Sorry. I have been IDing them. I have been IDing them. But, uh, there's just so much to read. You're up to Act 3. Oh, yeah. Act 3 is brutal. Alright, let's make... We can just... You know, just leave it messy. That 40-15 would have been 20 bed. No, don't say that. <laughs> don't say that. That was clearly a 6 to defense duel. Oh, wow. What do you reckon a pally combat skill with 36 life is worth on a hardcore ladder? I've got no idea, but a lot. Yeah, but I've got I've got no idea, man. Sweet, fine, dog. What I would do is I would... I would go on Tradery and... I would look up, like, a pally combat with, like, 30 to 40 life as the parameters. And then I would go on recent trades. In fact, just out of curiosity, let's do that now after this run, because I'm kind of curious. So if we go Grand Charm, these motherfuckers better sponsor me one day, I swear to God. And then if we go... Let's just mode, hardcore. And then, what is it? Peacomb. And if you go to life. 30 to 40. Maybe I should stop calling them motherfuckers, hey? That would probably help. That's probably why. <laughs> and recent trades. <clears throat> Yeah, 
This guy sold a 38 for a bear rune. Oh, what the hell? September? So long. Oh, so oh, yeah. I guess there's just not that many people. Okay, so this is unreliable because this is so long ago, right? Um, because our parameters are pretty specific and there's just way less hardcore players. So probably in this instance, usually recent trades is way more reliable to get you a better indication of what stuff is worth. But in this instance, because there aren't good recent trades, I would probably go off selling. That's insane. No shot. These are insane, man. I mean, this is listed... This is listed five hours ago, and he hasn't been able to offload it yet for a low rune. So I'd, pro I'd probably say in the ballpark of a low rune. This, these ones for seven jar runes is just nonsensical. Not a chance in hell. This guy can't offload one for a low, then good luck getting fucking seven jar runes. You know what I mean? But yeah, I'd list it for a low. We'll check JSP. Yeah, I mean, JSP... I kind of don't... I, I kind of personally, I don't... I got no... Like, could not care less if other people use JSP. But I, I don't go near it. Um, one, because it's kind of linked to RMT. And I've... You know, if I got banned a, another time, it'd just be like <laughs> the worst look in the world. But also the interface is just scary. Yeah, so I've never used JSP. I have used, I have read some of their forums though before. Now they've got like threads. Yeah. But personally, if I was me in that situation, I would list it for a low. Oh, Teleroth. <laughs> With the 10 gifted. Thank you so much. God damn, Tolareth. It's like so generous. Thank you so much. And some legends on the receiving end as well, Tolareth. Robbie got one. Hell yeah, dude. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Tolareth, absolute goat of the channel. Absolute mountain goat. How close to Enigma are we? We're pretty close, man. We're pretty close. We've got a Jar rune, a Low rune, three Vex runes, four Ist runes, a Mal rune, and a Pul rune. Yeah. So we're, we're kind of close. We're probably a, a Low rune away from being able to trade for a Bear rune. And then we'd need... We'd need the base as well. Thank you so much again, Tlaren. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers for calling you a mountain goat. <laughs> Thank you so much. We got R5 in the house. The, the SOJ king himself, R5. Hoarding them. In 500. It's been insane, Simon. It's been insane. Yeah. The, the Jairun, the Lowrun, and two of the Vectruns were natural finds. The four Ist runes I got from trading four Shakos. I found four Shakos. And the Vex, the third Vex rune I got from finding a Gull and then trading that with a 5 5 5 facet for a base. It's, it's been nuts, bro. Anything good recently? The best find we found today was. The Raven Frost, I'd say. 173 or 72 attack rating, but 20 on the decks. I'd, I'd probably say that's the best find today. We did also find an interesting rare jewel. But the, um, the Raven Frost is my personal fave today. So he says was all offline. <laughs> Bro. The footage is there. You'll see the footage. <laughs> but it is, you're right, it is suspicious. It's unbelievably suspicious how good those drops were. Like, unbelievably suspicious. Even I was suspicious of myself. You know what I mean? I was about to ban myself. Um, base, I want to go for Mage Plate. 
Uh, but my personal fave is Mage Boy. What's the gear? We actually have... We went over the gear three minutes into the stream. Yeah. Sorry, I tried to put a timestamp in, but I don't, I don't think it... I don't think it worked. But we're... Ro the most important things... And we have a Grief. Rhyme for the Can't Be Frozen. And then I'm just hawking with Spirits. Anything good since the start of stream? We got a 20 dex Raven Frost. That's that's my favorite drop so far. But the best find was probably the friendships we made along the way, I'd say. <laughs> Lame. Oh, guess what? One of, one of my other favorite finds, again, this was off stream yesterday, Metal Grid. And I love that I'm actually using it, you know? I don't think I've ever actually used a metal grid before. It's like really cool to find, but nice magic find there. Look at that attack rating, raw attack rating. That 400 attack rating is actually 4,000, which increases our chance to hit by 3%. 3%. He found his dignity as well. <laughs> what do you mean? I never lost that. I lost that in high school. Been been trying to like collect it back together ever since for the past ten years. And it, <laughs> what? <laughs> hell. Just found a metal gear in trap five minutes ago. Hell yeah, Rob. Hell yeah. I've only ever found um that's my third metal grid I've ever found. I found one in my first ever video from Mephisto and I found one from Duriel of all places when I ran Duriel a thousand times, which actually got surprisingly good drops from running Duriel, believe it or not. And then one from here. Oh, Liam, thanks so much for saying that, dude. Finally able to catch you live. Hey, welcome to the stream, dog. Welcome, welcome. Oh, we got the freaking Faco. So glad you um you enjoy the videos, dude. You're in one right now. You're in a video right now. You're famous, dog. Call your mum. Get her on the phone. I made it. <laughs> I'm in a remarkably niche YouTube video. <laughs> 28,000 subs, bro. Get the camera. <laughs> Sorry. Sonny, yeah, I want the fuck's a regular schmuck. <laughs> uh, which runes you got? Bro, I got runes for days, man. I got runes for days. Too many to list, honestly. Now, we have... We have Jar Lo, Vex, 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 Ist, 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 Mal Pal. But who's counting? You know? Who's counting? Hawk Nation, baby. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, Smalley, nice. One of my favorite things to ID. One defense. God damn it. One defense, small charm. Oh, my family will finally be proud of me. <laughs> Bro, you're a doctor. That wasn't enough. <laughs> that wasn't enough. Best drop today. Best drop today has been this guy, I reckon. Just because it's 20 on the decks. Yeah, the attack rating's low, but like casters use this, you know what I mean? Like source sources use that. Ew. <laughs> Ew. We've only done Oh, we've done 59 runs so far, so. Second best job has been the Ith rune. <laughs> hey, we needed the Ith. We needed the Ith. Need a P gem mule. Yeah, I might have to make one. I mean, I kind of wanted to... 
I mean, I guess I can still keep them all together. But uh, just because instead of adding them to the table now, I'm just going to add them to the table afterwards. Like how many P gems. How many P gems we found. And maybe at the end of the video, I can... Oh, that's actually not a bad idea. At the end of the video, I can roll Grand Chance with all the P gems. And hopefully we find something to include. Um, let's get this. They gave you a took you long enough for making it to med school back in the day, really? <laughs> Youch. I mean, took you long enough is better than... I didn't think you could do it. <laughs> I didn't think you had it in you. <laughs> is this a mistake? <laughs> <laughs> um, no, nah, congrats, dude. That's sick. You actually are a doctor. That's awesome. My parents just called you a rat bag. <laughs> no. I've been, uh, I've been flinging out the rat bags this stream. I've been wheeling and dealing in rat baggery. Oh, Trav, Terrorize Trav's up next? Hell yeah, dude. I haven't actually hit a Terrorize Trav, um, Terrorize Trav yet. I've been running Trav for a total of 11 hours and 15 minutes. And it hasn't been Terrorized yet, so that'll be sweet. Then we could get, uh, we could get my D-Web. My D-Web that I so desperately desire. Nope. Nope. Terrorize Trav would be fun, Hawken. Oh, man. I'm just enjoying Hawken so much. There's nothing like... I was gonna say something, and I caught it. I caught it before it left. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry to do that to you. I'm sorry to do that to you. I would have said it if, uh, if I was among close friends, but I just don't want that clipped. So, say it. I can't say it. I can't say it. Oh, I didn't, uh, I didn't boo. We'll never know. I, I, I can't say it. It's, to me, it's, a li it's, it's mildly funny, but it's not funny enough to, to warrant uttering those words, you know, just in the potential risk of it being taken out of context. <clears throat> we can assume the worst. I mean, basically, yeah. Now we're not close to friends, by all. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, Dead World? Welcome to the stream, man. Welcome, welcome. No, nothing on the internet is ever taken out of context yet. <laughs> yeah, we're safe. Oh, we got a ding, boys. Did you hear the ding? Ding, ding. I hope this is a Manald. Oh. Oh, what? Oh, someone made an offer, then cancelled an offer for the Raven Forest. Oh. Oh, whoops. Hey, Brian. Thank you, dog. Thanks so much, man. Brian with the gifted membership. Freaking traitory did did us dirty, Brian. Someone made an offer for the Raven for us six minutes ago and then just cancelled it just then. Oh well. We missed the boat. I thought it was my traitory. Sorry. That's gonna keep happening. <laughs> That's gonna keep happening. Because you get such dopamine when you hear that ding, don't you? Thanks so much again, Brian. Hey, thanks for tuning in, Lego. Yeah, sleep well, dog. Oh, Adam, he's from Countess. Nice. What's that? One and two fifty, roughly. Congrats, man. Golden Galleron. 
Skullrune within the next 10 runs. Shall we say flex? Or just a Gulrune sometime this stream. Let's get... Oh, that's why we can't pick anything up. Freaking armor just sitting there. Oh, <laughs> gotta sleep soon. Hope to see you teleporting later. Hey, you and me both, dog. You and me both. Sleep well, man. Thinking PGMs are for the Grand Charm rerolls for skillers, maybe? Yeah, that's that's what I'm going to use most of them for. Definitely not the Amethyst. I'll save the Amethyst for crafting. Maybe save the Rubies for crafting as well. But the rest we'll use for, for skiller rerolls. You have so much gold, you have Geeds. We have a, a crappy Geeds. Oh, well, he's crappy on the Magic Find. I've been keeping track of how much gold I've been gambling as well. And forgive me. Forgive me for my sins again. I don't have an edge bow. I'm so sorry. I don't have an edge bow. <laughs> so we're going to be gambling without an edge bow. Just forewarning you. I just cannot be bothered going to make one. You know, I just can't be fucked right now. Perfectly honest. <laughs> I'm full mask off here. Hey, covered. Nice. Even though it's like, what is it, like 15%? It's like significant. Um, but I'm just lazy. Classic lazy streamer. <clears throat> Anything good so far today? We, the best thing today has been a 20 dexterity Raven Frost. Streaming get good. <laughs> get good. Uh, we're very close to Gamba time as well. We'll do it when that, we get another 100k there. Oh, congrats! First ever low yesterday. In, in, um, Chaos Sanctuary. Insane feeling. Dude. I, I found a low rune two days ago here. And it's... It, low runes? I feel like I've found... Less low runes than jar runes, honestly. Like, less low runes than Jar and Bear runes. Like, they're so rare for me. And it's such a useful rune, man. Like, so freaking useful. Grief. 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 And, like, fortitude and stuff. Like, oh, man. Or battle boots. Some war traps would be amazing. Found a bear like day five in chaos. Amazing dog. What'd you use it for, Chong? Um let's actually go let's go jamble now, bros. Let's get jambling. But I'm gonna leave these. So there's more space. Let's go jamble with Jeed. Gamba, Gamba, Gamba. And forgive me as well. I don't re-roll so we get the coronet every time. Again, just cannot be fucked, you know? Two source, two druid. FCR. I do want M MF is pretty interesting. Let, let me know if you guys are getting any good juju about gambling amulets or rings as well, bros. Like, if you guys are getting good juju, then I will listen to the juge. But uh, <clears throat> if not, if you're not, if you're not getting any, oh, we got a diadem! Oh, <laughs> nah! Every time, <laughs> every time. <laughs> Oh, every time the hope is there. 120 Necro. 
Only bad juju. Okay, we'll stick with we'll stick with these then. You got Enigma already? No, 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 no. We haven't got it yet, but uh, we're gonna keep streaming today until we get it. We're close though. This is our the runes we've got. It's pretty close. Like in the grand scheme of things, but like could take 500 more runs, you know what I'm saying? Oh. Okay, I'm actually gonna keep this for the smiter. It's not good, but I just hate switching to use teleport. So I was actually looking for one with teleport charges um, for running Ubers. Although we're going to get the Enigma. So that's obsolete. Sell. Really traps 21 life. I don't actually know. Is that good? Or do you want a high roll on the life? Are you planning on cubing? Nah, I'll, I'll trade. Yeah, I'm not sure. But if I... Hurts so much to cube up <laughs> low runes. <laughs> that, that hurts the soul. I don't know if I could do that again. Yep. Is it the moment a bear rune is going for 120 with life miner and old res? Why couldn't that be a different 20? If that was a 20... If that was a 20 FCR, not 20 run walk, we could actually be in business. Um, yeah, at the moment on tradery, a bear rune is going for like two lows, two vexes. So, we're basically just another low rune away from a bear rune. Is this good? Or do we sell? <clears throat> I feel like it's not high enough on the life. But I just literally don't have any idea how PvP works. It's bad? Okay, thanks. Yeah. Confirmation. It's meh? Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. These questions are above my pay grade. To Baba. That one had 99 life on there. You guys are getting paid, I know. <laughs> Don't tell Pally. I'm paying the other moderators. Um yes. getting paid in tradery, yeah, with sick deals. With life-changing formative curated content. That's what this is. Um, I play a pivotal role in society. Without streamers, the ecosystem would crumble. Getting banned in friendship, yeah. That's the definition of friendship right there. Tit for tat. I think we got one more little baby gamber in us. I just want to use up all the gold so the table is somewhat accurate. All right, nothing. That is five milli worth of gold we've gambered for sweet, sweet nothing. All right, let's get uh, let's get Hawken, baby. Let we organize this nicely. Sweet Caroline. Ba, ba, ba. <clears throat> Just tuned in if you found something already. Nothing rock in my world today, except for a 20 dex Raven Frost. It's the best thing we've found today. That, and of course, as 
formerly mentioned friendship, which is priceless. Edge burn, I know. I know, but I just can't be fucked. Like, I, I just can't be fucked making one right now, you know what I mean? I simply cannot be bothered. Do you? And Tiara. Another ED jewel. That one's got max damage as well. Whoops. Give me that. What's up, Isham? Welcome to the stream. Any highlights of the day so far? Best thing so far is for Shiz, a 20 dex Ravenfrost. Pretty decent, this large charm. 5 strength, 15 fire res. That's kind of not bad. I think maybe we put that in the stash. We could probably find a good home for that one. What's up, Dong? You've been listening all the time? Hell yeah, dude. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Oh, Corey. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. There will not be any of that. Anything that I miss and on the ground is always a bad roll. That's why I left it on the ground, because I just knew that that jewel was sticks to defense. It was not... N in no world was that a 40-15. Flawless Amethyst. Got so many rare rings here. I've had one that's been halfway decent. I'll see if I can find a few guys. It's like almost good, but just like not quite good. Just like this. Almost good. So much attack rating. Nice cold res. Little baby bit of life. But just not quite there. Lightning res, fire res. These boots, almost there again. Just need a smidge more than that. Oh, Fishy. How did the game um, like go with you two bros? Thanks for, um, thanks for asking, man. Yeah, well, Disaster actually struck Fishy. Disaster freaking struck because uh, we've been playing Gloomhaven online, just like on Steam. Like we've had a campaign going and turns out that the developers ripped their game. Yeah. <laughs> so they had an update uh, last month and ever since you can't play online if you're a Mac user. So, like, me and my older brother have PCs, and my younger brother plays off a Mac. So it's just like, oh, we can't play. But it was, it, was, it was okay, though, because we could play, um, we played Wingspan instead, which is an incredible game. If you, if you like board games, strongly recommend Wingspan. It's, thematically, it's very cool, but it's also, you know... A bit niche you're basically collecting birds it's like a deck building game where you're collecting birds and like laying eggs and and stuff like that but it's really well designed it's really fun and we played that three times and i won one of the three times so wasn't the best result kind of stats wise but had a lot of fun it was fun to play wingspan again sometimes you know how sometimes in deck building games or like for example like if you're playing draft in magic the gathering someone just gets super lucky and just gets a really powerful deck the first the first round was kind of like that where my older brother just got insane cards so it's kind of the game was already won and the last round the one that i ran was a bit like that as well but the, the middle game was really quite close sounds like a blast it's really good. It's a really well-designed game. <clears throat> uh, you don't check elite magic armors like dust shrouds and swayahayas. If I'm playing offline, 
most of the time I wouldn't check it dust room. If I'm playing online, if I see it, usually I'll check it for you guys. But I know that like there's a one in a million that it could be something that's worth like a hundred million bear runes. But I don't check everything I'm meant to check. Because for me, for me there's kind of like a point where I'm checking too much stuff that I'm just having less fun now. If that makes sense. It kind of feels like a chore to check stuff. So there is stuff that I'm meant to check that I just leave on the ground. Yeah, admittedly. Just we're, we're meant to be having fun here, bros. <laughs> if I have to check everything I'm meant to check, for me personally, it just feels like a chore. Yeah. What's your highest rune? Jar rune, baby. Jarun. But usually when I'm online, I check more stuff just for you, bro. It's just cause it's like having an itch just you can't scratch, you know what I mean? Can you mention which runes you've found already? I, it would be my delight. I would love to. Thank you for asking. So, El Naturally, I found a Jar rune, a Low rune, two Vex runes, a Gal rune, and a Mal rune. And then I've also found... Not one, not two, not three, but four Shakos, which I've all traded for Isp runes. And then I also did some wheeling and dealing to trade into a third Vex rune. Oh, I saw the belt and I thought that that's, this looks like ring, you know? Same number of letters. Here, yeah, Jack, show me what you got. Death mask, what's this black horns? We actually went over all the year three minutes into the stream. If you want to see the full thing. But this is the most important thing. Let's go black horns base. <clears throat> Add that one to the Tabale. Chucks and booties. What are these like water walks or something? And a cool one. Definitely one for the table. Water walks. Water walks. Is it water walk or water walks? I think it's probably just water walk. Um, D Web and Bear incoming on Terrazard Trav, calling it now. Dude, how long is it? Oh, only 11 mints. Hell yeah, man. I was saying before, we haven't had Terrorized Trav yet. Can't wait. Even the idea of crossing off one Grailer. We could get the Tyrus. We could hit the Tyrus. We could, could any we could hit anything in the whole game. Any good roll on Crown of Ages? I haven't rolled a Crown of Ages this season. Yeah, I haven't found one yet. I think the last Crown of Ages I got was. I might have even been from Pindle, like ages ago. Next Terrorized Trav, I can finish my thousand Terrorized Trav video. Hell yeah, dude. Yeah, you've been making um 666 run videos, right? Very cool idea. I like that. Very cool. I haven't seen seen someone do that. Six six hundred and sixty-six of a single run. The only issue with it. Is I don't know how well 666 is search engine optimized compared to a thousand. That's the only issue. But I don't know if it matters. Because the road to a thousand is so long, true. <laughs> I hate that number so much. Why? Because it may remind you of the the uh, D4 battle pass. Yeah, we got a smallie there. What's your level? I think we're 88. Yeah, we're at level 88. We st I started at level 85. And we've been just slowly getting experience. Playing with your gold fan, Bob, now? Hell yeah, dude. It's probably making you sick that uh, I'm leaving all of these 35Ks on the ground. <laughs> it makes you sick to your stomach. 
Did you watch the Llama video on how to track hack traffic players count? I certainly did, man. Really interesting. Really interesting video. Havki sounds like an absolute goat. Absolute goat. In your latest video, you've got a little Easter egg about me. Oh, I'll have to watch it, man. Oh, yeah, Mortal Kings. So this rolls 35 to 40 on the crushing blow, right? I'll have to snoop it. The latest vid. Oh, agree? 40. We hit the 40. I'm probably still going to put it on the ground, unless someone really wants it. It's just not that good, you know? <laughs> it's perfect, yeah. <laughs> still sucks, though. <laughs> I tried it, it's so bad. Fall of Mortal Kings is so bad. <laughs> I'll put it in the stash just in case. Just in case there's someone that wants it. Goodbye. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Um, chuck it in the table though. It's actually the first of Mortal Kings more. Kind of cooked. We found one of Mortal Kings more and four Shakos. Straight up hacks, man. Goes hard in classic. Simpler times, classic, hey? Simpler, simpler times. Not that I was there, but um, from what I hear. Oh no, shot Richard! The, uh, bro, the, um, the storied, the straight up storied. Normal Tells Ami. Finding a Tells Ami in normal mode. That would have been such a shock, bro. Hey, the Pheasant Crown. Poor man Shaco. In the bin. In the bin, but also in the table. Uh, no, yeah, it's, that's all good, Ragnar. Thanks for, um, phrasing that in such a polite manner, dog. Yeah. Just part of the, just part of the deal is answering the same question over and over again. Um, although not many people have asked me that today, but yeah, I'm going to try D4 Season 2. I, I was going to anyway, but in light of the past two dev talks, I'm actually kind of excited right now rather than just curious now i'm excited curious yeah we get there we got a peasant crown yeah to be honest the only time that i get tired of answering the same question is when we're doing the one to uber streams and i've just been streaming for like 16 hours in a row then then it does kind of like, I'm just kind of like, just so tired. Like reading and opening my mouth is like <laughs> exhausting. <laughs> That's the only time where, I, where I'm like tired. But yeah, it's just the nature of uh, streaming. People have the same question because it's a good question. You know what I mean? Um, Grand Charm, the amulet. Pretty decent. Only required level 27 as well. Anything else I'm missing here? I don't think so. Oh, Smolly. Woo. Godlike. Oh, it had the 7%, but the wrong 7%. Damn. Can you show me here? <laughs> what we've got is I knew we'd get this one a lot. Um, 
I, I went over the gear three minutes into the stream. Exactly three minutes into the stream. I tried to put a timestamp in the description, but I don't think it worked. But uh, it's mainly just a grief. We've got four piece of model kings. Treachery, Rhyme, Dwarf Star, Nagel, and then two spirits. Yeah. It's a mixed bag. Like some of it is really good. You know, we've got a grief. And some of it sucks donkey donkey balls. Like our we've still got like lots of three magic fine small charms. We still only have a 27 Nagel. Oh we've got Metal Grid as well. I found Metal Grid here. How cool is that? Good roll on the Metal Grid. And of course this is hardcore. <laughs> nah, softest of cores, baby. And I'm loving it. I'm loving it being soft core. It means I could just switch off. Just watch Dragon Ball Z, you know, chat with you guys. Chat with you guys more so. I've almost finished Dragon Ball Z. I think I've got like three or four episodes left. And on Nate play, what's this Corpse Morn? Corpse Morn. I always forget how to spell this one. That's that's one we'll add into the table. Corpse Morn. Like that. Like Morn. It's spelt exactly how it's pronounced. <laughs> Any good runes so far? Hey, what's up? We got um, Madara himself. Um, I haven't been this excited since fighting Hashirama. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Popped into my head. <laughs> uh, Naruto quotes live in my head rent free. We got... We've been really lucky with runes, but not today. Not yet today. So, all of the top row ones, including this pull, have been natural finds, and then these ones have been trades from things we've found. It's nuts, right, Moloch? Right? It's nuts. It's suspicious activity. It's suspicious behavior. Give him up, baby. No shot. No shot I'm doing that again. That hurt too much. We're trading those. We're trading those. So at the moment, pretty pretty consistently. Hey, Van Braces is there. Is it Soul Drainers? Um, a Bear Rune is going for two lows, two Vexes. Tradery. So we're kind of like a low rune away from... The Enigma. Which is obviously a low rune's a big deal, but in the grand scheme of things, kind of close. Soul Drainer. Pretty cool. Another one for the table. Soul Drainer. But anything that ends up on the ground does not end up in the video, <laughs> as a rule of thumb. Like, why would you highlight something? Why would you highlight something in a video that you're gonna throw on the ground? Unless it's single player, that's different. Because in single player, it's like the rules are different. Let's see. Oh, 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 it ticked. It ticked over. Oh, beautiful. Oh, beautiful. We're on, boys. <laughs> We're on. Hell yeah, dude. Let's get the freaking D-Web. Let's get the D-Web. Let's get the, um... What else do I need? I need a Tyrell's Might. I need a Zod Rune. I need a Cham Rune. I need a Storm Lash. A lot of those we could have found pre-terrorized, but D-Web, Tyrell's. Oh, ugh. not our fifth one ends. Give me a you. And I guess we get way better experience as well. It's actually pretty good. We'll hopefully be able to get up to level 89. Gives us another 1% boost to our Hawk. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Guy. Need a 
champ. Let's go, champ. That'll do. Pray to the chair gods. <laughs> the old god chair gods. Um, this one ends. Low Nagel rig on the next unique rig incoming. No, Wolfie. <laughs> Don't do me like that, dog. The past two unique rings I've found have both been Raven Frosts. So we are actually due for a bad one. <laughs> Log it in, Schmuck. You only have an hour of godlike terrorized trials. I know, I know. It's kind of like when you hit a really good terror zone. It's kind of like, go, 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 go. But uh, I prefer to just maintain the same pace I think and just like maybe I'll get five less runs in I'll, I'll be less stressed and have more fun while I'm doing it but I remember when Terra Zone first came around I was really like that I would like wouldn't even look at you guys I'd be like <laughs> try to min max so hard mana I don't even know. I don't actually know if we're getting. I assume we're getting more experience. But I don't know if it's significantly more. I mean, of course we'd be getting more experience. Is grief required for this build? No, nah, grief isn't required. Um, there are a lot of good alternatives that you guys have suggested. Um, I think Oath is a common one that you guys have suggested. It's just really nice having the grief. It's just, it's, it's just so nice. Not required though, for sure. Oh, there are a lot of freaking Zerkers up in our grill today, aren't they? I mean, ze Zealots. Get out of here, dudes. You can change the time on your PC to have the same terror zone. I think you can on single player, I, although I've never done that. Um, I don't think that would work on, on ladder though, right? Joe's tough. What's this? Razor switch or something? Yeah. Reckon we put razor switch in the table? Probably do, hey? What have we got here? Ooh, legendary mallet. What could have been? Could have been a Schaefer's. That would be, that would also be a good item. Probably hit a bit slow though. Let's put the razor switch in. Razor switch. The zealots run away when it's not terrorized and they charge you when it's terrorized. Wait, actually? Is that? I feel like they do do that. True. I didn't even realize that. Oh, that's why. That's why they've been up in our grill. <laughs> it makes perfect sense. Um, hi, you're from the US? Hey, welcome to the stream, dude. No, I'm from, uh, Australia. Yeah. True, they just charge us. Yeah, they normally run around like little freaking... It's kind of annoying. Like, I don't really want to deal with that many bros. Let's just go in here and let the council come to us. What's up, Miguel? Let's go, schmuck necro team. Well, I mean, we have to do the one to Uber's Necro at some time. And by have to do, I mean really want to do. It's not like... It's not like something I'm dreading. It's something I'm looking forward to. I'm scared of it. But, um... It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. And it means I'll have to meld my face onto a Necromancer as well. Which honestly is probably a more natural transition. 
because uh, I feel like when you're a degenerate gamer, you kind of morph into a necromancer anyway. Got lots of necromancer-like features going on, just naturally. Remarkably pale skin. Gaunt-looking dead eyes. It's going to be a smooth transition. Okay. Uh, what server do you use in Australia? Is it Asia? Most people would use the Americas. Yeah. Yeah, because the ping is comparable for uh, Asia and Americas, but everything's in English. So, yeah. Good question. Great question. You would think that the ping would be better with Asia because it's closer, but kind of the same I mean it, it also kind of doesn't really matter that much that everything's in English I rarely join public games except for bail games I do like to join bail actually when I'm leveling I often do that with just like in random pubs <laughs> Good luck with the run. Thanks, man. Hey, good question, dog. I actually Google it. When I got D2R, I Googled it myself. Like, which server should I join as an Australian? <laughs> I mean, I had the same question. Um, Blauless. Do you ride kangaroos in Australia? <laughs> No, but kangaroos ride us. Yeah. That's an image you'll never get out of your head. Uh, off to work time for a cold one. How's the run going? Yeah, going well, Willie. Really. Yeah, good luck with work, man. Haven't had anything amazing happen today yet on drop-wise, but plenty of time. Let's get this. Oh, shit, we'll change the camera after this Terra Zone. Am I doing this right now when we're on the clock? It just makes no sense. Oh yeah, baby. Light me up. Does the rune watch from season three still work on ladder? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, so the rune words they added in Season 3 should still be on ladder and single player. But they're not... The latest rune words were, aren't on... Um, aren't on non-ladder. Because they didn't get kind of pushed to non-ladder. That makes sense. By new, new rune words coming in. How close are you to Enigma? I would say... We're a low rune away. The equivalent of a low rune away. We'd need to do some trades. But the equivalent of a low rune. And then we can trade for a bear. And we can trade for a ED mage plate. Trevor runs with the hawk barb are the best to drink beer with. You don't have to think it all. I know, it's perfect. It's so good. It's kind of like bail, bail waves with a Blizz Sorceress, you know? You just sit there spamming the same button. It's great for streaming as well, Justin. So I'm not looking half the time, you know? <laughs> just looking at you, bros. Right clicking. In Alaska, we ride polar bears. I uh, like um, the Northern Lights. Actually, little known fact, the Northern Lights, i.e. the Golden Compass, was actually a documentary filmed in Alaska. For some reason, people think it's a fantasy novel, but... Um, In the UK, we ride squirrels. 
<laughs> the Aurora Borealis. Yeah. So good. They actually made a Northern Lights TV show that's on, um, it's on like binge or something. And it's really good. I still, I, I, I still need to, um, watch the third season of it. Should be out by now. Grandy. Come on. I don't think there's anything else there. Probably something I'm missing. What characters you got so far this season? We've got this guy. This guy's the main. At level 88 Barb. And we also have a level 80 Nova Source, i.e. Key Farmer. And then we have like a level 76 Pally, i.e. Uber Tristram Runner. Yeah. Smiter for Trist. Who would be a lot better off if he had an Eber. But <laughs> we're in the right place. We are in the right place. He didn't miss the same run. Oh, hell yeah, baby. Get that magic line going. Oh, Galvaroon! <laughs> Wait, flex call to Galvaroon. Hell yeah, dog. We got a gal. Flex called that. I hope he's still here. Flex straight up called that. Hell yeah, baby. We didn't even have to hawk that. I was here. <laughs> I feel like that came out of nowhere, man. Frickin' Galvaroon, boys. We're edging closer. We're edging closer. Now we probably need the equivalent of... We probably need the equivalent of... An Omrune, a Vexrune, and a Galvaroon. I'd say that's how far away we are. Om, Vex, and Galloway. Roughly. Ooh, Grand Charm, too. That's pretty good. Max damage attack rating. If only it was life on the bottom. Let's go, boys. Terra Zone has already paid off. Oh, I lead Farfay. <laughs> Thank you so much. I literally joined to you yelling, Galvaroon. Here's to, to more of my cash money, Daddy Schmucker. Thank you so much, man. I really appreciate it. Here's to more Galvaroons. Whoops. Thanks, Forfait. Oh, fantastic. We're probably even closer than that, hey? Because let's say... Where, where are we going by? Two lows... Two lows, two vexes is is a bear rune. So basically we need one more low rune and we have all of this. Like that's getting very close to being worth a low rune. And then maybe we trade maybe an ist or something for an enhanced damage mage plate. We'll see. Beautiful boys. B E A U T I F U L. Macaroons. That's a schmuck loads of, of runes right there. All of those from just over 500 runs. And Stoxy new rune next month. Hell yeah, dog. Almost got that ist rune. Thanks so much for being a member for so long, man. And for all of your, your glorious moderations. Very much appreciated. Nice Ace Ventura reference. Oh no, Willy, I've got to come clean. I've got to come clean. It was accidental. <laughs> it's the worst feeling. I feel like I'm such a such a disappointment when someone says nice reference and it was just an accident. <laughs> it was just an accident. I shouldn't have said anything. But my conscience, my conscience is getting the best of me. I'm so sorry to let you down. Now I feel like I need to watch like all three Ace Venturas just to make up for it. Wait, what? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. It happened the other day too. 
<laughs> Someone commented on a stream and they're like, nice rounders reference. And I was like, oh no, I've never seen rounders. I've never seen rounders. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Let you down like that. I was telling my brothers about that. And it's like, oh man, now I have to watch rounders. I don't even know what rounders is. I'm a failure. I'm a fraud, man. I'm a fraud. I'm a fucking fraud, dude. There's only two. I've, I've never seen them. I've never seen them, dude. I've never seen Ace Ventura. I've never seen it. Or maybe I saw it once when I was a kid. Like, the first one. I guys hope you're all doing great. I mean, we just found a Galroot, so I'm doing great. I'm doing excellent. Alright, excellent. It's right up your alley. I actually, uh, I was snooping, um, I was snooping a streaming website last night, like, just to watch, just to watch movies. Um, but I said that in the most sus way possible. Um, and I was looking at all these movies, like, I, and I googled, like, best movies of 2022 and, like, best movies of 2021, because, like, I haven't watched movies in, like, so long. Like, a new movie in so long. And, like, n literally none of them were remotely appealing. Like, I just... I just don't care about new movies. Is anyone else like that? Like, they just don't give a fuck? Like, I'm much more interested in watching old movies that I haven't seen. So, Ace Venture is good. I can actually watch that. And then now I can make a reference. And then it'll actually be a genuine reference. Dreamio with Dorentio, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was definitely on an illegal website. You know, for... Cause it's like, cause it's like Netflix was really good for a little while, but then it's like, oh, now there's a streaming service for everything. There's like Netflix, there's like Binge, there's this Hulu, there's like the Amazon Prime. And it's like, the more of them there are, the shitter each one of them gets. So it's kind of, for a while, it was like worth it for me to like pay. It's like 15 or 16 bucks a month now. It was worth it to pay 16 bucks a month to, to get a streaming service. But like now it's not worth it anymore. So I've just like canceled it and have gone back to watching stuff illegally. In Minecraft, of course. I would never break the law in real life. I'd never admit to it on live stream. You know what I mean? I feel like it's a natural cycle of things. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, 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 okay. Hopefully we can't pick this up. Hopefully we can't pick this up because our geese is so bad. Oh, oh no, we can. Ah, damn it, damn it, damn it. All right, well, 70 light. Ooh, 89 light. It's not good. It's not good, but maybe we can find a good home for it. I got so excited for a second there. I got it wrong in my brain. <laughs> We're excited when we can't pick it up, not when we can pick it up. Because we need a new gate so bad. Although, I, we don't actually have a Sunder on the Nova Source yet. So we could use that there. One Piece live action. I've actually heard good things about that. But I don't know if it'll be... If it's... If it's good, if I haven't watched One Piece. You know what I'm saying? Like, would I enjoy it if I haven't watched One Piece? The Truman Show re reminds me of my life. Right? <laughs> How the heck do you get a key to where? Uh, I got... One gauge from Trav. And I got... I got a second gauge from, uh, from Countess, actually. One was from Trav, one was from Countess. They're pretty rare drops. Wow, why are you freaking getting absolutely boned right now? Jesus Christ. Yeah, they're pretty rare drops. It's, although you could get one pretty cheap now. You've never found one before? If we if we find another one this stream, then you can have my old one if you want, if you're still here. We gave away one earlier, but <clears throat> I don't have a spare one going. 
Anchorage. Debated by the T. Martial arts. You stash this under charm? Yes. Good question, though. Good question. Because that was brutal, that run. <laughs> that was freaking brutal. Like, I don't think we were even amped or anything either. What's up, Jack? Welcome to the stream, dude. Welcome, welcome. It's better if you haven't watched it. Okay, sweet. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's the um, the One Piece live action. That means I will have to get Netflix back, but it's okay. I will do it. I'm a famous streamer now, so I can afford $16 for one month. <laughs> oh, good, um, Bravo. Yeah, I just play so much Diablo that I... After, after any given time, then I I am, have excess of lots of things. Naturally. All right. Man, I'm so happy about that girl. I forgot that happened for a second. Too busy talking about committing crimes on live stream. Um, Carnage Helm. I guess we I did this. The six boo. Ooh, Grandy. Oh, 120 attack rating. Is that max roll? That's got to be max roll, right? 120. <clears throat> Are you being able to still enjoy the game? How do you manage burnout? That's a really good question, man. That's a really good question because when you film magic finding videos, you can get burnt out. And one thing, and I was kind of teetering on it there for a little while. Uh, but one thing that really helps is to play other games. Yeah, to play other games. Like I went and played POE for a couple weeks. And then went and played D4 for a little while. And then went and played Project Diablo 2 for not enough time. And just having something to bounce off makes, um, just re really, really, it makes me enjoy everything more when I'm there. And you're not just, just playing one game and only one game. But, like, obviously, like, you know, that's a, it's, a, it's, it's a blessing to be able to do that. Because that's a, it's not kind of something to be taken for granted on YouTube. Because, obviously, you build your audience around one thing, you know? And if you go off and play something else, it's like, well, the vast majority of people are kind of like, well, I don't care about this other thing, you know? I like, uh, I'm here for Diablo. Dab Diablo alone, but um, I, I feel really grateful in that when we have gone off and done something else for a couple of weeks, then it hasn't been like there's literally no one there, and it hasn't like bricked, bricked the ta bricked the channel. Well, at least not yet. <laughs> at least not yet. We're here for you, Schmunk Thunder Game. Yeah, well, that's why. Because we got legends like you, Willie. So it's kind of like... Maybe... 20% 20, 20 of people might be like you, Willie. That are... You know... Here, here, here for me. Not, not, um... Not solely here for the drops. Helps that they are ARPGs. Exactly. I mean, you have to pick the right game as well. You know, like if I was just to go off and play, you can't just go off and play anything. You know what I mean? Yeah. You got to pick the right game. <clears throat> For sure.
Really? Thanks, man. I appreciate it, dude. Wait, did you... Your last... Your message you sent a, a little while ago confused me in hindsight. Wait, you, you said you're, it's time to go to work, but then you also said it's time to crack a, open a cold, cold one? Did I read that wrong? Or did you say it was time to knock off work? Or are you cr cracking a cold one at work? I don't know. I'm confused. <laughs> I need clarification. <laughs> um, Kingfish Monk and Call of Duty beta this weekend. <laughs> See, that actually, in a weird way, that could actually kind of work. Because it's so out of left field. And it would just be bit me being murdered over and over again. Like, that could actually kind of be funny as a once-off. But, um, yeah. Like, we're gonna play Last Epoch. Oh, oh, whoa! Max Cold Resist with 4% Magic Find. That's pretty decent. I don't know if this makes it into the video, but you guys decide right now. Does this make it into the video? I don't know. It's three up perfect on the Magic Find. Do, 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 do. You decide. Nah, we take those, yes. Pally, ruthless, yes, yes, maybe not. Oh, I think we're gonna be ruthless with it. I think we're gonna be ruthless with it. It's nice, it's really useful for right now. But it only makes it in if we're six and up. Let's say six and up. Good for personal use. <clears throat> and but it means we have to change this thing a biggie jiggy here. So we're 239. Creeping up there. Can you trade it for an ist? Oh, I don't think so. Yeah, I doubt it. Oh, did I miss a javelin? Was it matriarchal or ceremonial? Sorry, man. I usually check those. Um. All right. What get kicked out? Gets kicked out here. Probably this one. Oh, everything's going to be a mess now. That one goes. Um, how do you feel about finding the items in POE compared to D2? In POE, I kind of miss the big drop because they happen so rarely or not at all. Um, for me, I thought the drops in PoE were really good on the whole. One of the things that Diablo 2 has going for it, just in this specific circumstance, is that I know what all of the drops are already. You know what I mean? So I know what to get excited by. Like that charm, I know that, that that's a good charm. But I know exactly that that's perfect on the cold. That's three off perfect on the magic find. If that was perfect on the magic find, then we'd we'd be talking big money, baby. So it's like with Poe, I just didn't have nearly enough time to learn all of the specifics like that. But I did know what color swish it was. You know what I mean? Like that's a red swish. You know? <laughs> yeah, we're excited about red swishes in Poe. So that's more so what I was getting excited by. Um, but for example, like if I was to, now I know what a freaking, um, what was that card that I found again? The one where if you get five of them, you make a mage blood. Is it just called a mage blood card? What was it? What's it called? What's that really, really apothecary? Yeah, 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 yeah. So like. If I found an APO again, then I would lose my mind. Because now I know how fucking rare that shit is and how insanely lucky I got finding one. So <clears throat> So I think they did they did they did that they're they're really good. I think the drops in POE are really good. You found an APO? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> On like my third day playing. <laughs> it was I had a stacked deck of uh of like 10 cards and there was an apo in there and i looked at it and because i like opened them in my inventory and then i looked at it and you guys had taught me what a mage blood was before and i saw mage blood on the card 
and then I dropped it to see what color swish it was, and it was a red swish. And I was like, oh my god, is this insane? And then I looked, and I saw chat move the fastest that I've ever seen it. It was like fucking light speed. <laughs> and I was like, okay, this is insane. Yeah. And then I tried to do, and then I tried to double it using the using the herbology recipe, and I burnt it. I burnt the apo. <laughs> I'm gonna make this apo disappear. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, I think the the drops in POE are really good. Um. And like when you find. I like how there's nice, it's, it's such a fleshed out game that there's nice tiers of drops as well, which is the same in, there's the same in D2, right? It's kind of like, you've got this ultra rare stuff that you're super excited by, like, you know, griffins or something like that. But then there's also like a million tiers of, you know, effective rarity between a griffins and like a pulver, you know what I mean? Good to pick up blue jewels. Yeah, sorry. I've, I've been skimping on a couple of blue jewels, haven't I? Yeah. I'm like 65% of blue jewels. Yeah. <laughs> 65%. I was doing good at the start of the stream. I was doing good at the start of the stream. <laughs> what are you really gambling with? <laughs> pop it, add pop it to your head. <laughs> well, it's like... If you're streaming, there is, it's non-negotiable that you gamble the APO, you know? If you don't, if you're streaming and you don't gamble that APO, then I'm sorry, but you're doing it wrong. Because the potential upside is immense. If we were to freaking turn the APO into a mage blood by doubling it three times, then that is... That's a hundred thousand views, baby, right there. And you gotta think, ooh, ooh, oh, 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 oh no. Oh no, we can pick it up. <laughs> no, we can pick it up. Oh, 74 light though. That's a good one. <laughs> I'm less salty now. I wanted to be a geese, but 74 light's good. We take that. We take that. Yeah. And you gotta think, what's most important? What's most important in life? And the obvious answer is YouTube views. So, anything for the views, baby. And if you burn it, then it's still kind of funny to watch. You know what I mean? So that, uh... That made it an easy decision. But also... When we burnt it on the very first double or nothing, that was fucking soul-crushing. That was soul-crushing. Soul it just, poof, it's gone. It's gone. It was never there. You can trade the charm. Yeah, I wonder what this uh, this trade's for. Should we have a snoop after like 26 mins or something? Can I find this charm in single play? Yes, you can. So all you need to do is beat Bale on hell mode. And then you might need to go into your settings and activate terror zones. Sometimes it doesn't default to being turned on. Yeah. So just got to... Beat the Bale Quest in Hell Mode. And then you should be able to. When you're running Terrorized Zones. Light Source will just eat that charm up. Yeah, our, um, uh, our Nova Source. Uh, H Mike, you can play D D4 Season 2? Yeah, yeah, looking forward to it, actually. Yeah, wasn't looking forward to it. But uh, now, in light of the past two campfire chaps, I'm... Uh, Dare I say it, I'm optimistic. I'm optimistic. I should be cautiously optimistic. But uh, I'm just flat out optimistic. Oh, we got the light. The light's going to be glaring into my eyes for the next uh, 20 minutes or so. So just heads up on that. Got that holy light coming through. <clears throat> How much do you make from YouTube? Personal question. It is a personal question. It's super... It's super variable. Um, but I make enough to live off comfortably. 
but um, I'm not like balling out over here, obviously. So, yeah. I kind of, I kind of, I have previously, but I'm apprehensive going into more specifics than that. Just because, like, depending on where you are in the world, it's, it might just be fucking annoying to hear. You know what I mean? But, I live, I live like a, a comfortable, modest life of what I make off YouTube. He likes Schmuck so much you turn ad block off for him. Oh, dude. <laughs> Thank you, man. But don't do that, man. Fuck ads, man. Fuck that shit. Bro. <laughs> I got YouTube premium, but I had ad block before that, you know? It was just getting out of control. Full transparency. Um. Alright. Run walk. Like, I very much appreciate everyone who watches the ads, but. Like the ad at the start, but. <clears throat> it's just too many, you know? When they started playing like multiple non skippables in a row, it's like, oh, nah, that's it. Time to get ad blocker again. Although they were doing, um. They were trialing cancelling ad blocker, or like blocking ad blocker, right? Something, something YouTube was trialing recently. Rings armor is a bit of a nothing burger, but we will we will sell it. Rings. How much a maximum Mr. Beast is a peasant compared to regular schmuck you <laughs> schmuck <-il> you man? <laughs> Bro. They're absolutely not. But also, Mr. Beast lives a lifestyle that I would absolutely not want to live, you know? Like, I don't... I don't want to work all the time. Like, that's just not the life that I want to live. You know how some people are like, rise and grind, baby. If you're... If you're not... If you're sleeping any more than four hours a night, then you're, you're wasting time, you know? It's just... That's just not... That's just not for me. Know what I'm saying? Once you get premium, so it's so hard to go back. Yeah, I'll never not have premium of YouTube. Like, you can't, you, and you're not allowed to call me a paid chill because I was literally just saying, don't deactivate your ad blocker. <laughs> but it's like, there are so many good features that it's hiding from you. Like one is no ads, obviously, but Playing, keeping YouTube videos playing when you minimize YouTube on your phone, like that alone, I, I will never, I will never go back from having that. So you can like play a YouTube video and then like be scrolling Instagram or something, and it'll just keep playing in a mini player. Or if you, or if you're watching something on your phone, you're halfway through it and then you open your laptop, that video will be there, ready to go, with exactly where you're up to. <laughs> it's just a good, it's just good service. It's just so worth it for someone who spends like all day on YouTube. That one's huge. That's like how YouTube is like literally half of my work day. Yeah, I mean, if you're on it all day, it's just so worth it. Hey, Willie. Yeah, true, you can do that in Samsung without paying, yeah. <laughs> but you run offhand. We got uh, a rhyme offhand, Adrian. Yeah. That's our source of can't be frozen. Um, it'd probably be better to have like Trang's belt or like a champ shaker if we were balling out and then have like an Alibaba or an offhand. Just rolling with what we, what I have, you know what I mean? Any GG drops through all 540 runs? Dog. You have no idea. You have no idea. Yes is the short answer. Um, Jarvrude is the long answer. Found a Jarvrude, found a Lowrune, found two Vex runes, found a 555 facet, found 
four Shakos, found two Galvaroons, found two Ravenfrosts. Um, yeah, it's been insane. It's been insane. Hawk Nation, baby. Anything good here, bros? It's a lot to read, isn't there? Bang one of these. Let's peel out. Oh, uh, yeah. That's one of the things I love about um, PyGen. That's one of the things I loved about PoE's design. It's similar... The card system in, in PoE is in a way similar to the rune system in in uh, Diablo 2. So like with the card system, exactly like you're saying, like you can work towards these super rare items incrementally. Like five Apos is a Mage Blood. It's, it's a bit similar to runes in, um, in D2. It's kind of like Jar and Bear is an enigma, you know? Charms drops are often you'll get good stuff eventually. Yeah, we actually haven't had good, um, surprisingly bad charm lack. Charm luck, based off how many, how many charms we've, we've ID'd across the 500 runs. Like, I haven't found a good grand charm yet. I found one Geeds, but it's been... 25 magic find. Actually, we did just find the 24. I mean, the 74 lights under. That was probably the best grand charm we found. Oh! Ooh! Could have gone for number 5. Shaco, number 5. Don't tell Sweetfield about your drops. He suffers grinding draft. <laughs> yeah, he's never had good luck here, right? But didn't he... I lurked a little bit of his stream last night. Um, didn't he find a good rune last night? I didn't actually see it, but it was in the title. I actually found a good rune tonight. Do you know what he found? But watching him, watching his Trav runs, I was like, man, hats off to him. Just like not doing it with the Griffins is just so baller. I don't have the patience for that. I'm too like, I'm too impatient. I needed the Griffins. Wow, these guys are so brutal, man. Need to get uh, some more Rejuvies. Randy there, that's kind of nice. Oh, you found an Ace Rune? Oh, sick. Ooh. Come on, Tals, baby. Oh. Get to the other things in a sec. Flawless. Alright. Randy. In the bin. In the bin. In the bin. Oh, sorry. I meant grief. Did I say griffins? Yeah, I meant grief. Yeah. Thanks, man. Yeah, I did. I, I tried a couple without the without the grief, um, and it works. It works fine, but just the efficiency of it just it's just killing me. <laughs> it's just killing me. What's Earth like here? I've heard good things about Earth as a good intermediate. Yeah, I didn't actually try the Earth. I tried. I tried. Um, Unbending Will, I tried Obedience, I tried Full Immortal Kings, and nothing was quite cutting it for me, so I, wait, I waited till we had the grief. What's up, dude? Good morning from Holland. Oh, welcome to the stream, man. Hope you slept well, dude.
Redeemer is a good budget? I don't know much about the Redeemer, honestly. There are all these rune words. Basically, every rune word that's not grief, like every melee rune word that's not like freaking grief, um, strength. Oh, we were due for one. Elemental skiller, six dexterity. I have no idea. You probably don't care a flying floop about decks on elemental druids, hey? You wouldn't go max blocks on druids, would you? Unless maybe if you're dueling or something? I've got no idea. But it's a good skill. It's a good skiller. Take that to the bank. Take it to the bank. You would on wind druid? Jazzy food? <laughs> Anything less than, than 40 bonus... Um, Anything less than 40 bonus, uh, 40 bonus life. Absolute chassis food. We'll look up, once this terror zone over in, in, uh, 13 minutes, we'll look up what, what that skiller and what the, the lightning sanderer would be worth ballpark. Boink. Beautiful. Check this in there too. You got max block for Windy and excellent after all. Sure. <clears throat> so it's not a completely useless six dexterity. You don't have Enigma yet? Not yet. We're we're pretty close, though. Sort of. In the grand scheme of things, we're close. Flawless. Get out of here. Gear check. We actually, we went over the gear three minutes into the stream. I know it's a little bit annoying. But, um... There, but this is the main thing, is the grief. Yeah, sorry, I tried to put a little timestamp in the description, but it, it didn't work. But it's exactly three minutes in. Where'd you find the gyro in here? Found the gyro in here. Didn't even hawk it, man. Didn't even hawk it. As grief, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. A abysmal roll, but grief's a grief, baby. And the runes are in the right order, which is the most important thing. Found a jar already? Yeah, I found a jar last night. Right? Absolutely insane, water. Absolutely insane. The natty jar must have felt nice. It was so surreal. It reminded me a lot of the server rune when we did um, running countess till cubing countess rune still bear. It reminded me a lot of that server rune that just like cut the duration of the video in half. You know what I mean? It's like... <laughs> I was prepared to do 3,000 cat to do 3,000 uh, trav runs, and now it looks like we're going to do less than a thousand. You know what I mean? It was a really surreal feeling. Um, let's just leave those. I think there's a dude up here. Uh, the cubing to bear video is one of my favorite videos for me. Thanks, man. It's my favorite video as well. That's my favorite video I've made. It was on stream? No, unfortunately it wasn't. Yeah, it was off stream last night. I did the first 450 runs off stream. No, the, the bits where I got insanely lucky were suspiciously off stream. So... <laughs> classic i'm sure i'm gonna get some comments about it like bro make it less obvious you're hacking genuinely such suspicious behavior how lucky we've been like don't blame you don't blame you for the su suspicion it's our 17th ralvery something about doing countess runs is just fun i i like i quite like it you know it's very nice, nice sort of kind of monotonous grind. And I like how you 
almost always get something at the end. Um... You got a question about magic find? Beautiful, beautiful. If you're using a blizzard sorcerer with a gull dagger as a backup for magic find, if I switch for the last hit, does the last hit need to be cast from that weapon? Uh, I think the enemy just has to die while you've got the gull dagger in your main hand. If that makes sense. So even if the blizzard that kills them wasn't cast from the gull dagger, as long as you have the gull dagger here, not like in the other tab, when the enemy dies, then you should get the magic find. That's my understanding. Yeah. So like, sometimes when I'm farming just a boss, then I would do that. Like with Mephisto, like get him down, then like switch, switch to whatever I have on switch. Um, I don't usually do that when I'm farming like just mobs though. I can't be bothered. Yeah, Dead One's got it. Said it much more articulately than I could, Dead One. Magic Find is calculated on death, not on cast. It's all good, dude. Honestly, useful for me for you to ask questions like that. So... If I've got something wrong, then you guys can teach me about it. And if I've got it right, then it solidifies it. Every time Aura Rune drops. Can't work like that. If you have seven players and a monster dies, then which magic find do you take? Oh, god damn. Not even thinking about with multiple players. Maybe it is the other way then. Because if your Merc kills it, your Merc magic find is the Merc magic finds the one that works. So maybe it is whoever gets the last hit. Oh, no, no, it can work like that. It can work like that. Yeah, 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 no, it can work like that. Yeah, so it's still... You don't... I don't think you have to get the last hit with... While you're wearing the Gull Dagger. But... If you get the last hit, then it takes whatever magic find you have at that point in time. That's how I think it works. So I think it, it can work like that. Right? I mean, I don't know this for sure. Yeah, so if it's... If you're in multiplayer... And then whoever gets the last hit, then it would calculate off whatever magic find that they have at that point in time. That's my understanding. But also... Could be wrong, dog. Could be completely wrong. Could have another Pavki situation on our hands. <laughs> I went Travigil 10,000 times to prove Schmuck wrong. anything good yet hell yeah dude this stream so we've done just over 100 runs this stream and we found a 20 decks raven frost we found a gull rune and we found a elemental skiller with six dexterity and a 74 lightning thunder this is what we've got so far this stream and Heaps of good stuff before that. Heaps of good stuff before that. Thankfully, I'm just solo. Yeah, I'm mainly solo as well. It's just like, whoa, playing with other people. What are you talking about? <laughs> the 
you mean you have friends? What is this? Dark stacks with your character magic find if he deals it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think there's a guy, Zitmiss. Do you gonna did you guys know that guy? Zit Zitmiss? Might be pronouncing that wrong. Like he made uh a, a character, like a YouTube video with like 18, like 1,800 magic find. But that's only if the Merc gets the last kill. Zitmiss. Extimus. Extimus. That's what it is. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry. <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. Xmas, Yeah. Zitmiss. <laughs> oh, man. That is a skin condition. Um, ring, that's not a small charm. Elstrator, any offers? No dice yet, no dice. I'm a bit salty that we didn't get a ding because someone made an offer for, someone made an offer for the, uh, the Ravenfrost and then they canceled it six minutes later. But Tradery gave us a notification when they canceled, not when they made the offer. So classic... Classic Tradery Tings. Again, oh, we'll run for three more minutes and I'll just tinker with some video settings here again. So it's your magic find plus Merc's magic find. Yeah, so if you're, you're, you just only get your magic find. But if your mercenary gets the, the last hit, then he gets his magic find plus your magic find. That's my understanding. Oh, these rejuvies are really nice. Couple of, Oh! Ah, uh, we could pick it up. Damn it! Damn it, Janet. I love you. <laughs> Will you update your find? It would be awesome. A list of things found. Yeah, I mean, some people put, like, today's drops, like, on the side. You know what I mean? Um... The only thing with that is, like, this is going to be a YouTube video. Like, tomorrow or the day after. So, I don't know if I kind of want it, like, cluttering the screen, screen if it's going to be in a YouTube video, you know? But my priorities could be wrong there. You know, you guys probably don't give a fuck when you're watching a YouTube video. That there's a little bit of text in the corner of the screen. Oh, ho, 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 ho. oh, baby! Now that's money. That's money. <laughs> I don't know how much this is worth, but it's worth something. Hell yeah! That's good. Hot tamales, <laughs> exactly. I couldn't have said it better myself, fishy. Hot tamales, baby. Hot tamales. Don't DC, don't DC, don't DC, don't DC. Oh, yes. What a successful Terra Zone, dudes. That is a successful Terra Zone. God damn. Three Sunders, including a 74 Lightning and a 70 Cold. Love your streams. Oh, thanks, man. I, I love doing them, so that means a lot to hear. You can afford some green wine tonight. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Eating good tonight, boys. Ooh. God damn. Trav has been insane, dude. Cold Rupture is worth a Vex rune still? Oh, man. If we can op offload it for a Vex still, like, what are we, like... 12 days into ladder, then that would be glorious. We'll list it after this run. Oh, we're not terrorized anymore. And we'll list that. We'll see what the uh, Ellie one's going for, and we'll see what the, the light one's going for as well. I had to attend a meeting. What drops did I miss? You just missed a perfect cold sunder, dude. 
Perfect cold sunder. And 320. All right, let's get Willin and Dylan on tradery for a second. Tradery. So it's called Rupture. Ben. Let's see what perfect ones have been gone for. Ist, gull, ist or gull, ist, ist mal, gull, gull, gull. Let's try list it for a gull. I don't like how people have been offloading it for ists. Come on, dudes. Supply and demand here, bros. They're tanking it for everyone else. And then... Let's see what an elemental skiller goes, goes for. Probably not much. Pull rune. But ours has the six deck, six decks on there as well. What two um runes? What the hell? Oh, that's six. What the? Wait, what? Sixteen life only for a pulverun, lem rune, lem rune. Oh man. Um rune for thirty nine life. Oh, it's probably not worth selling that one. We'll just give it away for free. And then, the last one we want to look up is the crack. So if we go so ours is 74. I just want to see recent trades in the ballpark. East rune for 75. Oh wait, are we still on? Oh good, we're on softcore, good. Because we looked up. We looked up stuff on Hardcore before, right? Alright. Let's see if we can offload it for an Ist. I'll be very happy if we can offload that for an Ist. 74 light. Whoops. I doubt we'll be able to actually pull off this trade, but... We'll see. Beautiful. Got them ready to go. Nice. How much would one fire skill with 39 life cost? Oh. Probably a lot. Should we have a look? Um... An elemental with 39 life went for an Orm, right? Probably about that ballpark. And we'll put life. Let's go like 35 to 40. Whoops. Good luck there, buddy. Recent trades. Wow. No shot. Two lows. So low. Bear rune. Two jars. Wow. Holy shit, man. Holy fuck. That's more than I thought it would be. Based off that elemental one. God damn. Two lows. One low. I would list it for two lows. That's what I'd list it for. Oh, what the fuck? Pally just found a J mod. Oh, no shit, dude. Let's look up J mods. Let's look up J mods. How do you. Jeweler. Is that. I mean, there's an E there, right? Dude, congrats, man. That's insane. I don't even know how to uh, search for it. 
Oh, we probably go Monarch, right? Monarch. And then it's... Four sockets. And then just block chance, right? Increased chance of blocking. I want to get rid of this one. Am I doing this right? Definitely doing this wrong. I don't know how to search for it on Tradery. Just can't really think right now. Bro, that's insane though. They're, yeah, they're like insanely expensive. Like 20 gyrons, yeah. That's nuts. On single player, oh! Now you just need to find four five five facets. Add the sockets in a in at a minimum in blocking. Am I am I on the right thing though, Monarch? Is that the right thing? Because it's not a white monarch, it's a a rarity. Magic. And then it's in increased block chance, yeah. Then and then it's socketed. What's this? This is fifteen. Fifteen? Is it ten to fifteen? Still feel like that's not the right thing we're looking at. Oh, die to my days. Got it. Okay, 30% faster block rate, 20% increased chance of blocking. Jeez, these things are so fucking rare. I don't even know exactly what they do. Um, thank you, man. And then there's faster as well. Dude, that's insane, Pally. Oh, now we're talking. Okay, now we're in business. Now we're in business. Recent trades. 25 jar runes. So this is pre-ladder. Like at the end of last ladder. 25 jar runes, 30 jar runes, 25 jar runes, 40 jar runes, 32 jar runes, 35 jar runes, 28 jar runes. And the 5 bear is so cheap because that's 2 days ago. Because no one has bear runes in ladder. Yeah. But, like, this is later on. Jesus Christ, man. Holy shit, that's a once-in-a-lifetime drop. That's a once-in-a-lifetime drop, man. Congratulations. You're freaking shaking? Yeah, bro. <laughs> God damn. I gotta pick up more blue items, dog. Congratulations. You're single-player rich? <laughs> yeah. Rich where it matters. Yeah, rich at heart. Congratulations, man. You fucking deserve it, dude. You deserve that shit. Hell yeah, dog. Wait, I just gotta um sort some uh sort this lighting out over here. I'll be too sex. Let's go here. Turn that down now. Just crank up the light in front of me a little bit. I want you to see every fucking follicle on my face. Perfect. Perfect. All right, let's go, homies. Let's continue the journey. That's so huge, Pally. That's so freaking huge, dog. Oh, oh, all the phones. We might have had a ding, dude. Someone made an offer for the Raven Frost. Oh, fuck no, dog. <laughs> Get out of town. A Raven Frost is listed for a Gulliver and someone offered a lamb. Like, nice try, broski. Nice freaking try. I hope that wasn't one of you guys. Because I would be embarrassed to be associated with someone so poor. Sorry. Just kidding. 
<laughs> Just kidding. If it was one of you guys, then I'll give you the Raven Frost for free. You clearly need it. <laughs> Um, man, that's so insane. Did Whirlwind get nerfed in D2R? I think it got buffed, right? I think it got buffed. Because it used to be the first... The first levels into Whirlwind, it gave you negative damage. And... Ooh. I guess we put that... Here. Um, and now it doesn't minus your damage in the first levels. I don't think. We can have it. We can uh, snoop it in a sec. 245 magic find now. Link to the build. Uh, it's just a pretty stranded uh, berserker. I can show you in it if if you want. I can show you what we're rolling with. So. We've just got max Berserk. Then we max the two synergies. Hal and Battle Orders. We've got our one hit wonders. We max the you know the relevant mastery. And then just put one point into Battle Cry, because we're using it for Ubers. And then I just putting points into find potion and find item now. From here on out, it'll all go into Fine Potion. And then with the stats, we've just got... Got actually a bit more strength to wear our gear, just because it gives us a bit more damage. We've got Dex for max block, but also for attack rating. And then just got Vitality. This is kind of a bit... It's not min-max, but like all three of these are useful, so it doesn't really matter. And just none into energy. And items? Sure. We've come this far. So we got Grief. This is the main thing. Grief is carrying the boats right now. I'm wearing four-piece Immortal Kings, although there is better stuff we could be wearing. Uh, I'm wearing a Treachery. I've got a Metal Grid, just because I found it and I wanted to use it. Plus, that's an awful lot of attack rating. I've got a Rhyme for the Can't Be Frozen, although there would be a better way of getting that. I've got a Dwarf Star and Nagel. And then on Switch, I've got two Spirits. Just because that's what I have. With um, an Annie, a Torch, and then mostly these are crappy magic finding ones. And I think we put this one here. Sorry, you have been relegated. You are the weakest link, Large Charm. Jump ID scrolls, yeah. <laughs> Good looking out, man. Good looking out. I tried about his whirlwind. Yeah, if we were whirlwind, I think we could do these a little bit faster. And then just have one point into Berserk. Like Mac J was saying, to deal with the physical immune. There's one physical immune broski. Makes a lot oh good dude. No. Oh good. There's probably a couple of people that were watching that are curious about the gear. So Oh, what the hell, dude? You got a Tyrael's Might. Congrats, man. Freaking Pindle. Freaking Pindle. That, that little scumbag has to be terrorized, right? That would have been so surreal. Hitting the blue. Dual Grief Whirlwind would be way faster. Yeah. yeah. I mean, part of the thing is... We're just rolling around with whatever gear we have. You know, like, we don't... We don't have, uh... All the gear we want just yet. Even though we could almost afford it. But, uh, I think one big upgrade we could use... Is putting an Alibaba on our offhand. For just, like... What is it? Like, 150 magic find or something insane. If you chuck some ists in there. And then having the can't be frozen somewhere else. Like in a Trang's belt. Or a champ shaker. Something like that. But um... 
we have to get the things, you know what I mean? Oh, 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 spawny, baby. Spawny, 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 spawny. God damn. I'm in. I'm in. Vex for Raven and the Light Sunder. Yeah, dude. Yeah. I feel like... I feel like I'm coming out the winner in that trade, though, Spawn. Like, that's pretty generous from, from your end. Because, like, we're trying to offload the, the, the Raven for a Gull Rune. And we're trying to offload the Light Sunder for an Ist Rune. But... Yes, but also there's a little twang of guilt there. There's a, there's a little pang of guilt. <laughs> it's pretty, pretty equal trade. Oh, well, there's no guilt anymore. Justin said it's fine. Justin said it's fine, so it's fine. Um, let's do it then. <laughs> let's do it. That's all I needed. My My feelings are absolved. How good was the roll in the Raven to merit a high trade? It was... It's perfect on the dexterity, but a crap attack rating roll. But like, the attack rating doesn't matter if you're a, a caster, right? He, he made the offer, I'd take zero guilt. Yeah, it's different though when you're a streamer though, you know, because you guys are so, you guys are so kind and like so, so generous. So sometimes there are some just, I'm just basically receiving free right now. You know, there are some just ridiculous trades. Um, but this one's, this one's just a little, this one's just a little, uh, a little one-sided, just a smidge. Just a smidge, just a dash. Enough that I can live with it. What's up, Brad? Oh, actually, no, that's a good point. That's a good point. Yeah, that's a good point. We've, we've run, we've run, and we will continue to run Ubers for spawn. So. That, that's, that's, that's a good point. This is fair. This is fair. Let me know, uh, let, let me know when you're on spawn and we'll, um, we'll do some trades, man. I'm going to do something very embarrassing though, bros. Very embarrassing. <laughs> it's not actually that embarrassing. Letting it with PC right now, okay. I like because just I might use some footage in the video of like doing the trades. But for the trades, like to record the footage, like I'm gonna turn the camera off and like the run counter off and everything just to keep it consistent. With the rest of the footage, so <laughs> just to give you a forewarning. <laughs> um, again, one of those things that like no one else would fucking care about, but my autistic little brain is like, it must be the same. It must be the same, or else the video is ruined. <laughs> Let's go. I'm in the video. Yeah, your name will be in it, dog. You're fully geared so you don't care about loots anymore. I'm kind of the same, man. After I got the grief, it's kind of like, ah, oh, the rest is just extra. Found anything yet? Yeah, this stream we found... Uh, a Ravenfrost, a Galrune, a Perfect Cold Sunder, a 74 Light Sunder, an Elemental Skiller with 6 decks. Uh, I think they're the best things we found this stream. Oh, brutal green diadem. Yeah, that's... That never feels good, does it? Sure, we have one grave, but what about a second grave? Yeah, true. Well, the thing that I really wanted... I, like, I just wanted to get geared enough where I could start filming videos, you know what I mean? Like, farming efficiently where it wasn't killing me to, uh... To do heaps of runs. Like, once we hit that point... I'm golden. It would be nice to get a bit more magic pine though. Like to get a better gauge would be nice. But I kind of want to find it rather than trade for it. Is it jar in the last stream? No, the jar was off stream. Yeah, I did 450 runs off stream. 
uh, over the past two days. Yes, just recharging the old social battery. We're recharged, baby. We're ready to go. Drop a row of minus five ID scrolls. Oh, TP scrolls even. These are normally rejuvies, two rows of rejuvies, but I chewed through them all doing, um, during, uh, terrorized. The terrorized hour. Let's just play seven loot trick. Dude, to do that online would take so much coordination. It's like if you if you go through the trouble of doing that online, you deserve it. You know what I mean? You deserve it. Single player though, yeah, that's a different story. Single player, <laughs> that's not hard at all. <laughs> it's kind of annoying. Now everyone's gonna claim that I'm doing that in my videos. Whenever I get super lucky. <laughs> oh well. It's just engagement. Think about it like that. It's just engagement. Did they drop a jar? They dropped a jar. Natty jar. Were you recording? I was recording, yeah. Thankfully. You can always see. Sometimes I edit it out. Whenever I drop something really good, if you watch my eyes really closely, you can see they always just flick to the left for a second just to make sure I'm recording just out of instinct because I've been burnt before with the freaking death fathom I got burnt in my second video ever I got burnt with the Shaco wasn't recording with the Shaco that one stung so bad because at the time like a Shaco was like that's the best thing I've literally ever found You have time for my first Ubis ever? Get my Alibaba. Wait, how do you mean? Like, do you need help running it? Or, um... Like, do you need help running it? Is that what you mean, Black Lotus? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it, man. You have the keys? Let's do it. It's your first one ever. So we can do it together, bro. We can do it we can do it together. Do you wanna make a game? On uh do you wanna make a game on the Americas? And in hell mode? And I'll come in and we'll do it together. With the with the Pally. What class are you, Black Lotus? <laughs> oh, oh, what what I do here? Such a viewer friendly streamer. Can you can you imagine being the opposite of that? <laughs> Just sounds like a shit time. <laughs> Although admittedly tax cuts tax cuts. Someone Someone donated, was insanely generous at the start of the stream, and the first thing I did was call them a rat bag. So, keep that in mind. Keep that in mind. Apologies, Giga Chat. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, bros. Thanks for saying that, dude. I heard a charm. I heard a charm. Ooh, Grandy, nice. All these last yeah, the grand. Just have a quick snoop on tradery because I do not trust the freaking nodies at all. Literally, don't trust them at all. Yeah, we're good. You're assassin. Okay, perfect. Are you trap assassin? Because that could help. That could be great. If you're a trap assassin, then uh, then I'll just be smacking away with my shield. You hang back. 
and then just lay traps. That's a strap, man. We gotta nut it out. We gotta nut it out. Come up with a game plan. Oh, hell yeah, Spawn. Let's do it, baby. Let's do it. So what are we giving you? We're giving you perfect deck Ravenfrost and 74 Light Thunder. On my way, homie slice. Okay, I know this is so lame, bros, but I'm just gonna go, I'm just gonna disappear for a moment. Just so it's consistent in the video. I'll be right back though. I'll be right back. I'm still here. Oh no, wrong one. <laughs> wrong one. Okay. Oh, look how clean this looks. No clutter on the screen. Wow, so clean. You guys better appreciate this shot in the vid. Oh, thank you, Spawn. Beautiful. Beautiful. We got it. We got what we came for. All right, let's get it all back up. Here I am. Are <laughs> you chip? Yeah. <laughs> Another Vex, baby. We're getting closer, man. Who's talking? Who is this? All right, and uh, Black Lotus is ready to go. Okay. So what I gotta do, I just gotta switch over some, some gear, Black Lotus. Um, but I'll come into your game. But I'll, I'll have to leave and rejoin and stuff. GG trade. That was a good trade. That was... That was... That was very generous on Spawn's end. Um, okay, we'll need that. Maybe we use the Metal Grid? Um, I think that's our best Annie. That one's kind of hard to trot. I think we've got a dwarf, but let's put another one just in case. Um, I don't think we need spirits for anything. And the rest you should still have access to. All right, I'll be back with the... Um, Oh, it's Farmy! Oh, hell yeah, dude. Yeah, we know Farmy. <clears throat> yeah, Farmy was in the, the last stream. Can you please say you're short on swap? You missed it? They're ja they were just um spirit swords. Yeah. Just spirit swords. Okay. Get the grief. Got a pally torch. Put the attribute one on instead. Oh, we can't wear that yet. Got a dwarf, got a raven, got a tea gods. I actually found this from. I actually found this from Trav. Forgot about that. Still got a spirit in an in an Akarantage. <laughs> so embarrassing. Um, got a Dungos as well. Let me put the Dungos on. Thirteen on the DL, perfect forty on the Vitality. Pretty sick. And then there was like. Life charms that we found as well, right? 19 life. That nice life. 18 life. Let me put this away for a moment. All right, Farmy. Let's go, Broski. All right, you want to open the port portals, Farmy? It's your first time ever. So you just put one of each into the cube. And then open all three portals. Oh, we need an amulet. Good goal. Uh, the, we had a sick resistance one. There, yeah, that one. Eagle emblem. And we got a telly staff. Sick. All right. Okay. What I'm going to do, Farmy, is I'm going to go into the Forgotten Sands and I'm just going to make sure he's there, okay? And then once I've confirmed he's there, then then we can go in together, okay? Man, this doesn't really work that well with a bit of stream delay, but... Uh... Whoa! He's there! He's there! He's there! He's there! <laughs> okay, perfect. 
Perfect, perfect, perfect. <laughs> okay. Oh no, 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 he's so gonna die. <laughs> Don't die, Farmy. <laughs> Don't die. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let's just go in. Let's go in and help him. It's a hot team. I know I bricked it. I know. I know. I murdered him. Oh no, he's been running around alone. Let's go, Farmy. I will save you. Get the traps going, baby. Oh, hell yeah, dog. Look at that wombo combo. Hell yeah, dude. Dream team, baby. Absolute dream team. Easy mode. All yours, Fami. Nice. Let's do... Let's do... Let's walk furnace next. Great job, baby. Great job. Leave that for him. Even though we definitely need it more than he does. Let's wait for him. Don't want to go without our... Uh, without a homie. Calling a 1720 torch now. <laughs> Bro, I've had the shittest luck with torch IDs this season. <laughs> and I feel so bad because like more than half of them have not been for me. Rocking the spirit and area shield, no shame. Hell yeah, dog. You're probably a hammer then, though, where it doesn't matter. Okay. Let's just walk it. Don't need to be greed. Whoops. Man, I would love a freaking Drax so badly, man. Or exile, or just... Um, Fami? Where are you? Where is he? Okay. My backup? <laughs> Where's my backup, Fami? <laughs> I can't do this alone, Fami! Oh, he's here. Oh, thank God. <laughs> oh, don't leave me like that. I need you, man. Nice. Like the trap damage is actually so useful. Like, like unironically, like very useful. Revenge for leaving Jarrell to cheat. <laughs> yeah, true. That was, that was a BM. That was a freaking BM, uh, a BM portal for sure. <laughs> oh man, some death traps would be so hot right now. Oh, he's on it. He's on it. Freaking death sentries. Pop, pop, baby. Out of here, dude. Give me, give me a wall I can smack you against. That's better. Smack your lamb. Damn smacker. All right, let's keep rolling. Okay, good thing is we can just ignore those bros to the right, farmy. Can a jar drop in terrorized Tristram? It can drop in non-terrorized Trist. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. I thought I thought I was talking about Trav. Terrorized Tristram. Yeah, it should be able to. Yeah. Yeah, everything can drop in uh in terror zones. As long as you're high enough level. Yeah. Yeah, I saw a clip once of this other Diablo con content creator. I his name escaped me right now. I feel so bad. Um who found a Griffins in Cold Plains. And I was like, what? Excuse me? Okay, I think what we do here 
is I'm gonna just get a telly, and then I'll give you, I'll pop a TP for you, all right? Mr. Lammer. Uh, now is this? Uh, he was on YouTube. I can't remember his name. One of you guys actually recommended him to me. He's like a, a smaller um, content creator, but he's got a really nice, really nice energy about him. Okay, TP's up, kind of hot, but not as hot as the last one. <clears throat> In fact, nothing was as hot as the last one. I should have kept that freaking uh, telecharged circlet, hey bros. Alright, we're almost there, broski. Barricade? No, it's not barricade. Bro, I I was talking about this on stream the other day. I was lurking in one of barricade streams on Twitch. And he is the best Diablo 2 streamer there is. And it's not even close. It's not even close. His energy, his... Oh, everything is so good. It's not even close. Okay, okay, he's gonna come. He's gonna teleport over. Okay, be ready. We'll just clear, we'll clear the area. You can do it, Is Come on, bro. You can, you can jump that, bro. Let's pop a safety just in case. Maybe we walk around. Oh, there he is! There he is! Let's go, Farmy! Dial in here, Farmy! Play the traps, baby! All you. All you, baby! Oh, yes! Hit him with the fire traps. I love it. Big damage, big damage, big damage, big damage, big damage, big damage, big damage. Oh, is he down? Nice, dog. Get the brain, get the brain. All right, let's peel out. Woo! Two miners down, Farmy. Great job. Excellent job so far. Excellent stuff. Definitely don't need all of these. Ain't no energy like schmuck energy. Bro, he puts my energy to shame, dog. He's like schmuck on crack. But like in a good way, you know? In a good way. Not like I'm gonna steal your wallet kind of way. But like schmuck on crack when he's in form. Um, <clears throat> all right, let's do the hard one. Matron Stan. Alright, I think we just go slow and slow and steady here, Flammy. We just walk it. We just want to keep fanging it left. Some cool looking boots you have there. Pretty decent. 38 fire res. Not bad. Probably almost due for an upgrade. <laughs> what do most smiters use? Actually, know what, what do most smiters use? Probably just good, good rare boots, right? I know Hamidens like Trek sometimes. Oh no! Find me down, boys! <laughs> that still is money. <laughs> uh, I'm just kidding. Whoa. Yeah, these guys just do a truckload of damage. God, I'm, I'm almost gonna die here. Okay, the TP is hot. The TP is kind of hot. This is good, this is good, we funnel them. D1 door strat farmy. This is how it's done. Just cheese up a storm. Just keep cheesing, baby. Always be cheesing. Can never forget the ABCs. But I miss having house so much. Whoa! Oh no, find me down! <laughs> that was kind of my fault. I feel like I kind of lured them over. I take, I take responsibility for that one, dog. All right. Let's just clear this together, broski. If you if you have death sentries, then that actually be pretty hot to pop the corpses. You might not have it max yet, though. Right, let's go. Salvaged.
has a hot room. I'm actually going to yonk a couple of these. Sorry. I know they're yours, but like, we're a team. We're a team here. Oh, gauze. Obviously gauze. Oh my god. Gauze or freaking Jitos. What, what am I thinking? God, I'm not thinking. <laughs> Such an obvious answer. Gauze or Jitos, obviously. My bad. <laughs> my bad. God, I would have sounded like such an idiot then. It's like... The most common knowledge thing. Oh, I'm so embarrassed. Do we not have the life tap up there? God, I should really, should really put, like, a couple into, um... A couple into uh, zeal or something. You guys were suggesting that the other day. It's probably a good call. But then it's also like once you've got the enigma, it's like, oh, you can just teleport straight there anyway. You know, you have a drinking problem when you're yolking pots from a dead mate. Yeah. <laughs> We're a team though, we're a team. We're just sharing, we're pooling resources, that's all it is. We're pooling resources. Alright, so we just want to keep fanging it left, Fami. Keep fa fanging it left. It's basically the tower, the tower uh, layout. Hopefully she's close though. Sometimes you can get scrooched in the nooch with these maps. Whoop, let's funnel this. to lay out. Coming. I'm coming. Alright, we're good. Nicely done. Let's pop a safety. Is that the last one? No, we got 12 more. Oh. Scary dudes. God, I want an XL so badly. We need this. I wonder how long that's been out for. Come over here. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Alright, Fami's just chilling, playing it safe. I like it. Okay, not this way. I think we fang it back here, broski. Let's go this way. <clears throat> Let's just run past these dudes, I reckon. Come in here. Nice, nice, nice. there? Nope. Wait, did fuck? Oh, he's got telly stuff. Okay, let's clear this. This guy's gonna be annoying. Oh, man, the traps. He's got the Merc too. So useful doing this with a friend. Nice, Fami. Bro, I feel like I'm useless here, honestly. I'm just being carried. Being hard carried. <laughs> Is this I Love MF? <laughs> may as well be, dude. It honestly may as well be. He mainly plays hardcore now, right? I haven't watched his most recent video, but I love his videos. Okay, Fami, we've had shit luck here, dog. We've almost explored the whole map, but that's good. That's good, because it means she's close. It means she's close. 
And better, better go slow and steady. Okay, she's in here. She's in here. She's in here. Okay, we need to come up with a strategy. We need to come up with a strat. I'm thinking... Oh, that's a good strat. Yeah, that's a, that's a good strat. Yep, I like that. That, that. That'll do. I think we go back to town. We drink lots of... We drink lots of uh, antidote potions. I'll pop a fade, and then we lure her out. That's what I'm thinking, because there's lots of succubi in there with her as well. Let me just pop this fade. <clears throat> you got a nick, but not yet. Not yet. We're kind of close there. We're, we're a little bit less than a low rune away. Yeah. We're just helping, um, helping out one of you dudes do Ubers for the first time. Can you show items, please, for one sec? Sure, 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 sure. We have Grief, G-Face. Should probably put something different in there. Uh, treachery and Duress. Uh, just Resistance is here. We've got a shitty Spirit here. Some shitty Boots here. Uh, Raven Frost. Pretty nice Dungos. Dwarf Star and these really nice Crushing Blow Gloves. With just Life Tap and Ancient Pledge on Switch. And then Pally, Annie survivability stuff. This is kind of nice. Seven all rares. Congrats on the low rune. Thanks, man. Yeah, the low rune we traded some 220 Javazon gloves for. But then I found another low rune not long after at Trav. And a jar rune. We'll just take a, qu a quick break from Trav. All right, Fami, you remember the plan. We tried to bait her out. We fight her out here in the open. All right, let's go, Broski. Dial in, dial in. Jebait, Jebait, Jebait. Come, 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 come. There she goes. There she comes. There she comes. All right, out here, out here. Let's get her away from the sucky bye. Okay, this is perfect. This is perfect, Fami. We're on here. Nice, bra. Big damage, big damage, big damage. She absolutely melts to fire damage, Fami. Oh, yes. Look at this. Oh, man. She's no match for our strategy. We simply outsmarted her. Went straight up Shikamaru on her ass. Hell yeah, baby. Oh, no. Life taps one off. <laughs> Life taps one off, but we're so close. <laughs> That'll do. That's why we had the four rejuves. Nice, baby. All right, we're on. Let's crack it open, Fami. Let's crack it open. Um, I'm going to fang this one on. And yeah, that should be fine. <clears throat> All right. So here's the plan, here's the plan, here's the plan, here's the plan. So we, you can follow me if you like, but we're gonna sneak around the back of the house. We're gonna sneakily debate out Mephisto so he's away from the other bros. And then we're gonna smack him in the lamp, basically. Although he's gonna have heaps of minions. So it's probably gonna be important for you just to stay moving, all right? And we might die here. There's a very real possibility we die here. All right. But just follow me, baby. Let's do it. Got everything ready to go. Let's go. We're going to sneak around here. I'm actually going to put this on. Be real sneaky sneaks. Steady. Steady. All right. You've got to come with me, man. It's not going to work unless you come with me. We're a team. We're in this together. Good job. Great job. Great job. Good distance. Here he comes. Let's get out. Let's get out. Into the open. Into the open. Okay, we've got the life tap on. Engage. Nice, dude. Perfect. Stay mobile. Keep moving. Stay moving. Great job, Fami. Absolutely killing it, Fami. Holy hell, dude. Bro, the lightning damage is actually sick. Okay, that life tap is going to go soon. 
Okay. I don't have Fnat on because I went Salvation, so it's a bit slower. But we do have the full rejuvies there. Life tap is off. We've got a couple of full rejuves. Come on. One rejuve left. Nice, dude. Clutch. Absolutely clutch, baby. We did it. We freaking did it, dog. Bro, we freaking did it. Zero deaths. Nicely done. Let's just clear these dudes. Bro, Fami's a freaking El Natural at this. Put me out of a job, man. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> Running over to have a deal with Nick, bro. Yeah. I have actually found. I've found two Vex runes in uh, Furnace of Pain. Can you believe that? Can you believe I've never used the jacuzzi? <laughs> Not one, but two Vex runes farming Izzy. Just from the minions around him. Robbie's called it earlier. The uh, 1720 torch. Alright, alright, alright. Alright, so. Next phase, Fami. I'm just going to put the, uh, the G face back on. <clears throat> just going to put the G face back on, but here's the plan. Alright? Here's the plan. come to you no worries here's a plan we go swing it around the back of the house we get bail to teleport us the bail jebate and then we get the double jebate so he's just a bit further away from diablo okay remember that not one jebate double jebate and broski thank you so much dog oh my god he knows me well a man after my own heart let's go farmy Oh, thank you, baby. So good. So freaking good. All right, let's go. Dream team. Come, come. We'll wait for him. Let's go, baby. Stick with me. Do we have charges yet? This way. Remember? Not the single debate, the double debate. Remember this. Okay, Bale's over here. Single Jebate. Double Jebate. Absolute pro. Absolute pro, dude. I'll take the aggro. Let's go, baby. Nice, dude. Hey, we got a level. That's sick. Um, let's go here. Let's go here. All right. Let's just charge into the fray. Into the fray, bro. Victory is is within our grasp. Nice, farmy. What's that lightning dog? He's on it. He's on it. I don't need to tell him. He's on it. Nice, broski. Big damage. Freaking huge damage. Okay, life tap is almost off. But it's okay. We got all of this these glorious rejuvies. Woo! Life tap's off. We got him. Oh, we got him. <laughs> and they got me. Nice work, dude. Okay, now with the hardest bit. We just have to secure the torch. We just don't need to secure the torch. Hey, we got two standard heroes. That's so cute. <laughs> One each. <laughs> okay. Steady, steady, steady. Mew. <laughs> nice work, bro. It's all yours. Grab it. Get in, get out. Smash and grab. Okay, let's peel out. Our job here is done. Our job here is done. Beautiful. And since this is your first ever torch dog, you identify this one, man. You identify this one. But just tell us what it is. You ID it and then show it to us after. Just so stream can see. We can't we can't steal that from someone, their first ever torch ID. We simply cannot take that. It's your job. Alright. <laughs> alright, alright, when you put it like that. 
<laughs> you can't be slacking, man. You can't be slacking. All right, here we go. Thanks, man. All right, for farming. First ever torch. Can we get a 2020 sin? Oh, no, I tried. I tried. I didn't want to ID it, man. I've had the worst luck all season. We did our boy dirty, man. We did our boy so dirty. Oh, I'm so sorry. This is for you. Sorry, man. Oh, no. It's not even close. That's stiff. That's rough, man. I don't think we've we uh we have an assassin one to give away. I don't think so. I wish we did. Um, but alas. How dare you? <laughs> yeah, that was really fun. That was really fun. Um, okay, what do we need to get back onto our um What do we need to get back onto our uh our hawker? Uh, what did we switch over? I don't think there's too much we switched over. Obviously just the grief, the tretch. And then this stuff is here. Oh, you gave him a Sinelli Barbar. <laughs> Thanks, man. True. We might actually use this. When, when, we, when we find a Trang's belt, we'll actually use this. Thank you, man. Enjoy, dude. Congrats again. First Ubers. Thanks for nothing. It's a stat stick. It's a stat stick. <laughs> yeah. You let the temptation get the better of you. I tried. I tried to let him ID it. But uh, he said it's my job. I'm not sure. My head was probably blocking it in, uh, in game chat. Yeah. Thanks for all the content. Hey, my pleasure, man. I, um, I have a lot of fun doing this. If you, if you can't tell. My pleasure. Thanks for being a member for eight fucking months, bro. Thank you, dog. There, yeah, was it uh, 12? Was it 17, 12? I mean, I'm trying to be glass half full, but that, let's be honest, that torch fucking sucked. So, <laughs> there's no way around it. Oh, I must have moved a small charm over. Probably wasn't too important. We can just add in... Uh, We have a smallie we can add. No, it doesn't seem so, but I guess we'll we'll just find one along the way. Oh, that little hole there is driving me crazy though. Maybe we put a key there or something. This is gonna drive me nuts. Um that will do. Like that. Beautiful. Thanks again, Tanner. Thank you, man. Alright, let's Get it, uh, get it going again, bros. Let's just see if we got anything going on tradery. No dings. You have a smaller stash. Oh, we do. Oh. Oh, here's one. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Oh, that fits perfectly, dog. Oh, thank you. Woo. <laughs> Woo, thanks. <laughs> the old OCD. <laughs> Have you heard of P7 loot on P1? I have, yeah. Really interesting stuff. Yeah, I think that is really significant for single player. Less so for online, but really significant for single player. You had something in there before? Yeah, I must have moved something over to the smiter. But it shouldn't matter too much because if I moved it over, it wouldn't have had magic find on there. Would have been like some life resistance thing. Oh, I think it was. Yeah, I think it was like 11. It was a fire res one with something else on there. That's what it was. Hey, a lum rune. You like that? Have I messed around with re remodded? No, I haven't. I saw Llama made a video of that too, right? I saw the thumbnail, but I haven't watched the video yet. Yeah. Yoink! <laughs> one to mastery is one max damage. Kind of useful. 
Mastery skillers are actually really good. It's like, because that's one to increase speed. It's one to freaking all res. It's one to a combat mastery. Like that's actually kind of good, man. What's that? An extra 20 damage? Extra 160 attack rating? Extra move speed? Probably not going to keep it in our inventory, but it's pretty decent. And definitely one for the Tapale. Did I hawk this yet? Oh, why did I hit the timer up? Oh, there it is. There we go. Put the right one on. Yeah, thanks, man. Yeah, I, I had the wrong... I've got the timer through, like, a window capture. It looks like this. But I had the wrong window capture. I must have had the uh, stopwatch window capture activated. Good looking out, man. Thanks, dude. Uh, do you want another Alibaba? Oh, thanks, dog. That's okay. I, I, I'm sure we'll find one. And for the moment, one's pretty good. So shout out to Fami for that. Like, we'll use an Alibaba here when we find Trank's belt, I think. Or when we find, like, a Chamroon or something. Maybe. We'll probably just trade the Chamroon to help get to the, um, the Enigma. <clears throat> but if we found a bear and a Chamberon, then, like, might make a Cham Shaker or something. Mastery is his best skill for, for Bard. Yeah, my, I don't, Masteries or War Cries, right? I mean, that would be my, what my intuition tells me. I'm sure it depends. I'm pretty sure War Cries are really high value on Hardcore. Like, obviously we're not on Hardcore. Uh, you started the season with Source. It's been rough. Really squish and super huge mana hungry. Is it just not good to do Source solo? Oh, Source is really good solo. Once you get it online. Yeah, very, very popular season starter. If you're, if you're kind of used to playing with it. You might just be more familiar with, with other classes, right? Um, getting, uh, getting an insight online would really help, probably. Raltir Tal Sol. Can uh, do some Cantest runs and get that online. It is a bit weird source. We are talking with someone earlier. It's like a little bit weird source until, until you get a Sunder. It kind of picks up a bit as well. Like especially a Cold Sunder. Why not Ravenfrost? Yeah, I mean, we could go Ravenfrost, but Ravenfrost has cold damage on it, which means that we shatter corpses. Not always, but sometimes, which means that we can't hawk them. So, honestly, sh the shattering of corpses, it might not be too big a deal. Like, it just happens so infrequently that it might not matter. Uh, that's that's the rationale at least. I haven't actually tried it with a Ravenfrost to see how frequently we actually shatter corpses. That's what I was thinking. Hey, shaft stop. So we care about this if it's ethereal. Ow. Oh. In the bin. Oh, 3%. <laughs> okay. Well, that goes here. Another 3%. And that's in the bin too. I hope no one wants this. If no one wants it, we'll leave it there. Hey, 15 AS. Favorite armor? I'll put it in the stash for the meantime, just in case someone wants it. And we gotta crank this up to 448. 248. Right? Yep. You make me sad by dropping it. It's like, if it was ethereal, I would have kept it. I'll keep it just for you. I'll throw it out off stream. When no one's looking. 
Just pretend you didn't hear that. Shout out to the old Lappy for adding Shaft up to the table. Any good drops? Just tuning in. Welcome to the stream. Yeah, we, um, this stream, the best three drops have been a Galvrune, a perfect 70 Cold Sunder, and a 20 Dexterity Raven Frost been the three best drops to this stream. Although that 1712 Druid Torch is up there. Yell for my torch. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> Good luck, man. Alas, I need the gold, man. We're on the grind. Gal is going towards the Enigma. Towards the Enigma fund. The Give Bob Telly fund. You take drills over Shaft for Merc every day. Yeah. I mean, even Ethereal Shaft Dock, I never use it. Like, honestly, I know this is probably boring. But like the only two th the only two things that I ever really use for Merc are Treachery and Ethereal um, Guardian Angel. I know that's so boring, but that's just that's just the only I don't even really use Fortitude ever. Then I have to spend a, a low rune on the Merc, you know. Just so greedy. <laughs> so greedy. I give him nothing and take from him everything. <laughs> what do you think of the Ubidural drop pool on D4 next season? Uh, I haven't heard the specifics of it. I mean, this is this is what I know, so... If there's anything I'm missing, then you got, you can fill me in before I give my opinion. Is that he has uniques that only he can drop, and he has a significantly higher chance of dropping super uniques. In that they're actually going to drop. That's that's what I know about it. Is there is there more information than that? Because, whoa, 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 why are we almost dead? Oh, hello. Oh, for Nat with Amp. That's why. I feel like with Cancel, you just need to get a couple pickoffs and then it kind of snowballs. But it's like, if you can't get that first kill and they keep healing each other, then it's just so annoying, you know? Like, once you get a couple of kills and it just snowballs. It's one of the things that was really annoying me when I was running these pre-grief it's just like, oh man, it just I'm so I'm too slow that they just keep healing each other. Do you use wealth in your bub? I don't I we probably should though, honestly. I mean the treachery is like I, I, I don't even know if it's doing anything. Like surely forty five increased attack speed is getting us to the next breakpoint. But I just kind of had it there, just cause. So we could almost certainly put some better, some better armor on. It's working good enough. Our magic find is fine, two fifty. So fade's also not terrible. Sweetfield was running with an obedience thresher is rough. Yeah, I actually tried that ex exact thing. I tried. Um, I tried obedience. I tried full or more kings. I tried unbending will, and like it works. Like you can do it. It's just, it was just killing me a little bit inside. So I waited to. I waited an extra day until we had the grief before starting this. Um, you use the name on your own path. Yeah. Well, <laughs> we will soon. We will be there soon. 
Oh, I can't believe freaking Pally got a J mod today. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, I love, I love that they have included Ubers into D4. I think that's exactly what the game needed. 110, so close. Halfway there. I mean, the game needs lots of things, but that was a gaping hole in the game. Was end game content and good chase items. And by adding stuff like Uber Duriel, end game content, I love how it's kind of like more of a PoE system. Um, I, I do love in D2 how you can go straight to the boss, right? You can go straight to Mav, you can kill him. You know, with, with Chaos, you go straight to Chaos Sanctuary, you pop the seals. Bale, similar, you kill the waves. Like, you can go straight there and do the boss for the most part, right? But with PoE, it's kind of like you collect different, you know, things to give you access to the boss. Like, you gotta do some progression towards getting access to the boss fight again. And it sounds like Dural's a bit more like that, which I, I think is fine. I think that's awesome. And... Yeah, I think in on the whole, it sounds really good. It's definitely should have been there at launch, but that's okay, as long as the game's getting better now. Um, but also need to get my hands on it and see how it how it feels rather than how it sounds. But I think ultimately the game is heading in the right direction, but obviously it's got a long way to go, right? Oh, 6 ED. Huge. Is J mod rarer than Tyrael's? That's a good question. I don't know. But it's comparable. It's comparable for more, for sure. I don't actually know. It's definitely worth it a million times more than Tyrael's. We were looking it up beforehand. And like at the end of last season, J mods were trading for like 25 to 35 Jar runes. And then at the start of the season, one traded two days ago for five Bear runes. Um, but a J-Mod is a blue monarch. And it's a blue monarch with specific traits on it. So, J-Mod stands for, like, Jeweler's Monarch of Deflecting. So, it's got... It's a blue magic monarch with four sockets. And, what is it? 20% increased chance of blocking. And 30% faster block rate. And the reason why it's so good is because people put like five, five, five facets in it. But they can still get like max block much more easily. It's more of a PvP thing. Like an ultra high end PvP thing. But it, insanely rare, insanely expensive. You know your stuff. I, I only know my stuff because of you guys teach me so much. Like, funnily enough, when I... My last video of running Trav was my 1,000 subscriber special. I ran Trav for 24 hours straight. And I got so many comments about Jmod specifically. Because I wasn't picking them up. I wasn't picking up Blue Monarchs. And that's because I didn't really know what they were. I'd heard of them before, but I didn't really know exactly what they were and that's how i learned it yeah. from you bros you have to be willing to be a fool as the saying goes yeah but they, they're just so rare man unbelievably rare Hell of a stream thus far. You have to catch the rest on the VOD. Hey, thanks for, thanks for ha hanging out, Robbie. You've been here for the past almost five hours, dude. In fact, you've probably been here for five hours because we had the, like, little stream upcoming thing for a little while, too. You're so tired. Uh, GG chat. Y'all have a good one. Yeah, thanks for tuning in, man. Sleep well. Sleep, sleep well, dude. Can we get a 45? No, we can't get 45. Can we get a 40 life peak home? For Rob. Oh no! No way! You've got to be kidding me, Rob! What the hell? Warcry's 35 live! <laughs> no shot! No freaking way, dude! You've got to be kidding me!
kidding me, man? Holy hell. What the hell is that? This is some pre-recorded bullshit. You've got to be freaking kidding me, dude. What the hell? Oh, man. I'm about to ban myself at this point. This is insane. No. No, man. What the hell is this? What the hell, bro? Get out of town. Get out of town and get into my inventory. Let's make room for that. What the hell? Wait, I don't even want to drop it in case we DC. Okay, we'll, we'll look at the boots like this. Holy shit, bro. Let's look that up on Tradery, man. Wait. <laughs> yeah, let's sell that shit. I'm not giving it. Let's sell it. <laughs> let's sell it. <laughs> what the fuck? Bro. Bro. <laughs> what kind of... Oh, what kind of fucking hacks is that? What the shit, dude? More cries with live. Let's go. I just want to snoop how much they're worth. How much they're going for. We're just saying these are like the most expensive ones on hardcore. But like, obviously we're softcore gamers. Recent trades. Bro, East Rune, are you insane? What? No, East Rune? No, what? Gull of Vex? Vex? What? No way! Come on now! Come on now, bro! I wanted so much more than that! What? Wait, if we go up to 45... Oh, the difference between 30 and 40 is nuts. Wait, if we do this... Six bear runes! Are you fucking kidding me, man? Oh, that's at the end of September. Okay, so that's last season. Oh my god. Freaking eight life is the difference between an East rune and six bear runes. Jesus Christ. What the hell is this shit? Wait a week? Let's wait it out, bros. Let's wait it out. Let's wait it out. Jesus Christ. Get that freaking bot money, baby. And then we can do stream giveaway. The disappointment, I know. Still insane. I mean, we just found a Vectorune effectively, but way more exciting. Jesus Christ, that is probably one of the most memorable moments I've ever had in Diablo. And then, uh, was any of you there? Like when we rolled the War Cries with life? Were any of you there when that happened? That was also some cookery. That's my scripted luck. Bro, that's the most scripted shit that's ever happened ever. Lockie was there. That was also so scripted. Because we're re-rolling Grand Charms. And then someone was like, Oh, you should just sell the P-Jams for an Istrun. Which is fair fair play. Like, that's not a bad call. And then I was like, Oh, yeah. But then with this way, we could get, you know, we could get a skiller with life. And that fucking second, we rolled a Warcry's Grand Charm with 43 to life. And got like freaking five hybrids for it. It was insane. And then the same thing happened with this one. The same thing happened with this one. Oh, what the shit, dude? Bro, I can't believe that. I can't fucking believe that. Can you believe? I've never used the jacuzzi. Uh, okay, how do we, how do we do this? How do we do this? How do we do this? What? How can we make room for this? Mm. Maybe we just get rid of the last, the other Warcry one. The poison damage Warcry one. I think that's a play. God damn it, Rob. That was fucking insane, dude. Good luck sleeping now, baby. Holy hell. Is it time for the cube? Nah. I like our strat. Maybe we... Nah, 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 nah. This is good. This is good. This works. But we need these. We should have columns of rejubies. Extra 12 slots. 
I just hate like putting stuff in the cube. Like it's an extra click, you know what I mean? I'm so lazy. But I can't sleep now. <laughs> That's good because that means you're gonna leave again, which seems to be <laughs> when we get the most lucky. Let's milk it. Holy shit, man. God, I'm buzzing. I'm freaking buzzing after that. I can't even. What? That's like an Omrun level of, um, the infamous Omrun that I found in the stony tombs. That was like a message from a, the heavens above being like, Oh, schmuck, you're on the right path. Keep grinding. And I was like, yes, father. Yes, father, I will listen. And here we are. Here we are. Oh, shout out to anyone who remembers that Omrun. Remembers the backstory. Would it be a good idea to write notable find in the top left corner of the screen? It definitely could be. <clears throat> it absolutely could be. And it's definitely something worth considering. Thing is, it's just like... The reason why I, I'm not doing it is a little bit ridiculous. It's just that we're gonna make a magic find video out of this <clears throat> in the coming few days. And I just kind of don't want that on the screen for the video. I know that sounds so so silly and you guys probably don't give a flying fuck, but um, that's the reason why. And it means that you guys, uh, I like it when you guys, I like it when I find something really good and you guys ask me, have I found anything really good? And then I get to say it over and over again. And I'm like, well, yes, just found a skiller with 35 life, you know? <laughs> I get to relive that. <clears throat> Why Travanko runs for the, for the runes? Uh, I just felt like running Trav, yeah. Just felt like running Trav. I like how it's always in the same spot. It's it's a pretty good place to farm. Yeah. What are the charm mods? Well, <laughs> let me tell you. <laughs> Freaking 35 life, baby. Cows are always in the same spot. No, you have to find the uh you gotta find the leg. I mean the stones are always along the path. But it does move that one a little bit. But this this build wouldn't do very well in cows. Would do really well in the pits though. This is mainly a pit circer that we've got here. A pit circer minus the enigma. Give me the booties. I can't, I can't fucking believe that happened. <laughs> 35 life. Like, not just a skiller. A skiller with 35 life. <laughs> what? <laughs> what kind of sorcery is this? I'm bad. <clears throat> oh yeah, Sam, for sure. For sure, yeah, light skill with 35 life would be just worth a truckload. We actually had a funny story about light skiller with um I think it was 33 to life when we we're on stream and it was like right at the right at the, right at the start of stream. We we're doing a thousand bail runs and I was just saying, like, li literally in the process of saying, like, oh, this is going to be a chill stream, like, a perfect sort of stream if you just, like, want to chuck it up on the side or, like, white noise if you're going to sleep or something. And then as I was saying that, I, I identified the Grand Charm and just fucking obviously screamed because <laughs> of <a> light skiller. 
<laughs> With 33 to life. <laughs> I was like, wake the fuck up, boys. <laughs> this isn't a chill stream anymore. This isn't a chill stream anymore. Just the timing. Impeccable timing. Pre-recorded scripted timing. You were there? Hell yeah. I think Kano was there as well. This video should be Hawk Marathon. Season 1, you rolled over 10,000 perfects on Grand Charms. Damn. Any good ones? Best one for 45 life uh, war cries. Hell yeah, dude. 35 life of a light scaler. Amazing. She's 10,000 gems. Did you... How do you get the gems? Did you trade for them or... Farm them yourself? Just the... Uh, the inventory management of having 10,000 of anything is insane. So many gem, gem mules. I guess you just do them systematically. Um, snoop the horny helm. Get a six boo. Oh, it's true. You're willing, willing and dealing. Nice. You want your skills with 7% faster run walk over life? True. I mean, I guess... I guess if it's source, I would take the life. I'm just telling ev everywhere. For a, for a bob, the... The run walk could be nice. I mean, it'd definitely be nice for us right now. I mean, I guess everyone has to run, run in town. Rob, two for two. <clears throat> Economy's dead. It is. It's very. It's, it's slow on tradery for sure. Yeah. Definitely slow. It's it's hard to offload things, unless it's like something super common or you're selling it for a good price. Like I found four Shakos, Lum Rune, and I've all I put them up as Is runes, and they've all sold like immediately. Probably because they're worth just a smidge over an Ist. <clears throat> what bill is this? You're new to D two. Hey, welcome, man. Now this is called a um. It's basically a Berserk build. Using this skill. A lot of people call them pit zerkers because they often farm in the pit. But we are not in the pit, we're in Trav. So basically we're just smacking them with this, which converts all that physical damage to magic damage. And we got some war cries to give us heaps more life. And then after that, we used find item on the corpses. Which is what we're doing when it we're kind of like looking like we're humping and yes yeah, a sweet build it's a really good build it really shines once you have this item a grief really shines when you have a grief but also most things shine when you have a grief almost everything in fact I can't believe that, dude. Holy hell. I'm still, I'm still reeling from it. Thanks, mate. Love your content. Oh, thanks, dude. Yeah, welcome to, uh, welcome to the game, dude. Hit us up if you've got any easy questions. Only the easy ones, though. If you've got hard questions, I'll direct you somewhere else. Throw Ginger under the bus. Ah, just go eat. Go ask Ginger. <laughs> too too difficult. I'll take all the I'll field all the easy ones. <laughs> How do you count the runs automatically? Uh I'm not it's not actually automatic. I'm controlling it with key commands. Black Hades. But I'm just so used to doing the key commands that I do it without thinking. But I'm using this little run timer. But I'm pressing like Alt Q to start a new run. You 
much time. It's just the key command I set it up as. And I think um, if you want a link to the magic find timer, then Sweet Phil's got a good got a good video on it, which is where I got it from. All right, let's check uh, Black Hades in the in the table. Black Hades, absolute terrible item for how rare it is. <laughs> Cheese tags. <clears throat> Were you here for the um, the latest Grand Charm Cheese tags? God damn. I got your stash, bro. Sorry, but it actually hurts the head. Wait, this is this this is the organized stash. What do you mean? I freaking organized it for you, dude. Dudes, I've got all of the gems on one one tab. I've got like all of our rooms on another tab, and then everything else in between. I literally just cleaned my room for you guys specifically. Whoop. It is a little, it has got, it has got a little out of order recently, hasn't it? Did you water your plants? Oh, I actually need to do that. Good call. I actually need to water them. It's been a couple days. Yeah. <laughs> Actilion. <laughs> Can you believe I never used the jacuzzi? <laughs> yeah, look at that. Look how organized that is. Even color coded. And this is just like a hybrid. Another hybrid, and then runes. Like it's beautiful. What are you? What are you, what are you, what are you talking about? It's organized chaos. Highest room you found so far? Last night I found a jar rune. Thank you for asking. A natty jar rune. Didn't even hawk it. It was right here. It dropped right here, right in this spot, right where that hydra is. Seeing the J on the ground is insane. Because there's no J in any other room, you know? So the second you see that J, you're just like... Ooh! You see the J and your, your jar drops. Such a mess. Bro, I know where everything is. I know where everything is. Closet organizing simulator. <laughs> we actually do need to clean it up a bit. Or like make a, make a P-Gem mule. Because, like, I'm keeping them all so we can keep track of how many we found throughout the Trev runs. And then maybe re-roll some stuff at the end. Magic find on there. It all needs to be pretty lines. <laughs> what weapons are you running? We got, uh... We've got Grief is the, the main weapon. And then I just have Spirits on Switch for the Warcries and then the, the Hawken. Don't have, um, don't have Heart of the Oaks, which would give us two more all skills. Decided to go with the Spirits instead of Alibaba's for um, our purposes. Can you show gear real quick? Sure. We'll do it after this run. Quick, um, quick gear checker rune ski. Also, if you want, if you want to look over it again, then we looked over it three minutes into the into the stream. But we'll we'll do a gear check after this one. Some advice on skills I should use with my Paladin through Normal and Nightmare. Okay, so what I normally do with Paladins is through Normal. If we're doing one to Ubers, that would be kind of nice. Through Normal, I do Holy Fire, and that should carry you through Normal, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. So like have Holy Fire, and then hit things with like, a level five zeal or something 
and then with extra points you can put them into um, like resist fire for the holy fire synergy. If you're golden through normal and half of nightmare like that. Then after that, I would respec in either Blessed Hammer or Fist of the Heavens slash Holy Bolt. But usually Blessed Hammer. That's what I normally do. So around level 30-ish. Switch from Holy Fire to Blessed Hammer. So with Blessed Hammer, the most important skills are Blessed Hammer and also Concentration and Vigor. And then Defiance last. But just focus on those, those three. <clears throat> That's what I normally do. Lots of ways to um lots of ways to do it though. But here is our very mixed bag of gear bros. We have a grief with a pretty bad roll. 349, but decent IAS. We've got four piece immortal kings. Just because. Hat looked really cool. Which may or may not be a factor. We've got a treachery, a metal grid that we found. With a really nice roll, really well rolled metal grid. We got can't be fro <laughs> can't be frozen on the shield. Um, dwarf star, twenty seven nagel, and on switch I've just got two spirits, so the war criers and the hawken. And then these are mainly now crappy magic find things, except for this one of course, with a barbarian torch and an annie. And that is the setup. Definitely got lots of room for improvement, but um, does the job good enough? I mean, basically, once you get the grief, then the rest is extra, isn't it? Thanks for a lot for the advice. Yeah, all, all good, man. All good. If you got any other questions, please do let me know. You like to reskill to hammers in Act 4 Nightmare? Yeah, that's that's another way to do it. Because Holy Fire carries you really well in Nightmare as well. Up until Act 4, when everything has like really high natural lightning res. I mean fire res. So that, that works really well as well. And it means it means you don't have to go through the maggot layer on Nightmare with Hammers, which is kind of annoying. Ceremonial Javeloon. Would you do an enchant source with a grave? Oh, maybe just for funsies, yeah. Wouldn't be opposed. Especially if we can farm a video out of it. Which is all I really care about. YouTube views, obviously. No, just kidding. It's like third on the list. No, second. No, third. Third on the list. Um, I'm distracted by playing myself. What do you want with grief? A shield? Uh, there's lots of ways that you can... That you can... There's lots of things you can do with grief. Some people... Some people have two griefs. And then they use, like, whirlwind which would be faster than what we're doing, for sure. Probably shave like 20 seconds off each run. Um, a lot of people, and a really good thing for us to do, but I just haven't committed to doing it, is like on the offhand, instead of having a shield, having something that gives us hits of magic find. So either an Alibaba or like a sixth Isted Phase Blade. A lot of people do that. Um, if we work to commit to that, that would mean we'd need the can't be frozen somewhere else. But um, right now we've we've got a rhyme, so that's our source of can't be frozen. It does give us a couple other good things too. It gives us a bit of magic fine. Gives us a bit of all res. So there's lots, lots of different ways to do it. What about a frenzy barb with the grief and the lower bringer? Yeah, I think that would work great for sure. Do 
You make good pace with the Zerg. Yeah, I mean... Average runtime is a minute and 20 seconds. But... Probably like 10 seconds of that is just looking at the ground and like IDing stuff and seeing what we should should or shouldn't be picking up. Oh, double ith. I thought one of those was ist. Damn. <laughs> the double ith. <laughs> Debated. So like this, I meant to pick up all these. For like, um... Like jewelers of or something, I don't know. Something of the whale. I don't even know exactly. Something rare we'll never find, but I should ID him. Oh, two thirties. Secretage. Yeah, I, I saw the secretage. Am I meant to ID that? Am I meant to ID that? Hundred life. Because could a rare, could a rare, I guess the answer is yes. Could a rare sacred Taj be better than like a Hoz? I do rare shakers. No, I, I, there's a lot of rare stuff that I don't ID that I know I should. I was talking about it a little bit before. Like for me, like they, that there becomes a certain point of like checking stuff where it I need to check so much stuff that it's it's like not fun anymore. It feels like a chore. So sometimes there are certain things that I just I just don't check just because it would make me have less fun. Even though I'm meant to check them. If you pick up too many blues, it really cuts into your time. True, yeah. I mean, that's another point as well. Like, is it cost? Is it... Is it more beneficial for you just to keep blasting through more quickly? Jewels of the Whale? True, true. Probably need to do some Cuban soon. You rarely pick up blues. Yeah. I mean, the two blue... Yeah, I'm kind of like... Off stream, I on stream I try to try and be better. But off stream with stuff like... Blue barb helms and blue antlers. Like, because you know, you're meant to pick up the, the barb helms just to try and get that six boo. And like the antlers for like the six NATO. I pick it. I pick them up like probably 60, 60 to seventy percent of the time. Sometimes I see them and it's just like, oh, I just can't be bothered, you know. I just can't be bothered with that one. Like I, I pick them up most of the time. Claws with claws. I would pick up some. I'd I'd pick up. Greater talons and runic talons, but there are some blue claws that I don't bother with. I always get, unless I don't see it, I always get uh, maiden and ceremonial javelins, just for the six forty dream. Feral claws, I don't know. <laughs> Probably if I saw him. Whoop. Blues are the most expensive item in the game though, along with some rares. I know, but it's like... If I was to check every blue that I was meant to, and it's like one in a million, you hit one of the ones that's valuable, and I would just have less fun. That's, that's all it is. And everyone's got a different threshold for when, that, when they've reached that point of them checking too much stuff that means they start having less fun. It just depends where your threshold is. Like, wherever it is, it, that's 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 fine, you know? Don't do something that makes playing a game less fun for you. You know what I mean? 
Um, bro, dude, thank you so much, man. Flow Flotantum. Thank you so much, dog. I really appreciate it. Thanks, man. The truth is, bots, ID the blues everyone sees. Anyway, yeah. <laughs> If you play to trade, you check everything, yeah. I mean, to be honest, to be honest, like, sometimes, sometimes, like, if I'm filming a magic finding video and I'm just not finding anything, like, I'm not finding anything at all, then I would ID everything I'm meant to ID just to maximize the odds. But if I've found, like, heaps of good things already, then I'm probably going to be more lax with it. Yeah, just admittedly. Like, oh... I'll pick up the next antlers, the next blue antlers that rolls like six to life and nothing else on there. The way my noggin works. Just got a free Sin Torch in a Nightmare Rush. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Like, we're gonna check the shit out of these Taloons. Wait, that's so nice. They're rushing you and they gave you a free torch. I swear to god, people have been so nice to me in public games. Like the past week. Like like just just like random people, you know? Just like dropping into a game and be like, hey, do you need a rush? And it's just like, uh oh, yeah. <laughs> No, but I really want one. Thank you. Thank you so much. And they're just like, expect nothing in return. They're just there to help. You know what I mean? Matthias, what's up, man? Fan of the vids? Thanks, dog. First time catching any life? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Yep. Grinds are legendary, bro. I feel insecure about my grinds after watching, uh, after hearing about Pavki just running 10,000 freaking Trav runs just for science. Now, that's a real grinder. He's putting me to shame, dog. How's the gear coming along? Yeah, gear's coming along really well, dude. Really, really well. I'll do a quick once-over for you, just because we checked it very recently. Um, it'll be a, it'll be quick, um, a quick overview. But there's also three minutes into the into the video, we go over it in a little bit more detail. Regular celebrity. It is funny when uh, I'm trading on Tradery and someone's like. Are you the real regular schmuck? <laughs> and I'm like, that's me, baby. <laughs> At least I hope I'm real. <laughs> what is my purpose? I keep having dreams of unicorns. Um, what's the gear setup? We'll, we'll do a quick overview after this run. Uh, let's heavy belt. Enoch, did you like the, <laughs> the little, <laughs> little Blade Runner thing? <laughs> Um, I was hoping there would be one person out there that would appreciate that. This is kind of nice. Here is the gear we have. Reef. We've got four piece of Model Kings. Using Treachery. Metal Grid we found. Prime. Dwarf Star. Nigale. Mainly Magic Fine stuff. Found this like 20 minutes ago. Um, this is the only non-magic find one, I think. And then I've just got two spirits on switch. Yep. And our hawk. Here are the skills. But our hawk is at 52%. Chance to hit. Oh. Got a grief in like 50 runs, got insane start of luck, bro. I've had the best luck. The first 450 runs of Trav were nutty, bro. This is all from Trav. Like some of it we traded for. Like these we got from trading the things we found in Trav. 
four Shakos, five five facet, like a um a Raven Frost and a and a Sunder Charm. But these were all El Naturel finds from Trav. Insane. Insane. Damn. Holy hell. It's getting old Mad Max up in here. Let's get this one. You basically already have your Enigma. We're really close. We're really, really close. Like, we're very close to being able to trade for a bear. Like, if we went all in, we might even be able to now. Please do cubing and tiny. <laughs> the other tabs. We'll do it soon. We'll do it once the... Once it fills up with flawless, then we'll do it. Um, I heard dings. Were there any flawless dings? Oh! Perfect. Nice. I'm probably missing stuff there, but too much to read. What base are you making Enigma? We're going to make it in a mage plate, but I don't have one yet. I'll have a quick snoop on Tradery, see if there's good mage plate deals going. Kind of want to make it in an, in an ED mage plate. Um... If we're going ED, like, may as well hit the 15, you know what I mean? Hmm. Don't want to spend more than a Vex, though. But maybe we organize this after. We see which runes are left over. See which runes are left over after we get a bear rune. And then use that on the base. See if there's got a good any good bear rune deals. Too low, too vex. That's kind of standard. Jar and something else. Rah, come on now. This seems like such a scam. Let me tell you why. It seems like such a scam because this person has no reviews, right? And they're asking for their bear rune. They're asking for five torches. Which means you'd have to trade the torches individually. Because you can only have one in your inventory at once. So... You're going to have to give them unidentified torches before they give you the bear rune. You know what I mean? You can't do it all at once. Would not go near this with a 10-foot pole. Attached to a 100-foot pole. That's how scammy it looks. Good, bros. Yep, so the going rate for bear runes is kind of like two lows, two vex. So... Like, you know, we've got a low and four vex. So we're very close. Very, very close. All right, let's cube. Let's cube. Actually, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get rid of that. More space. More space appeared. And dip after the first torch. Exactly. Yeah, or the third. Or the third. <laughs> yeah. You take a bear and trade for the first torch, then drop the last four. Yeah, I mean, that's how you should do it. That's how you should do it. For sure. Rune bird, what is that? If you if you were going to do it. Don't give them anything for nothing, basically. Um, yeah. Most most people are pretty reliable. If they've got reviews on Tradery, then they're pretty trustworthy. Especially if they've got heaps of them. Like, I remember when I was doing massive torch IDs on stream last season, like, I'd be like, 
go away for two days and then come back with 20 identified torches. I was like wheeling and dealing on tradery the whole time. I'm sure there's stuff I'm missing here. And then sometimes you're just straight up trading with bots. In fact, a lot of the time. And if you traded like a... Sometimes I would trade like a bear rune for like 70 keys of hate. And you just go over to the Asia server, you go into the game, and then it's just a bot that's just dropping 70 freaking keys, like before you give them anything. And you're just like picking up all of the keys, like for ages, like multiple stash stashes full. And then afterwards you give them the bear rune. So <laughs> if you wanted, you could scam them big time, but um, that's just not, it's not worth it in the long run. Also, you, you you play a price with your soul. Oh, is there hunting hunters guys? Oh, sorry, I didn't see it. This we kind of need a loot filter for trap. This is where this is one of the places I think a loot filter would be most beneficial. It's just a lot, especially with these new um. UP7 hacks or exploits. Ashy. What's this one? Blood Moon? Hexfire? Hexfire, that's right. One for the table. You uh, press F sometimes? Yeah, when it's like clogging up the scream, I'd, I'd fang a zoom. Yeah, That really helps in LK as well. That must have been freaking terrifying though, dude. Almost missing a jar rune. Woo! God damn. Can you do a TLDR on the P7 thing? Yes. Yes. So it's mainly relevant for single player. You can, in theory, do it online, but it's just a lot more fiddly because you can't manually control the player's command. You know, you're, you're managing people. Basically what you do is you go in on P1, you spawn them in on P1, then you go one screen away and switch it to P7. And then you wait like five seconds, I think. And then you come back and they'll have P1 health, but they'll give you P7 drops. And a freaking legend, the legend who discovered it, Havki, uh, ran Trav 10,000 times just to confirm it 10 times over with really robust data collection. Shout out to Pavki. Did that, did I get that right? Was there any mistakes in there? Or at least that's what I took from it. But yeah, it's more, it's more, it's more of consequence for single player. Seems like a lot of effort online. Yeah, it wouldn't be worth it online. It wouldn't be worth it unless you're like freaking got a land party, you know? And even if you've got a land party, it, it almost wouldn't be worth it anyway. It's like so much coordination. Like if you do that, then... You deserve the extra drops, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Um Which gear do you use right now? Right now, we're smacking things with the grief and we're hawking with two spirits. But if you want a little bit more detail, then three minutes, exactly three minutes into the stream, we go over all the I tried to hook you guys up with a timestamp, but I don't, I don't think it worked. What have we found today? Ooh, great question. Today we have found a Galrune, a perfect cold sunder, a 74 light sunder, a Raven Frost with 20 dexterity, max roll on the decks. We found a. Warcry skiller with 35 to life. We found an elemental skiller with 6 dexterity. 
And anything I'm missing, bros? I think that's the bulk of it. Did you find the low for grief and trav? No, actually, I did. We did find a low in trav, but that was after the grief, Dennis. How we got the low was actually crazy. It was right before stream. I was running. Um, I needed one more key of hate because it was like a stream when we we're gonna run Ubers. And I needed one more key of hate. So the, the stream was like in the upcoming stage, you know, like the stream starting in eight minutes sort of deal. And I was just fanging, I was fanging um, Arcane to get one more key of hate. And then I found these rare heavy gloves. I did the heavy gloves. They were two to Javan spear skills, 20 IAS, 11 dexterity, 21 magic find. I think there were nine lightning resist and had like a little bit of enhanced enhanced defense on there or something. They were very, very good 220 Javazon gloves. Not like god tier, but very good. And we traded them the next day for low Malrune. Yep. And they made the grief. They were probably worth a bit more. But I just wanted to offload them just so we could get the grief online. Yeah. They were beautiful. Alright, let's go. So, from here on out... Okay, we actually, I actually want to see what this does when we've got the boo on. Whoa. 1 to 42. That's the highest one I've ever found, I think. It goes up to like 99, but I think that's the highest I've ever found. Let's keep that for a minute. I just want to see what happens here. Yeah. So now if we put points into find item, it's every two levels, we get a boost. But every one level into find potion, we get 1%. So just go there. Everything into find potion from here on out. Is 1 to 99 worth anything? I think it's really expensive. Yeah, I remember Cooley talking about them in a uh, in a video once where he implied that it costs heaps of forum gold. It's like not many people would be after them, but I think they are super expensive. Oh, bro, Pally. I can't wait for you to tell people. Can't wait for you to tell Omak right now. You got one in stash? Hell yeah, dog. Or of gold. Yeah, I don't really use JSP myself, but just could not care less if other people use it. In fact, I like people using it because, like, I like people having fun with the game. You know what I mean? Like, if it, if it means you keep playing the game, then uh, go crazy. What runes are we at? Oh, what's up, Lucky? We have a lot of runes, Lucky. We have a Jar rune. We have a Low rune. We have four Vex runes. Four East runes. A Mal rune and a Pal rune. Yeah. And a Gal rune. Excuse me. <laughs> How could I forget? So we're quite close. We could almost like. We could almost like um. Spend all of this for a bear rune, almost. In fact, we probably almost we probably could. But let's just keep running. Oh, nice Rene, super nice boots, max fire, max light. Oh. Holy hell. Really nice. Mixed feeling. I guess my biggest pet peeve is the incentive for body. Yeah, true. True. Yeah. Because there's RMT there, right? Right? Is there? 
I guess it's I don't know I don't know, I don't fully understand how JSP works. Can you withdraw Orum Gold? If for some reason I have it in my head that you can't. Like you can buy it, but you can't with, withdraw it. Am I just making that up? Or is that a thing? How long have you been running trap now? Uh, today's stream has been going for five and a half hours. Uh, 13 hours and 46 minutes total. Yep. So pretty in insane drops for that short amount of time. Started out as a druid and thinking you do hell content now. Hell yeah, man. Only issue is that I barely have any magic finds. What would you recommend for me to farm for some runes? Oh, great question. Love it. It's an easy answer. I would farm Countess. <laughs> I would farm Hell Countess. The best place to get mid runes. To get to get the ball rolling. That's what I would do. So you're not going to get like high runes from Countess, or you can in theory, but it's unbelievably rare. But really good to get all of your mid runes online. Spirits, get lore, get stealth, maybe a treachery for your merc or something, insight for your merc. Oh, good dog and she's pretty easy too even though the reason why we're playing barb right now is because she murdered me but all things considered she's pretty easy uh is trev worth it with low magic find uh what's your magic find at yeah what's low what specifically is low I mean, I think you got to farm somewhere with low magic find eventually, right? So, I would say it's fine. Yeah, as long as you can you can clear it. Sixty percent. Good burn words you could make. I mean, what you could, um, it depends. It, one strategy you could use is you could basically sacrifice your helmet or your armor to crank that magic find up a bit. A lot of things that, a lot of, a lot of times what people do at like the start of a season where they still don't have much much gear on is they just get a three socket helm um like a coronet with three sockets and then put three perfect topazes in there just to get the ball rolling so that would give you like like 78 magic find or something i don't know i don't know exactly what it is which means it'll do it won't do much else for you but it just gets the ball rolling yeah. or some people do the same thing with armor like they just get a four socket armor put uh four perfect topazes in there just to get the ball rolling or you could also if you had a lem rune you could make the rune word wealth but um four socket armor is just as good 72 72 <laughs> thank you <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, oh yeah, chuck the skeletons on, baby. You're set. Oh, yes. Dude, that's it. That's it, man. You're golden. You're golden. Skeleton is one of the best finds you could possibly found. Yeah. Chuck that on, man. And and what I do with skeletons is I take it to Lazik. If you've still got Lazik available, normal nightmare, add a socket to it, and then chuck a perfect topaz in there. Yeah, you're golden, baby. You're good to go. A 
I'd say the grave. Sure. <laughs> sure. Oh, nice hauls, man. Hell yeah, dog. Why treachery instead of hustle? Yeah, that would work too. Yeah, that would work too. I mean, I just had the treachery, so I just chucked it on, basically. Um, what exactly does hustle do? The move speed and the attack speed. Hustle did you are. Hustle could actually be a good caller. Because we're running over there. Run, walk, IES, hit recovery, evade, dex, stamina drain, all res. Shale, co eld. I mean, this has got the gold find, but I prefer the move speed. Let's make a hustle. I like it. Inspired. Good call. Great call. We just need a base. Wait, I'm getting rid of this freaking shaft stop. I'm so sorry. It's gotta go. It's gotta go. Let's see if we've got... Uh, after this run, we see if we've got a base on another character. Why not Myth? Uh, myth is that barb armor, right? Gives you two to barb skills. The other one. What else does that have on there? To be honest, I just haven't put any much thought in it. You know, we, just had, we had the treachery, so I just put on the treachery. That's really all there is to it. Just for a swab? Uh, if we're swapping an armor on, then I just can't be bothered. Yeah, even though that would be min-maxed. Talking after, after the kill? Yeah, I just can't be bothered swapping an armor on, though. I'm, I'm far too lazy for that. But the hustle, I really like the hustle call. We're running over there. I think that's... Glorious. Hopefully we have um, a three socket armor somewhere. We'll see. Have a look at Lamp Smacker. Two. Got anything, Nedge? Damage ring mail. I mean, we could just make it in... Let's just go to let's just go shop one actually let's just go shop a breastplate because it doesn't matter with berserk anyway because we'll have no defense i honestly forgot hustle existed would it be good as an act 5 web <laughs> bro i forget it exists all the time um i don't know if it'll be good as an act 5 weapon Let's just quest it. Let's just quest it. I, I'm sorry if this drives you crazy. But I'm just so lazy. Just unbelievably lazy. For the Fnat. Oh, like as an offhand? Yeah, that could be pretty freaking hot to trot, man. I feel like I really haven't utilized Hustle enough at all. Shale? Do we not have a Shale? Bro, I've left so many shales on the ground. Do we literally not have a shale right now? Is it... Are you flipping my dip? What do we cube to make shales? Is it like ams or something? Wait... <laughs> D2 time. Good. We wouldn't have the chippies either. Three souls with the chip sapphire is a shale. Oh, 
I guess, I guess we just hold out. We hold out till we hit the shell. <laughs> Embarrassing. Honestly, need a search bar instead. Fair of Roots would be kind of nice. Or, or I could just organize them. You know. That's also an option. But organization is frowned upon in uh, Schmuck's dreams. See if Limpsmacker has one. Found a non ethereal great holberg with 14% ED. 580 defense. This is a solid base for fortitude. Sounds solid to me, dog. Um, I guess it depends who's using it, man. Yeah, like if it's going to be for you and your merc. And it's probably, probably decent. But if it's just for your merc, you probably want a high defense one, right? Oh, currency stacking PGMs would be glorious. Big time. Yeah. Especially since all of those PGMs are just going to go onto mules, you know? It's just like, oh, now we're going to use my character slots. We've got limited character slots. You and your Merc? Then that's an excellent base, dog. Yeah. Hell yeah. Especially since you found it yourself. Makes it better since you found it yourself. Everything tastes sweeter when you found it yourself. Except for those blueberries. Do not just walk around eating random blueberries that you find. Don't ask me how I know that. Okie dokie. I saw something good here earlier. Oh, it was a dust shroud. That's right. I knew there was something I was meant to pick up. Good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. <laughs> Thank you for the sympathy laugh, Alesso. <laughs> Thank you <laughs> for the pity laugh. <laughs> Wait, did we make a hustle? No, we've got the base. We just need a shale rune. So, <laughs> we did a shale rune of all things. Um, We found the cove rune earlier. What's the other thing? Is it like an eld or something? Delco Eld. Might need the Eld too. Let's see. Um, what's up, Christopher? Welcome to the stream, man. Best drops yet? Just join the stream. The best drops from the stream today, top three, are a Gull Rune, a Warcry skill with 35 life, and top four, actually, a perfect Cold Sunder. And a Raven Frost, which rolled 20 on the decks. They're the top four drops of the day, I would say. But last rant, last night I found a Jar Rune. I have a Jar Rune. I have a Jar Rune. <laughs> I'm very happy about it. If you couldn't tell. Um, bang, bang, bang. Bang. Twenty on the deck sounds like a producer tag. Yeah, <laughs> we got twenty on the decks. <laughs> Give me a hey. <laughs> Give me a ho. Give me a high voon. Oh god. I might yoink that. I went. I might yoink that for my mid thirties, where I have a. Water life crisis and try out DJing. Right after my rock climbing phase. You can have uh, DJ 20 decks on the decks. Goblin mode. <laughs> yeah, please. Almost. It's almost, it's almost Cuban time. Yeah. And we just have six more minutes of mobbing time and then we'll be, we'll be, we'll be onto cubing time. Just hang tight. Hang tight. As someone says 35, I take offense to that. <laughs> it's alright, it's alright, it's alright. I hear uh, bouldering is a great place to relieve stress. Sorry. <laughs> I couldn't help myself. <laughs> 
and then after that is will be the best phase that will be the uh the cured meat phase where i learn to make my own beef jerky that's 36 um i can't wait for that wish that would come around sooner to be honest it's got a shell on tradery i know but it's like it's just so small. It's so small a thing that you like have to make the trade. You got to speak to the person. You have to join the game. It's just like such a small thing. Uh, wow, twenty-two resistance. Well, let's clean this. Clean the stash. Um, bang, bang, bang. We got a rubies, 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 rubies. Daffies. Emeralds. More emeralds. Get out of here. Your time is up, bucko. Welcome, welcome to the dinging ASMR stream. Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> Should take that on a level MP character. I mean, move all these, move all these gems over. How's the enigma coming on? Just join the stream. Really rail dog. We're probably, we're less than a low rune away. I'd say we're we're probably about an Omroon away. Omroon equivalent. And then we just need to do some wheeling and dealing. Maybe even a Vex rune away, honestly. We just gotta hit the trades. This is this is what we have. We're balling out over here. We're rich. Um bang, bang, bang. Uh, when I played ladder, I'd always be rich from selling grease. I get whatever you wanted. Hell yeah, dude. You should roll my next grief. I don't think I've ever rolled a good dr good grief in my life. They're always so bad. You ever watch some cube gems while cubing gems yourself? It's so loud. Sorry. <laughs> And they're just throwing them back in the stash in such a haphazard fashion. Doesn't it um, just make you sick, James? Make you sick to your stomach. How could someone? How could someone live in such disarray? This is madness. This is my stash tab. Oh, what? Rolled a thirty-seven, three ninety-eight. That's insane, dog. Holy hell, two are perfect on the damage, good roll in the IAS. Right. It's confirmed, Renee's rolling my next grief. Got the uh, the Midas touch, it seems. Do we have another to pass? Nope. Okay, I think we're good. Move those over there. Move these over here. This is backup gem page. Do those, those spells. Look at this beautiful, beautiful gem page, gem slash rail rune slash other rune page, just random assortment of junk page and rune page. Nicely organized. Let's get out of there. I don't know what's that doing there. Look at that. Even got a row of charms here. Look at that. Beautiful. Like easy access. This is where we keep our rings. This is where we keep our gems and rail runes and other runes. This is gem slash cube page. Beautiful. It's beautiful. It's simple. It's simple. It's elegant. 
And you don't only save time when it's so well organized like this, you also save emotional energy. Because there's just less energy looking for things. And I should, uh, I should write a self-help book or something. I'm qualified. It's better. <laughs> it would have been hard to make it worse. <laughs> let's keep it, let's keep it real here for a second. Uh, how can I socket a helm without a quest? Oh, okay. So, if you have a normal white item, then there are some cube recipes you can do to add sockets. So it can't be superior. It can't be blue. It can't be rare. It can't be unique. It has to be a normal white item. And I think the rune, the recipe for, for helms is a Thal rune, a perfect sapphire, and something else. Like a Rao? It's a Thal rune, a perfect sapphire, and something. But I can't remember. Do you guys know off the top of your head? It's Ral. Ral, Thal, Perfect Sapphire. I don't know for sure. And then it kind of rolls sockets, so you're not guaranteed. You want to socket a Tal's head. Oh, okay, 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 okay. If it's a Tal's head, then you need to do it for the quest. You can't socket that without the Lazic quest. Not sure if you're allowed to send links. Uh, you, YouTube just deletes them. Yeah. You send links. So you're allowed. Yeah, but, uh, no one's going to see it. Except for the YouTube overlords. Roll the coronet. Drop the coronet. Flawless, flawless. So it's old time, baby. Any, anything interesting in the 40 minutes you're away? Probably not the last 40, hey? The last big thing we found was this. Want to war cries 35 life. There are two small charms there? I missed two of them? What? How did I miss two of them? Are you kidding me? If there was one... If there was one... Sure. You know, one slip through the cracks, but two? Jesus Christ. I'm slipping, boys. I'm slipping. Two small chops equals one tiny chop. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's one. Okay, I saw that one. Oh, the other one's probably godlike. I just want to get a quick vid, a quick shot for the vid, bros. Just a quick cinematic shot. Here's what I'm thinking. Here's what I'm thinking. Because it'll be like panning in on the rune, on the rune page of the stash, and I'll be like with my glorious voiceover, be like at this point. Probably could have almost traded for the Enigma. But, since we got it sooner than I expected, I decided, let's just round it up to a thousand runs. That's what I'm thinking. So if I just lay this out all pretty. Um, oh god, I don't like how the ear strings are together. Oh well, it'll have to do. It'll have to do. That's descending order, right? I haven't fluffed that up. That'll do, that'll do, that'll do, that'll do. And then I just gotta turn off this one. Turn off this one. Turn off this one. And then we'll start recording. Alright. Couple of seconds. We're gonna pan in. Think of the voiceover. It's all coming together. Probably could have found a probably could trade for Enigma at this point. But uh We're going all in. 
All in, rounding up to a thousand runs. That's what I'll say. You guys better appreciate this shot. I swear to God. Look at all this effort. Look at all this effort that I'm putting in right now. All right, stop recording. That should be enough time. <clears throat> YouTube, yeah. I'm muting the shit out of this. I'm not leaving this in. Me chatting. <laughs> yeah. This is voiceover territory right now. This is fucking voiceover territory. All right, beautiful. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. That'll do. That'll do, pigs. That'll do. At least we've got it there now, just in case. And get my glorious face back. And get that back. I just want to label that recording just so I don't accidentally delete it. The exact sort of thing that I would do. Whoop. Rune Montage 3. Getting the behind the scenes scoop here, bros. About how inefficiently I film things. All right, we're back on. Meat is back on the menu, boys. Let's get rolling. You have an enigma? Not quite. We're very close. We're very close. We're probably like a Vex or an Omrun away from being able to trade everything. Um, but I've decided since we got the Enigma far earlier than I was anticipating, that we would would round up, would round up to a thousand trap runs. <clears throat> but we'll see. Um, we'll see. Don't want to do do your bros dirty, you know. Imagine if I got it within two runs and it's like, well, job's done. <laughs> job's done. More content. <laughs> more loot. And if we do more runs, it means we can be more more cutthroat with which loot we do and don't include. It's like, mmm, storm shields? Nah. That's beneath us. That's beneath us. Only the best for you, bros. Only the best. Like that poor little small charm from earlier. That poor little small charm that pa Pally axed. Pally was like, nope, no way that's making the video. That was that small charm's big break. And you just threw it in the garbage. What was it? 11 cold res, 3 magic find. The cruel taskmaster. After Enigma 100 pit runs with Hawkabob. It's actually not a bad call. Because then we could showcase the Enigma. Oh, this bit video just keeps building. It's actually not a bad call at all. I was thinking at the end of the video. Just to show me teleporting around. Like chasing after a sorceress or something. You know, something stupid like that. It's like me and a sorceress teleporting together. Um, but, uh, working, doing a hundred pit runs would work just as well. Oh, there's a J-Mod in the ground. Oh, I missed a J-Mod. Oh, they're dropping today too. Oh, no. God damn. I'm sorry, bros. I'm slipping. I'm slipping. What's that? A J-Mod and two three twenty twenties that I've missed in the past five minutes. Oh, fuck. Oh, well. As long as I don't miss a shale rune. Only mods get J mods, yeah. <laughs> yeah, true, yep. J mods probably wouldn't even make the video anyway. It's beneath us. Grandiosity. I know I meant to check that, but I just can't be bothered. Faker. Apologies, Dominus. I simply cannot be so. <laughs> so I just 
<laughs> cracking myself up over here. <laughs> <laughs> Just the idea of someone saying, apologies, Dominus, <laughs> like really formally, <laughs> and being like, I simply cannot be fucked. <laughs> God, I'm funny. <laughs> oh, jeez. Cracking my, myself up over here. Oh, it's a good thing I'm laughing, because no one else will. Uh, good luck, Shrek. The bear is coming through. Thanks, dog. Oh, we got the shale! I knew it! We were getting sh so many shale roots. All right, now we can make the hustle, bros. We're gonna be zipping along. We're gonna be zooming along. The hustle was an inspired call. Yeah, a lot of people have remembered. Oh! <laughs> hustle into freaking unique ring with my favorite design. Dare I say it? My favorite design for a... Another Raven Frost, dude. This is like the third one. 205, mid attack rating, 19 decks, good roll in the decks. Hot damn. Hot damn. That's three from three. Three from three, Bob. Three unique rings, three Raven Frosts. And one Minald. Hell we're in two. Yeah, we'll yoink the hell. Yoink. I preferred the last Raven Frost, the one that got uh, 20 on the decks. But uh, this one's not bad. Maybe we list it for a Mal rune? I think it's we have Mal. Yeah, Mal is Justin's on it. it. It's two days ago, Justin, that would be Ist for sure, but now I think it's Mal. Um, yeah. It's annoying because I had a Raven Frost listed, went to sleep. Got two offers for it for a um for an ist rune, but I missed them because I was asleep. And then the next day, I couldn't even couldn't offload it for an ist. But I think this one is mal territory now. Just missed the boat on the ists, basically. So dex nineteen, and it was two o five, wasn't it? Yeah, with sockets. Uh, let's go Mal there. Beautiful. Let's have a look at recent trades. Now, Lamb. Oh, God. Oh, it's 15 decks. Um, Lamb. Jeez, these guys. Come on, you're tanking it. Oh, this guy got off offloaded his. Is for a 20 decks one. Yep. Ours is a bit better than that for a male. That's better. That's better. Wow. That's good luck. That is... Yeah. 20 decks for a gull two hours ago. Yeah, male, male seems fine there. I feel like if we listed that for ist, it just, it just wouldn't go. <clears throat> Sometimes... Sometimes I prefer to leave it for like a lower price, but it just make it easy to easy to sell. Raven. Frost. That's nice. Probably in arm territory now. We gotta be greed. We gotta be greedy with it. I mean, if we can't offload it, then the smiter could use the new Raven Frost. All right, let's make this. Oh, we just, we literally just cleared space. How did this happen? Shale? Oh. And then just Eld, right? If you have an Eld on the Sorceress, maybe. Let's have a look after this run. Any high runes so far? Oh, yes. Oh, big yes. L naturally. We haven't found any high rune so far this stream. We found a gull rune. But naturally, I found a jar rune. I found a low rune. I found two vex runes. 
and we've traded for two other Vex runes. So we're balling out over here, basically. We're balling out. It has been filthy, to say the least. In an unsustain unsustainable fashion. We're single-handedly tanking the economy, is what I'm trying to say. It's not bots. It's it's just schmuck. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, another smallie. 1 to 20. Alright, let's see if we can yoink that Eld Rune. I remember seeing the one the other day on the Sorceress. Is there a circle there as well? Sorry. <laughs> I'm getting worse and worse at reading stuff as the stream goes on. There's just a lot of stuff on the ground, you know? Um, Eld. Oh, don't tell me. Don't tell me we don't have an Eld Rune there. Must have cleansed it. Do one Countess run for the boys. FTB. Top left. Eld, 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 Eld. With a D. I guess we could cube up Eld to Eld. There's three L's. That could work. Did we cube these? Is L next in... Next in line? Do we have a third one? Oh man, my eyeballs. see a third L but let's see if we find a third L from this countess run or an L rune has anyone ever found a Thero Reaper's doll I found one I found one in my life yeah from uh I think that's from Bale actually there's two two's two, two pretty good now we're looking for two runes although we all know how rare all know how rare L runes are from normal Countess. I learned that the hard way. Yeah. Had a roll. It wasn't a amazing roll. It was kind of mid. It was kind of mid roll. I can't remember exactly. But I have found a perfect Reaper's Toll before. A perfect non ethereal Reaper's Toll. Which is also from Bale. Bale Reaper's Toll Target Farming Confirmed. <laughs> I actually have found quite a few from Bale. I think it's only one in a couple hundred. I got a Reaper's Toll from him. What the hell? You can get a Hell Oh, we're in Hell. Oh, that's why we're almost dead. Oh, I accidentally went to Hell. Right. I was like, what? As if we're not dead. I didn't even put uh, Energy Shield on then. <laughs> What's this sauce? This is just a Nova sauce. That um, she's kind of naked right now. We're just we're just hunting for an L rune or an Eld rune. From uh, it's meant to be normal Countess. Is it still on ladder? Yeah, yeah. Anything good since drops into Ubers? Yeah, since Ubers placebo, we found a Warcry Grand Charm with thirty five to life. Warcry Grand Charm with 35 to life. And just the circumstances in us IDing it were unbelievable. It was unbelievable circumstances. Pre-recorded, straight up hacks, scripted shit. It was insane. I don't know when in the stream it was, but... Maybe I'll put a timestamp. I, I actually will. I'll put a timestamp for uh, for um, the absolute cookery that was that uh, that specific grand charm. A 
Hey, okay. I think that works, right? Right, three L's is an L. Nice. Now we can make a hustle. We're gonna be so speedy. We're gonna be zooming along. We are zooming along. You saw, you saw a third L? You probably did, man. Yeah, you probably did. Stealth is for sure falling through the cracks right now. Yeah. <laughs> do the hustle, do, 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 yeah. <laughs> oh, I can't wait for this. Nice. So we lose 5 AES, but we gain speed. And we look sick, dude. Oh, fuck yeah. Breastplates look dope. Man, we should make our Enigma in a breastplate, dog. Wait, that's sick. Look at the spikes. Look at the spikes on the shoulder pads. Wait, that's so sick. Fuck mage plates, man. Let's make it in this. Fashion soul's up in here. Oh, yeah, that's speed, though. That's what I'm talking about, baby. That's what I'm talking about. looking classic oh it looks great in classic too oh that's money i'm genuinely considering it i'm genuinely considering it Real rune Baby shark, do 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 do, baby shark. Oh no, you fucking. That's 100% your fault. <laughs> Jesse J. <laughs> Bro, what have you done? <laughs> no, you did not get that fucking song stuck in my head. Oh no. <laughs> could be in trouble here, boys. This could be an early end to the stream. And it's Jesse's fault. Um. Looks better in classic. I mean, it does look sick in classic. You look more jacked in classic, don't you? Yeah, you're like busting out of it. In this, your shoulder pads aren't as like, you don't have that V shape with the huge shoulder pads. Like, look at that freaking triangle, man. Look at that fucking absolute Pythagoras. You know what I'm saying? Hot damn. And the arms, the freaking jack arms with the triceps just bursting out of that. Look at that rear delt. Woo, you can't contain him. Where this, it's like, oh man, show me the guns, dog. Show me the guns. Kind of flaccid and deep to our. <laughs> Giga, Giga Barbarian. Giga Barbarian. I had to cover him up in detour. Yeah, didn't want to objectify the um Dave Batista. Flawless. Don't don't no Steven, absolutely not. We're nipping that one right in the bud. Nipping that in the bud. We cannot let that freaking lodge its little tendrils into my brain. Any declone soon, bros? I feel like we haven't had a declone all day. What are these bots doing? You know? Get to work, lazy fuckers. Where I want I want my Annie's. That's the only thing you're good for. Is uh freaking declones. Muscles are offensive to us. Keyboard weak, please. Yeah. Um, this is an unrealistic beauty standard. So, I feel very uncomfortable and very unrepresented in this fantasy video game. Can you please cover up the muscles of the barbarian? It's an actual email. Wasn't a bit that actually happened. Flawless. 
Oh, gauntlets. Oh, revenue using his main and shield. We got a shitty grief and we have a shitty rhyme. Yeah, <laughs> well, it's not a shitty rhyme, but uh, that's how it can't be frozen is the rhyme. But the grief is pretty mid. It's not even <laughs> Mr. Lama said it. Yeah, but surely he was just taking the piss though. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, a grief's a grief. You're right. Grief's a grief. Why are you leaving money on the ground? I'm lazy. Yeah. I'm just lazy. EB. Oh my god. <laughs> ah! <laughs> what did you do? The rapper name could be lazy. <laughs> lazy with the 20 dexterity. <laughs> oh, you just can't stop me, man. <laughs> can't stop me, baby. A lot of destruction. A lot of corruption. Bro, Lama's fucking rap was actually straight fire. I go back and listen to that. Like... Like, not just, like, as a, as a meme. Like, I go back and listen to it because it's genuine, genuinely, like, friggin' catchy with the sick, like, uh, sick, uh, what do you call it? Do you call it a chorus in a rap song? I don't know. Loop? Lazy and optimized for being broke, yeah. <laughs> I would have something in my stash that's worth 35k and then throw it on the ground. And then run straight past drugs. Speaking of being broke, let's go, um, let's go blow all our money in the rogue encampment. Hit the casinos. And by casinos, I mean jamble with Jeed. Straight fire. It's so good. It's so impressive. A lot of destruction. A lot of corruption. Um, what are we feeling, boys? If you guys are getting good juju... Then just let me know if you're feeling rings, if you're feeling Amis, if you're feeling Cirques. Let me know where the Juju is. Otherwise, I'm just going to spam click this. Circlet? Circlet? Okay, we'll stick with Cirques. Sorry, I don't have Edge Bow. I know, I know. But I'm programmed to be broke. It's, it's in my coding, you know, it's out of my hands. It's out of my hands, dudes. <clears throat> I cannot overwrite my, uh, my programming. 323. Fast ring classic. Oh, for reals? Just like the buying process. Or like if you fast click, or if you do that, yeah. Like with the potions. Too rich. Oh, I gotta keep track of it. This is the six million we've spent as well. Got this in the table. Animations month faster? Sure. Give a shot. As long as it doesn't slow me down checking stuff, but it probably won't. Like if if you if we just right click, is it faster? I mean to me that seems the same. But I mean this is definitely f Oh! There's diadem there, bros! There's diadem! Oh, that would have been huge. That would have been we're worshipping the old gods for the rest of our life if we freaking old mode found a griffins. That's how religions are formed. Um, all right. I'm actually going to go back to this mode. 
Probably a bit slower, but I just like being in this mode. I feel like that would have had a niche use case. To the dodo, to the source. Telecharges again. It's alright. We'll have the Enigma soon enough. Soon enough. Circle of Tammy's rings your default gamble fog. Oh, for shiz. For shiz, for shiz, for shiz. I mean, personally, I always go circle. It's like the circuit slash coronets, you know. Um. Oh, shit. The DR3 open sockets is expensive. Oh, crap. I kind of got a feeling like this is probably good. But I, I still sold it. Who's it good for? What context is it good for? Because I was thinking like an immortal source almost really likes that. But surely immortal source wants lightning skills on there. You know what I mean? The bow is on, okay. And um, what do they put in there? Facets. Wait, no, not facets. What does the bow is on put in there? Really? Just like a... Just like a PvP bow is on? Is that... They put 4015s in there? Oh, shit. Okay. I mean, if they can afford three 4015s... Then give me more than a gal rune for the circlet. That's all I'm saying. But, um, okay, my bad. Yeah, I got a feeling that it was probably good. Whoops. You know, it's like, it's like everyone in the world has had this thought. Like, if, if a billionaire, can you just like fang me a million bucks? You know, it's a bit like that. Like, everyone's had that, because that, it's like, oh, it's not that much for you. A million bucks. You got millions of them, you know? You got thousands of millions. Just give me one. They'll change my life forever. And I'll be eternally grateful, you know? So, Geed, by extension, I know you've got a freaking Griffins just hiding in here. If you could just give it to me then that would be awesome because we're filming right now and that would just be such a glorious clip. You know what I mean? Just uh, help a home homeboy out. Oh, good, you dirty dog, you scoundrel. Oh well, it's worth a shot. Worth a shot, bros. All right, six million gold, one gull rune down the drain. My bad. Uh, oh, is it Terrorize Bell now? Oh, snap. Enjoy, fellas. I'll be Hawk and Trav. <laughs> but that sounds glorious. Alright, we're good to go. Good to go. Quick tradery check, see if we've got any bites, any takers. Nope, 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 nope. Alright. Let's keep hawking, lads. Let us know which uh which drops you get you guys get in Terrorize Bell though. Any book? Did I did I not have the book? I get the book. Do trader notifications not work for you either? They're really unreliable. Yeah. Yeah, same. So unreliable. Like we missed a trade earlier. Because of the freaking notifications. So annoying. <laughs> so you just gotta look at it. For whatever reason, they're better on my, um, they're better on my laptop. Which is a, um, like a Mac laptop. The notifications are a bit better. It's 
sometimes I see it pop up on here and then go check and then it's actually there. Destroy oh another hell rune. Um, don't want those, we want this. I'm sure I'm missing stuff here. Australia's had messed up notifications for like a year now, yeah. Kind of, it's pre pretty annoying, isn't it? How have I missed six and a half hours of stream already? You gotta move to the Western Hemisphere. <laughs> I mean, I'm basically moving around the globe constantly because I live the life of a filthy degenerate Viking. So I'm effectively moving through different time zones. And by that, I mean, I have the most remarkably fr fried and ever-changing sleep schedule. But uh, I do it for you guys. It's not because I am an aforementioned filthy degenerate. It's because I just want to start my streams at random times so it works out for all of you guys. That's all it is. I'm trying to, I'm trying to give back to the people, basically. By staying up till 4 a.m. I know for every stream that I miss, there's one that starts when I get on the computer in the morning. I know. You just gotta wait long enough and it'll circle back around. Yeah. We appreciate it. I'm gonna do it again. I do what I can. Don't worry, boys. I'll get these charms. I've seen them. I've heard them. I've seen them. I know I've been unreliable. Oh, phase blade. Wait, could this be anything? Right? This could be Azeroth? Surely, right? I think so. I don't actually know. Let's see. Oh, Sabre. Still cool. Still cool. Very cool item. We'll put it in the stash, just in case someone wants it. Thanks, Saber. It can't be... It can't be Azeroth, okay. Maybe. 18 life. Ooh. How are we going to finagle this? Let's do that. All right, I'll check these. I'm not checking that shark tooth though. Forgive me. Oh, I gotta check this too. <laughs> I need more space. Um, there it is. Sweet Phil's been running trap for like four days now and hasn't found out. Sorry. I shouldn't laugh, but it's just funny. <laughs> because we've been so, it's been so filthy. Like, that's why it's funny. <laughs> because, look at this. <laughs> like, that's objectively funny. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Is he a streaming client might not be on? Yeah. yeah. He's got to crank that shit up. That's what I do. I just crank it. Um... How many days? 14 hours and 20 minutes of Trav. Yeah. It's gross. It's gross. But Phil is being an absolute trooper, man. Like, he is a far more... He's a far more patient man than I. Because I have lurked a little bit. Ooh, towels. And... He's, he's doing it with, um... Like, obedience, right? Is what he's using. Alright, I'm not... When I was there, he was using obedience. I'm not sure uh, what he's using now. And I'm just not patient enough to do that, you know? <laughs> so, ma major hats off to him. Oh, dude, Sky... Sky... Uh, Sky Conic. Welcome aboard, man. Welcome to the Enterprise. The largest Manal manufacturer in the Southern Hemisphere. St statistically, but unverifiably. Thanks so much for supporting the channel, dog. Yeah, 117. That goes up to 131, right? And Gibberge. Flawed, flawed, flawed. He's on Oath. Oh, sick. Sick. Yeah. Well played. Well played. 
Can you show your gear if you haven't before? I have before, but I'll do it again. We'll do it quickly though. But if you want more in depth, three minutes into the stream. So we have Grief, Four Piece and Mortal Kings. We just switched to Hustle. We have a Metal Grid. I love this so much. We, I found this yesterday. I love this. Um, Rhyme, Wolfstar, Nagel, and then two Spirits. And then these are mainly just magic finding things. But we also found this today. War Cries with 35 life. Uh, Shitty Geeds. Our Barb Torch that we got painfully slowly as this Barbarian. And a pretty halfway decent Annie. It would be nice to be higher on the experience, but... Not bad enough. Not, not, um, not terrible. Canis Nocturnal or something? Yeah. I mean, it's in Australia. I mean, I guess it depends where people are watching from, but like YouTube, this may or may not be the reason why Kano is not I, I, I don't know, but YouTube shows you like when your viewers are most active. And I would assume that me and Kano would have similar, a similar demographic of viewers, right? And the time where most of you bros are on YouTube is between Midnight and 6 a.m. So, <laughs> if you're streaming and you want to min-max, then in Australia, as a Diablo 2 streamer, then midnight and 6 a.m. is the time to be live. So, <laughs> it's fucking unhealthy. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I don't know if that plays into it at all, but. 4 a.m. gang. Fuck's my morning cup of coffee. And then you're like, fuck this, I'm going back to sleep. <clears throat> this guy's putting me to sleep. It's boring as hell, small talk. 10pm for you then? Yes, exactly. Yeah, 10pm now. Yeah. 10pm. Actually, how's the, uh, the camera look okay? Yeah, it, looks new. it looks fine. I'm being... I think I stress about it too much. It looks fine, doesn't it? Check the light. Not too glary. <laughs> I just can't tell because things on one monitor look so different to the other monitor, you know? I always enjoy it when you load up at work and find you streaming. I love it when you guys watch the streams when you're at work. Like that brings me so much fulfillment, like genuinely. Like, ah, yes, my life has meaning, you know? It gives me a sense of fucking meaning, believe it or not. My purpose is to make your workday a little bit more bearable and find bear runes. But not exactly in that order, but uh, both are up there. Imagine if we hawked a bear rune just there. That would be fucking huge, man. Then you'd know they're watching. You're working from home, watching you and playing WoW? Whoa! Whoa, what the hell? That's a multitasker right there. What kind of... I want your job. I want whatever that is. I want that one. Yeah. Wish you had a job where you can watch TV. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Like, you could have a sick job where you can watch TV, or you could just have, like... Like, I know a lot of people, like, are... They're, dri they're driving, you know? They might be driving a truck for, like, 13 hours straight or something. And they just got the stream up on the side or something like that. Or they could be, like... Like, loading a truck or something like that, or, you know. Still watch TV. What I want is, what I wanted for a period of time is I wanted a job where I was, like, security. But, like, security for, like, a building, and I'll just sit there at reception and do exactly what you're saying. Just, like, watch a stream for, like, 10 hours. 
But I feel like that might have been the idea of that might have been better in my brain than how it would actually be. I don't know. You're in security, right, Bob? Oh, yeah, you did security for 10 years. Yeah, I remember that. Is it as good as I'm imagining it? Or I guess it depends where your security. And of course, you know, if, like I got to say, like everything's, you know, personal preference, you know, different strokes for different folks. You guys all know that already. <clears throat> You tutor rich kids in chess as a job? Oh, fuck yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah, or to be like a, uh, or to be like, like that, like a personal trainer, but just have like one really rich client. Yeah. Basically what I want in life is I want the least amount of effort for most amount of money. Yeah. And uh, to be honest, we're doing pretty well because this is low effort. <laughs> Being a streamer, it's not. It's not the most demanding job in the world. I'd say I can think of a, at least two, maybe three more demanding jobs than this. Just off the top, off the dome. Wait, either you guys are... Okay, you just came back. You guys have been frozen for a little while. I was like, God damn, did I just cancel myself? You guys were just frozen. Uh, mostly I just teach kids how to lose properly and learn from it instead of getting mad. It's a long process. True. Yeah, I used to, um, after high school, I did a bit of tennis coaching for a little while. And it, it, it was just crowd control. You know? It's like very little coaching of tennis actually happened. It was more like daycare, you know? Let's just, let's just keep things moving, keep everyone happy for, you know, for half an hour. That's, that's what it was. Let let the parents chat. No effort, that's not true. You have to make your bed every time. Thank you for noticing. Thank you for noticing. Yes, I have to make my bed every single day. Yes. Oh, God. You guys don't know what I have to go through. You don't know what I have to go through. Um, Hawk Helm. You play tennis? I used to. I used to. I haven't played in years. <clears throat> I haven't played in years. I had a really good forehand, but uh, my backhand was borderline non-existent. I'll just run around everything, you know? <laughs> I love the outside forehand. <laughs> um, streaming for almost all day is not low of shit. You're right. Yeah, you're right. It's just funny to make fun of. It's funny to make fun of. Um, but yeah, yeah, yeah. When you're doing a super long stream, it is actually hard work. Like, not this. This is fun. Like, it's... <clears throat> you know. This is fun, but like, when you go for like, the super long ones, at the end, you just beat. Absolute beat. Yeah. You ever watch other streamers? Uh, less so now. Less so now. I watch... Like, sometimes I would just lurk in ginger streams. It's like nice, kind of white noise almost, just having like ginger streams up on the side. Um, not like watching them, but more just like I'm doing something and then I've got like listening to them, you know? Um, same thing, I do that sometimes with Sweet Feel. Oh, I was a gem shrine. Uh, I listen to, I watch like Asmongold's on YouTube sometimes, if he's like watching something interesting. Like I watched a really interesting one the other day where he had this extension on Twitch which shows you the authenticity of the viewers. So you can basically just see like who's view botting and who's who's not who's not view botting. Uh, that was a really interesting one because <laughs> It's so obvious when you go in there. It's like someone with 2k views and like no method, no one's, no one's in chat. Um, but he had an extension which like actually shows you. That was an interesting one. So I watch his, um, I watch his stuff on YouTube sometimes. And then the other day I was lurking on Twitch 
not normally on Twitch, but I was lurking in a barricade stream, and I'm so impressed with barricade. Like, so good, man. He's such a good streamer. He's really, really good. I have a lot that I could learn from him. So, I want to watch more of him's, but at the same time, I kind of don't want to, you know? Because that makes me feel really insecure. Because it's just like, oh, man, he's so much fucking better than me, man. Like, it's, you know? But I, I know with that mentality, you never improve. But, um, yeah, it was almost upsetting how good he was. You know what I mean? I was almost upset by it. <clears throat> almost. Bile dropped a perfect butcher's pupil. True. I didn't even know that had variable rolls. How does it vary? Like on the ED or something? Path to greatness requires the death of ego. Yeah, you have to be willing to be the fool. Exactly. Exactly. Like all throughout uni, I would ask so many questions. Even if they sounded like dumb questions. Because like, they probably were dumb questions. But it means that you just get... Sure, it's a bit embarrassing at the time. But it means you, you, nail, you knuckle down the concept. And it's not going to come back and bite you in the ass. You know what I mean? And we need to carry forth the same mentality with this YouTube game. Yeah. <clears throat> Let go of my fragile little ego. Because I do have a lot of ego. It's not... I think having ego can be good. If you channel it in the, in the right way. But it can also be really, really bad. If it's like unchecked. <clears throat> you know what I mean? Like ego, I don't think ego is necessarily bad. Like it's, it, it can be useful. Kill the ego. <laughs> but, uh, having, a really, having a really heady, strong ego can be a source of fuel, you know what I mean? If you channel it right. Like, I feel like, rather than, like, killing off the ego completely, what would be better is if I was able to get to a point where it's like, I can control how much ego I've got freaking going on at that particular moment in time. So you know what I mean? So like when I need it, I can ramp it up. Like when I'm like doing a workout and I need the ego, like I need the energy, then I can uh, just like raise it up. And then when I need to like watch someone who's so much better at me do something that I'm doing, I need to like, let it go down and be like, okay, what can I actually learn from this? You know what I mean? It's called taking a deep breath. <laughs> Flex Real Life embeds their streams on a site more popular than their stream. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Flex Real Life's a big one. Yeah, like, yeah, maybe Tradery used to have embedded streams on there. Happens a lot with New World, apparently. <clears throat> You're missing the B in your Bob's name. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> it's a funny story. <laughs> it's not actually meant to be Dubrunsky. It was meant to be Drusky, but I misspelt it. So now it looks like I'm a Dubrunsky sim, which isn't the end of the world because I am. He was one of my biggest inspirations in making YouTube videos. But, uh... It wasn't actually meant to... <laughs> I wasn't actually meant to freaking call it Dubrunsky. <laughs> That'd be kind of weird. What's up, uh, Voltrans? Welcome to, the, welcome to the stream, man. Welcome, welcome. We're just experiencing ego death over here. It came in at an excellent time. It's hilarious. Yeah, now it just looks like a drunk Dubrunsky. Yeah. Couldn't even spell his name right. <laughs> it's a nice mix of the two, yeah. And you guys were telling me. You were telling me, right, Pally? Yeah. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. <laughs> oh, maybe we just make a new character, you know. It's not worth it. It's not like he's level 89 or something. A 
I'd do some work for a few hours, come back, and a bunch of Diablo degenerates are debating philosophy, philo, philo, philosophy in the chat. Yeah, we need you to keep us grounded, Billy. We need you to keep us grounded. Uh, didn't the Bransky start the 40 jobs and 20 kids meme about Diablo 4? I've got no idea. I don't even know if I have that, uh... I don't know if I, if I know that meme. Can you explain it to me? <laughs> Is it like... That Diablo 4 was made for people with 40 jobs and 20 kids? Because there's like nothing to do. So, it's for people that have no time. Like 40 minutes a week to play Diablo? Is that... Is that the meme? D4 is a good game. I mean, I think it's a good game as long as you're enjoying it. It will take time. Yeah, I think the past two... The past two talks have been... I'm very optimistic after the past two talks. Oh, how do we do this, bros? Tetris. There it is. But I'm gonna see. I'm gonna we're gonna we're gonna jump back into it for season two and see what's up. It's definitely heading in the right directions. Have I tried the one to seven bug? I haven't, no. Yeah, we're on ladder now, so it'll be a bit fiddly. Very fiddly. But uh, I'll definitely try it on single player, just to test it out but I don't think I'll do it as like a regular thing um d4 is okay but the expectation was so high anything but great seems like a disappointment yeah I mean I think if I th I think it was just really undercooked, man. I know it's I know you've heard it a million times, but I think you hear things a lot because they're probably true because it's a common sentiment. I think if D4 launched not the state of season 1, but uh, in season 2, if that's how it launched with resistances that worked with you know, more stuff to do in the end game, like having a boss you can farm, like Duriel, having unique chase items that you can actually find, then the sentiment around it would be vastly different. So it just needed, you know, four more months, at least. Just needed more time in the oven. Rax had a really interesting point about it. Something that I didn't, did not, um, didn't even consider, you know, Rax, Rax Hantrix or whatever his name is, the hoodie guy, really legend of the space. Um, he was talking to DM Diablo, also new age legend of the space. And he had this point that's kind of like, what's weird to me is why could you only... Why could you do so little in season one, but do so much in season two? Like, did you outsource stuff or did you kind of rush all of this stuff out of the pipeline that was meant to be for the future because the concurrent play account is dropping so drastically? Like, how could you do so little in season one, but so much in season two? And I know that like season one was already basically fully done at launch. So it was kind of good to go, but they still had time, you know. It's like, oh, true, I didn't even think of that. It's like 10 times more stuff this season than last season. <clears throat> Can you please tell me where you get the run counter? Sure. I got it from a Sweet Phil video. Yeah. <laughs> if you just go into the YouTube search bar and search um, Diablo 2 Magic Find Run Counter Sweet Phil, Will be the first thing that pops up and he'll have a link in his description but fyi it's not like automatic 
There is an automatic mode, but I, I don't think it works. It was for, like, LOD. I'm controlling it with key commands. So... Um... But you, after a while, you get so used to using the key commands. You don't even think about it. And he's got a link in the description. Crush shield. I'm sorry. I'm not checking it. Sue me. Sue me. I'm not checking it. No way I'm going to use a red crush shield instead of like a Hoz. No shot. I think they've had to break the emergency glass and pull features originally pegged for the expansion. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, 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 yeah. That checks out, actually. Yeah, that checks out. Yeah, like having the uber bosses behind a paywall, an expansion paywall, but it's like, oh, no, we need them now. We need them now. Yeah, that... Yeah, that, that could make a lot of sense. Could be onto something there. Of course, we'll never know for sure, but uh, that, that does make sense. Yeah, I love that expression too, break the emergency glass. It's so descriptive. I'd love a D1 remake. Oh, me too. I'd love that so much. Especially, I, I think a D1 remake would work Every time someone brings this up, I say the same thing. Would work so well on a Switch, a Nintendo Switch. Don't you reckon? Just handheld on the train, in bed. Just fucking banging through levels of the church. Wouldn't that just be the best? Mm-hmm. In my humble opinion, D1 remake would need way more microtransactions. <laughs> yeah, when you <laughs> instead of having paying five thousand coins to see whatever Wurt's got in the shop, you have to pay two bucks. It's two bucks just to see what Wurt's got in the shop. It's like a real life scammer now. Yeah, you could be onto something, man. Oh god, I hope they don't hear this. What have we done? What have we done? It's the beginning of the end. Is this P1? Yeah, we're just on ladder. Yeah. P1 ladder. Do you have... What base do you have? I don't have any base yet, Jordan. Yeah. I'm thinking mage plate, although... Honestly, this breastplate looks fucking cool. I'm very tempted to make it in the best breastplate. Like, I know it's stupid. But, like, look at that shit. Look at those spikes. Look at the shoulder pads. Look at that perfect triangular shape. God damn it. Look at the angles, man. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. A curace, cura, curace is better. Yeah, but then I, I'm going to use it for other classes as well. You know what I mean? Great Holberg. Yeah, but you need so much strength for that. Like, I want to use it for other classes. And it's like, let's be honest, boys. Defense doesn't fucking matter. You know? It doesn't matter. <laughs> It's nice when you get a perfect defense roll, but I don't know. <laughs> Breastplate is top base for every character. When you're a barb, strength's not the issue. Yeah, but we're going to use it for other characters, probably, maybe. I don't know. I haven't decided. I think it will just be funny to make it in the breastplate more than anything. That's for me. This is madness. Uh, just look at the graded taloons. Um, actually, it's pronounced talons. And I'll look at the demon hand just for you, bros. Try res. Right, let's have a quick snoop at what bear runes are going for right now. See if we can get any sick deals. B. 
Bevern. Get out of here. Two ist, two arm. We can afford this. We can afford this. Right? Right? We can just keep up the vexes. Why don't we just get it? It's buy it now. It's buy it now, so we'll have to just speak to them and be like, is four vex okay? They should be fine with that. Four vex is worth more than two arm. Or we could go here. And we could go... Omrun for... Not for two Vex. Vex is yes, we could do. Vex is yes, we could do. Because we've got four ears. That's one. If we get this one. Oh, that's a buy it now, baby. Oh, man. Oh, man. Vex scale is we can do, but... Oh. Prefer just Vex Gull. Vex to Ist. We can only get rid of two of our Ists. That seems too cheap. Because previously they are going for too low. Too low to Vex. And this is effectively too low to Ist. Too low Vex girl. We could afford that as well, actually, if we just cubed up all our Vexes to a low room. But, like, that hurts too much. Girl so low. Too low to Vex. Yeah, that's that's what was standard. But that was listed three minutes ago, so we're on, baby. We're fucking on, dude. We're on. I'm just scared. I'm gonna keep that up. <gasps> we have a ding. 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 Okay, that's for the Om rune. I make game. Yep, we're on. That's for the that's for one of the on runes. Let's go, baby. Let's go. What were we even doing? Ist, ist, vex. Ist, ist, vex. Okay. I know this is stupid, bros. But I'm just going to disappear for a moment. Because this is going in the vid, dog. This is going in the vid. And just to keep things con consistent, I'm just going to disappear from the video. <laughs> I know it's stupid. <laughs> oh, I know it's stupid. <laughs> Oh dear. <laughs> when you go, I'm hiding. <laughs> you know, if someone's streaming without a face cam on, then they must be really good at the game. You know? They must be really good. So, <laughs> I'll leave it on until this guy joins. <laughs> oh shit, what the frick? That came out of nowhere. I gotta make sure that the other guy doesn't message us too. Oh! Messaged. I need this other guy to come. He said he's on his way. Is is two is two is two vex one two 
Two S, two Vex, one Om. Okay. Okay, bros. Here it is, here it is, here it is. Recording. Yes, Om Rune. Vex, Ist, Ist. Easy. Nailed it. Nailed that recording. Okay, now let's go get this freaking bear rune, bros. Let's go get the bear rune. Woo! And this feels so good after doing the, um... After doing the one to... After doing the cubing to count test, this feels so good. I'm like, oh my god. I'm making high runes right now. Okay, so the bear rune, bro... I don't know if he speaks English. So we traded for the jar. We found the jar Natty. The Natty jar. El Natural Jar Rune. Okay, this is what we're dealing with, bros. Does anybody know what this means? Does anybody know what this means? That was a pretty good deal. Vex 2 is for an Omrune. Kind of checks out. It's basically Vex Carl. Based it into Google Translate. <laughs> okay, let's do it. <laughs> Google Translate. <laughs> Auto detect on. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. <laughs> Ayo. <laughs> <laughs> it's not just hey, it's hey oh. Um, he's saying hi. Okay, he says okay. He says okay. We're on, baby. He says okay. Yes, yes. I don't need Google Translate for that one. Make game. I'll join. I shouldn't have said the smiley face. I shouldn't have said that. That was so lame. Why did I send the smiley face? Oh, I regret that immediately. Oh my god, why did I do that? Oh my god. Yeah, I'm too anxious, bros. There's too much social anxiety. This is the most human connection that I've had in the past three weeks. This guy right here. Hey, yo. I just like his nature. He's got a good vibe to him. You embarrassed us all. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> you, you guys are coming down with me. The second hand. Secondhand anxiety. Yeah, relax is fine. It's probably fine. It's probably fine. It's probably fine. Yeah, let's go over to Asia service so we're ready to go. We'll, we'll, we'll jump over. Good call, man. To be prepped. Okay. This is good. This is good. There'll probably be a decline walk while we're over there too. You know, just playing the odds here. Let's be honest, boys. He's a bot. He's 100% a bot. Yeah. That's... Actually, I don't know. Maybe. He's only traded five times. Usually bots trade heaps. <clears throat> but, I mean, that's a pretty... It's a pretty good deal for us there. It's kind of insane. Did you drop a draft from Trav? Yeah. yeah. It's a bot, baby. It's a baby bot, yeah. It's a budding bot. <laughs> Oh no, come on, work online, please work. Oh, we're in, we're in, we're in, we're in, we're in, we're in. Uh, there he is. Okay. We're still waiting on him. I don't want to double text. That's lame. That's so lame, double texting. Oh, 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 go, 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 go. Oh my god, he sent it twice. Okay, 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 okay. I'm in, boys. I'm in. I've hacked the mainframe. I have hacked the mainframe. Okay, okay. Gotta get ready. Okay, what are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? What was it again? What was it again? What was it again? Okay. Two Vex runes. Two Ist runes. But oh, it's so laggy. 
an Om rune, and a low rune. Oh, breaking the bank. Here it is. Get that cam on. Ooh, okay. Low rune, Om rune, two Vex runes, two Is runes. We did it! We did it! <laughs> I'm back! Oh, I'm back, baby, I'm back. <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> we did it, boys. Oh, we did it. I should have kept the cam on for that. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter. <laughs> All right. <laughs> we got the Ithrid and everything from Trav. The only thing we didn't get from Trav was the base. Our breastplate. Keep going. Um... Well, I mean, since we got this sooner than I anticipated, I think we keep going for a, until a thousand runs. But I also haven't fully committed yet. Whew! We got it. And that came so quick. Oh, now look what we've got left over. We have Jar Bear. We have an Ith somewhere. We've got a Vex Rune, a Gal Rune, a Mal Rune, and a Pal Rune left over. I mean, we could use all of these. Hit me out, bros. We could trade all of these to get a 15 ED Mage Plate. Is that, isn't that just the most bougie thing? That's kind of gross, isn't it? It's a little bit gross. Overkill? Yes. <laughs> it's too gross. I'd prefer to give it away to you guys. I'd prefer, actually, I'd actually prefer to make it in a breastplate. And then we could give it away to you guys. Like these, these leftover high runes. <clears throat> Farm Trav until exile. I mean, we're kind of close. What is it? Vex Om Isdol. Actually pretty close to that. Um, okay. Let's get, get back to America's server. Go for a decent base. Ah, oh, the breastplate though looks so cool. We could try find it from Trav. We could run Trav until we found a base. Yeah, that could work too. Use a ghetto base for the charm factor and the thumbnail. Yeah. And to artificially generate um Artificially generate, wait, which server are we in? Oh, we're back. Artificially generate uh, engagement on your video, because then everyone will comment being like, oh my god, why'd you make it in that base? Yeah. We're playing 4D chess here. Alright. But first things first. First things first, I just need a nice little panning shot here. Just need a nice little panning shot just to zoom in on the runes. Okay, I'm just going to disappear for a second. Whoops, wrong one. Just a pan. Just got to get that pan. I want to be zoomed in like this, baby. Oh, yeah, that's better. Just zoom in. After, I can't remember how many runs we've did. We finally had the runes to make an enigma. We're only missing one thing. A godlike base. So I decided to run Trav until we found our three socket 15 ED mage plate. No, I'm just kidding. We'll see. But let's keep running Trav. Let's go, lads. God, that came together so quickly. I'm kind of in shambles right now, I'm gonna be honest. I'm a little bit scatterbrained. That was an outrageous deal. An outrageous deal. 
Two arm, two east, one low rune. Giant bear. <laughs> Imagine looking for a base with a circle bar. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Drafts notoriously bad for bases, I know, yeah. I, I haven't found any just like white, white base. You can have the base for any of your leftover runes, I know. We could just trade for one. Um, but I'm thinking like, oh, we've done 633 runs. Okay, here's what I'm thinking. Here's my artistic vision. Here's my artistic vision. <clears throat> here it is, here it is, here it is. We could go to 666. Yeah, pull, pull a joppy. That could work. Or... We could, how about this? We could like make the Enigma now, 633 runs in, then be like, since Trav was so lucrative, I rounded it up to a nice round thousand, but the drops from here to a thousand are like in a freaking sick montage with like music coming in and it's like no voiceover. It's just like, just like music and be like, sick drop, sick drop, sick drop. And then after a thousand runs, then put on the Enigma and then I get seven of you bros to come into a game, all as sorceresses. And then we all just teleport around like crazy. Like me and seven, seven sorceresses. What do you think? <clears throat> What do you think, bros? I kind of like it. Yes to all. It means I'll have to find some music, but I can do that. I can just get some music license or something. Or not even put ads on it. Just like put put a video that I'd know would get demonetized and don't put ads on it. It'd be worth it. Then they all blizzard on you. <laughs> then they all freaking aggro me at the same time. They all fight me at the same time. I hear the tiger plays in the background. <laughs> Pretty sure Simpsons did it. Yeah. Me and Seven Sorceress is sad, Keith. <laughs> You're on to me. <laughs> my my uh my alternate objective. It's an awesome idea. You're on an AP plate with three sockets. Oh, I couldn't. I couldn't, dog. Sweet Caroline! <laughs> yeah, baby shark. <laughs> yeah. But in the montage from here, from 633 to a thousand. We're only showing like top tier drops, like only high runes. Like, I don't even know if a gal rune would make a cut. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm, that's what I'm thinking, bros. <clears throat> Let's do it, baby. Better find a short song, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just three drops. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'm having fun running, running travel. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Can't end it there. We're only seven hours into the stream. I'm basically looking for new... Just I'm just like fishing for excuses to keep running. To keep, uh, keep hawking, baby. I'm hooked on the hawk. What can I say? I'm hooked on the hawk. That was a mid rune. Yeah. Gal, Gal rune makes a video, but won't make this montage. This is going to be the most... Oh, man. This is... You would not have seen a montage like this since Rocky 1. That's what we're talking. <clears throat> it's gonna be so glorious. Zodra runs up. I don't even know if a Zodra would make the cut. If we found a Griffins that wasn't a 2015, ugh, we'd barely make the cut. And I really hope this all comes together as, as glorious as it's envisioned in my head right now. But we'll see. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is Rocky Shannon, you're gonna do it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this was just a setup for a thousand pit runs. 
<laughs> True, not a bad call, man. I like it. Thinking six moves ahead. And by six moves, I mean one move. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the sequel. The sequel. So it can't be dropped from Trav up to Cham. Uh, we'll just have to run it until it rolls around to terrorize again. Doll there. I don't even know if we pick up dolls anymore, bros. Like, I think we're just, like, a little bit too old for dolls. You know what I'm saying? Mesh booties. Um, we'll take that. I'm probably missing lots there. We're gone. That wasn't that bad, Arrow. It wasn't that bad. That was pretty good. It wasn't my worst. It's close to my best, unfortunately. <clears throat> Loved it. Thank you. <laughs> um, wasn't the plan to make Enigma? Yeah, okay. We need the base for Enigma though. And I just don't know what to do with the base. I think maybe we should trade for it. With the runes that we found. I feel like that's on theme. That's on brand. On theme of the video. Like this breastplate we actually got from Faro. So we can't make it in this breastplate. Unfortunately. All that magic fire just held a breastplate. <clears throat> yeah. If we found the breastplate from here, it would be golden. We got it from fire. But we can trade things we found from here. Let's have a snoop on tradery. Let's snoop. We'll see what mage plates are doing. Um... Make it Dust Shroud? Well, we can look at Dust Shrouds too. Oh, I prefer Mage Place, actually. I mean, that's just going for a Lem Rune. 10 ED for a Mal Rune. That's way too low. This is going for a Socket Quest. What? Socket Quest, Vex, or Ismail. What? What the frick? 13 ED for an Isrun. Did we just hit that? We could hit that. Great Holberg's a good idea, but I kind of want this Enigma available for all characters. You can almost afford that. Actually, let's get this. Six Ralverins, 259. What does it go up to? 261? We got to think. This could be clean in the video because then I could say six of the 17 Ralverns that I found throughout running Trav. Boom, baby. Little callback. Little callback. Clean. Clean. I'm thinking about this video way too much. <laughs> Factoring into my decision making far too much. <laughs> You saw a decent one? Go down. All right, let's have a look. Um, it's good to get two on the go anyway. The make me and offer ones, I just can't be fucked with, to be honest. We haven't found a lem rune from these runs, so that'd, that'd be a bit annoying. Pal rune we could do. 257 pal. That's the one we bid for. 
Four rails on that one. Oh, par a oh, two socket. Ooh, 14 ED for East or Mal. Oh, booty. Yeah, let's get this one. The listing price. I'll take two, please. Um, just run more, more trap and trade for a sick base. Demonetized. I've sworn so much this stream already. Like this stream is long gone. Yeah. Nice. Good looking out, spawn. Good find, dude. <clears throat> these are only an hour ago. There's so many people listing these. Maybe we, maybe we just keep scrolling for a little bit. Land polo, um. Oh, so that's a perfect 261. Ismail. Ah. Falvern. Gotta put the defense in there, buddy. Alright, that should do. We've got two offers. Oh! Hi! How are you? Should I do it? I won't do it. I won't do the D. <laughs> Sorry. Hi. Should trade now? Whoop, caps! That would have been embarrassing. Available to trade now? Hi, back. That's how you... A closed conversation style. Zen bobs? <laughs> yeah, Pally. <laughs> Do an XD. Yes, he's available. Okay, make game. I'll join. Yeah, that's fine, dog. That's fine. Asia is fine. Please. I'll come over. All right, let's do it, bros. Let's do it. On to the Asia server, lads. Let's get rid of this. Let's get rid of this. Now more is embarrassing. I know I saw that afterwards. <laughs> I saw that afterwards. Oh god, he's not gonna want to trade with me anymore. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Should have gone with the tap to establish dominance. <laughs> yeah. That's how you make a deal. Wait, come on, please work. I still can't believe we got that bear root, bros. Connected to never failed! No! <laughs> no! No! Don't do me like this! Oh man. Okay. Mm -mm. Come on, thank god this didn't have the bear rune. My little heart couldn't have taken it. My tiny little ticker could not have taken this. Thank God this is just for the freaking sick arouse. Come on, baby. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! We're in. You son of a bitch. I'm in. Let's go. D2. It's annoying when people use O's because it's like, is that a number or a letter? You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Okay, let's go, bros. I'm, I'm about to go silent on you again. I'm going ghost. I'm going ghost. I'm going to regret this later. I'm going to be like, why didn't I just put the fucking camera on for the video? But it's like, I started... I started the trade sequences without the cam on. So I kind of want to keep it consistent. You know what I mean? But I should have left it on for the bear rune. I should have left the cam on for the bear rune. Because it's like... 
That's the climax of the video. That's the pinnacle. Is getting the bear root. I'm an idiot. Basically. Oh well. Oh well, it's done now. We cannot recreate the moment. Six Rao runes. 259 mage plate. Lock it in, Eddie. Lock it in. That was the money shot. I know. That was the money shot, and I freaking screwed it up. I was gritting like a little chimpanzee, too. Damn it. Gonna start, the, scrap the whole video, I reckon. Start it over. <laughs> start it over. <laughs> now you guys are gonna watch it and be like, oh my god, where's the payoff at the end? But I guess the money shot is making the enigma. We get that money shot. You know? That's, that's okay. Well, at least we get that one. Unless I decide to turn my fucking camera off for that, too. Like a fucking idiot. I mean, okay. <laughs> be kind to yourself, schmuck. Be kind to yourself, dog. It's okay. Everyone makes mistakes. You're doing the best you can in the situation you're in. And, you know, sometimes we fuck up. Yeah, sometimes we fuck up. That's fine. Okay. Don't have... Why did I burn the freaking Lazic quest on the breastplate? <laughs> Why did I do that? Oh my god! Surely the paladin has some. Surely Lem Smacker has some. Please! Please tell me what Lem Smacker has, has, has some. Okay, he's got that one. He's got that one. He's got that one. He's got that one. We just need to go smack some lambs. And then we're good to go. We don't have it yet. We can save one second per run now. More! And so much magic find. It's gonna be so glorious. BRB bros, just gotta smack some lambs. Only one socket quest left for you. Yeah, I think I would have had some on the source, hopefully. Well, that FCR is so painfully slow. Oh man, this is it. Maybe this is the climax of the video. This freaking teleporting over there, burning 2k per teleport, with the most ridiculous negative faster cast rate. This is it. This highlights how badly we need it. It was here all along. Got him. Got him. Sniped him. Maximum lamps, does that mean that? That's not how I've been intending it to sound. Yeah. Turn off cam. <laughs> Turn off. <laughs> it's ruined. Everything's ruined. We got camera on, we got camera off. Oh, this is what you get for trying to make a cinematic masterpiece in an action RP RPG game. That's what you get for trying. You just best not to try, dude. <clears throat> oh. And the thing is, no one else cares about this shit but me, you know? Like, no one else would have even noticed it. But for me, it's kind of like, oh my god. Like, there was a tiny little cord hanging down from my kitchen. Like, from my rice cooker, I keep it up there. And for a couple of... Through day one, there was a little cord hanging down. And I didn't even notice it. I didn't even notice it for the whole day. And then I notice it afterwards and it's going to be like, Oh my god, everything's ruined. Everything is ruined. It's all I can, It's all anyone's going to be looking at now. And it's like, bro, you didn't even notice it. You know? Like one person out of a thousand might notice it. I just need to freaking chillax. You know what I mean? I need to chillax. <clears throat> but this is a shot we don't want to mess up. We do not want to mess this up, baby. All right, let's go. Let's go. Jar Ith Bear Rude. And how does it roll? 750 to 775, right? Ready? Got it. Worry if I swear to God, man. I swear to fucking God, bro. Get this shit... Get out of my frame, man. Get the fuck out of here, dude. 
Honestly, now is not the time. Now is not the time. I'm sensitive. Thank you. Okay, let's go. Let's go. We're on. We're on. That is right. Buried jar, I swear to God, Marie. I'm a fucking... God damn it. I'm never gonna sell west ever again. Bear it jar sounds wrong. It's jar it bear. It's jar it bear. <laughs> bear jar. Wait, I'm gonna look it up. <laughs> it's obviously jar it bear, but just I'm so, I'm so panicky. Enigma detour. Not the definition of enigma. Ja it bear. Yeah, ja it bear. Alright, let's go. 750 to 775. 772! Over a thousand! That's a good roll, baby. That's a good roll. Hell yeah, dog, we did it. In record time. 635 runs. I was ready to go for a thousand. Several thousand. This is, I, I feel like I don't know what to do with myself. So I think, I think we got to round it up, boys. We got to round it up. We're going to round up this 600 to a nice, round, clean, a thousand trap runs with a glorious new enigma. It's the only thing to do. It's the only thing to do. Ooh, that looks good. Yeah, that looks good. Yep. Yep. It's like the breastplate, but more skin. I'm a fan. Breastplate looks cooler, though. Let's be honest. Let's be honest. Are we in hell mode? Now you can play the game. <laughs> Let's get rid of Leap. Now we can put this here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, we're rubber banded like nobody's business. Is it only from runs or also tradery? Runs and tradery, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We traded, um we've been doing lots of trading. Trade two, yeah. Traded for the bear rune. Traded for the mage plate. That's the sound of the police. When did the season start? Like two weeks ago, I think. Yeah. You didn't play for a while? Yeah, it's like almost it's like 12 days ago or something. Oh, we got a hawk, man. We gotta get used to these new buttons. And by new button, I mean one new button. What do we got here? Ooh, we gotta update the magic find. Two to all skills. 45 run walk, one to teleport. My god, this item is so good. 66 strength, increased max life, physical DR, life on kill, damage taken goes to mana. Magic find based off character level. Jesus Christ. It's just so good. It's not even remotely this. <laughs> Just so far ahead of the competition, you know? Re if that it, if this had faster cast rate on it, then it would be a wrap. It would li you'd literally never use anything else. 312 magic line now. We did it, boys. <clears throat> Alright. I've got an idea, lads. I need. I need, I need, I need. I'm gonna make a game and I need seven sorceresses to come in. And we can just teleport around together, you know? Just me and seven source. Schmuck. Sork. Password is Sork. Surely we've got seven sorceresses out there. There's 500 of you bros. God damn, that's a lot of people. I know we need that footage, baby. We need the footage, Gummy. We need a climax to this video. Since I had the fucking cam off when we bought the bear rune. We just need 
What are we doing? We're coming into Schmuck Sork. Password Sork with the sorceress. And we're just teleporting around. We're just teleporting wherever we want. Cow level, cold plains, den of evil. Oh, we're in Asia still? Oh shit, that, that probably that checks out. Oh yeah. I thought the last game was so laggy. And I was like, no one's joining. But surely there's at least one source out there. <laughs> Brain cell count minus two and a half. Dude, I feel like I've been cooking it for the past couple of hours. Like, ever since I missed the two small charms in one run, it's just been downhill. Like, how does one miss not one, but two small charms in a single run? Schmuck one password, a very secure one. Sorceresses, please. Please come in. Schmuck one password, lasers in the house. Oh yes, teleparty. Pour my bourbon, G stacks is in the house. Hell yeah, join the telly party. Oh, we got New Scotland in here. Hell yeah, dude. Telly party. Seven shirts, let's go. Cadavers in here. Okay, how many more? We got three more. We got three more. Three more spots. Schmuck one, password one. You're on Xbox? Oh, damn, dude. Oh, yes. Yes, mobs in here. It's mobbing time, baby. It's mobbing time. Your source is level one. If you've got a sorceress that has teleport, we're just having a tele party. That's all it is. Yes, bros. Thank you guys so much, bros. We're fucking full up with sauce. All right, where do you want to go first, lads? Where are we going? Oh, we got Jesse J here. Hell yeah, dude. Let's go, let's go Bloodmore. Let's go Bloodmore. We'll start off easy. We'll start off easy. Arcane, oh, we can go Arcane too. Let's just tell you around homies. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yes. Oh, just tell you with the boys. You know what I mean? This is what it's about. This is what it's about. Just kick, kicking back and, and fanging a telly with the lads. Oh, so glorious. Man, I need a uh, insight so bad. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, new locale. <laughs> to Trist? Yeah, let's go to Trist. And let's do cows as well. We'll do cows as well. Wait, I need a, uh, I need to get some, I need to get some. I need to get some, uh, thingamajiggies. These. And lots of these. Your mind works in mysterious ways. All right, let's get that. Let's go to Triss, bros. Where is? Raggedy shoe. Game crashed. Yeah, I mean this is basically like having five mosaic assassins. You know, this is a high ram load right now. What the hell is this thing? Oh, oh there it is. Alright, into Triss, bros. Let's go, homies. Let's do it. Let's get in. Only telly. No running allowed. I don't want to see any running, bros. May as well not be wearing boots, you know what I'm saying? This is telly only party. Alright, let's go cow level. Oh my god, I need cube. God, I need so much stuff. Found a dagger, huge loot. <laughs> nice, man. Alright. Three suck at that. Into the cows, boys. Oh, yeah, dude. <laughs> oh, yes. 
<laughs> oh, yes. Oh, glorious. Deli bar. <laughs> I can keep up. <laughs> I don't want to see any running. Runnings. <laughs> the legs are in town. <laughs> yeah, true. True, true, true. All right, all right, all right. I feel like we should set up a race, dudes. I feel like we should set up a race. Just to really... Really exemplify what I'm trying to get across here. Because I'm not getting the shot that I can see in my head. Okay, okay, okay. Here it is, here it is, here it is, here it is. I'm not getting the shot, dude. Okay, 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 okay. I need you in this corner. We start in this corner. We line up like this. Okay. Now, there's a little... We're gonna do a two-lap race. So we go around that central square and around where the cow king is. And that's one lap. Then we do a second lap. We come back into this corner. Counterclockwise? Yeah, counterclockwise. Yes, counterclockwise. Great question. <clears throat> okay. So two laps, two laps of the middle two two cubes, and then back into this corner. All right, skill issue, skill error. All right, we go, we go on one, three, two, one, go, bros, go, 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 go. Wait, wait, wait! I want to be next to him. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, this is it. This is it. This is the shot I so desperately designed. Just me teleporting with a bunch of sorks. There it is, baby. That's what it is. That's our damn. We got it. We got it. Oh no, I ran out of mana. No. I only have miners. Oh no. What realm was this? This is use the legs. I cheated. This is all the Americas. <laughs> <laughs> oh hell yeah dude all right let's hit up one more locale let's hit up one more locale thank you guys so much for bearing with me i don't know if this will um you said no running i know i ran out of mana <laughs> sue me i only have 330 mana uh you've gone mad with the streaming power i know <laughs> but i just had a vision you know i had a vision for a, an image in my head of me teleporting around with like freaking like seven different sorceresses you know what i mean but like i feel like ooh, what could work actually okay the harem that's actually kind of funny that's actually kind of funny if we what about if we all go into duriel's if we all go into duriel's uh chamber and if we all teleport around in Duriel's chamber, then the idea can be articulated. Because you can, we will all be confined. We'll all be able to see it. Thoughts? Oh, thanks, man. Thanks, dude. <laughs> the harem is also kind of funny, though. Yeah. <laughs> I kind of like the harem. Find the right tube? Yeah, we gotta find the right tube. Um, so we need, uh, what's his face? Summoner. Okay, what's missing here, bros? <clears throat> um, is it circle? I think it's circle. Which is over here, yes? Right? Quest log tells you. Yeah. Far left. Alright, somewhere in here, bros. And then and then we'll hit up the harem afterwards, because that's just objectively hilarious. Thank you guys so much for your patience. Bearing with my um my cookery. My undeniable cookery. Alright, over here, over here, over here. Oh, 
freaking natty mana potion. All right, get in, bros. My TP, homies. Let's go, lads. Almost all in. Canyon of Magi. All right, TP. Yes, beautiful, beautiful. This is what I wanted. This is it. This is it. It's happening. It's happening. Oh, yeah. Deli party. Deli disco, baby. Oh, yes. Hell yeah, dog. I ran out of mono. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Last locale. Last locale. Last locale. We need to hit up the harem because that is the greatest call of the century. I love that. Harem level one. Coming right up. So many maggots. Uh, hell yeah, dudes. Okay, maybe we try and keep it. Oh, how about this? 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 We stay in this room. And then we all teleport in a circle. How about this? Mm, that could work. That could work. Okay. This is it, bros. I think if we're all heading in the same direction, then that's that the what I want will come across. All right, so coming coming into uh, the harem level two, bros. New Scotland peeled out. He's like, "Fuck this! I'm sick of this shit." All right, and we'll all teleport in a circle, like this. Beautiful, beautiful, but stay in this room. Coming together. The vision is coming together. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's go, Bose. All right. I'm going off script. I'm going off script. <laughs> the tower. <laughs> the tower could work as well. I just don't think this is going to translate that well to the video. It was such a good idea in my head. But, uh... <laughs> it just looks like it's so scattered. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Thank you guys so much for helping. I don't know if that'll actually go in, but uh, the idea was there. Remove the map. Oh, no, I had the map there. Oh, no. What have you done? It was being covered by the map. Oh. <laughs> What's up, Schmuck? How we doing? Good. We're just flexing our enigma. Yeah, into the tower. Um, what do you mean? This is the best video so far. <laughs> do it all again from the top. Oh, we'll see. We'll see. Do it in Trav. <clears throat> I don't know. I feel like I'll have a look at the footage, and if it's if it's not. Uh, if what I wanted to convey isn't coming across, then I'll just, um, I'll just can it. We'll see. Sacrifice the Enigma? Sales for 10k, I know. It's, it's a nice round number. Alright, homies. Thank you, sources, so much for freaking bearing with me. Goddamn. You guys are so patient. So patient and so, so, um... Just so patient with my artistic vision, you know? And lack of uh, people skills. Only 773 defense, literally unwearable. I know, two are perfect. All right, what does this guy want? It's Morbin time. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Wait, we need space. Wait, can we give you these as a trade? That's funny. <laughs> That's funny. We did all of our six million gambling without an edge burn. <laughs> yes. Oh no! That's even funnier. My most hated item in the whole game. The fucking chieftain. He's been holding on to this specifically for this moment. <laughs> that was the moment, dude. Take back the grand charm. Yeah, I'll swap you. 
I'll swap you this. Good trade. Bad trade, I think. Bad trade. You can't. <laughs> Thanks, homie. All right, my dudes. I'm I'm clearly losing my fucking mind here. I wanted to keep going because I was having so much fun running Trav, but I think my brain cell density just jumped off a cliff. It was pretty poor, but I think I've actively lost 99% of my remaining brain cells just by listening to myself over the past five minutes, past 15 minutes. Yeah, so I cannot even imagine how you guys are feeling. I'm so sorry I put you through that. I'm so sorry I put you through this stream, basically. Although this is probably, this has been one of the funnest streams. I th thank you guys so much. It's been so fun just fucking hanging out with you dudes, honestly. Like, it's been a blast. Hawk Nation, baby, who would have thought? Who would have thought? The old schmuckle, the nervous source simp, ended up in the Hawk Nation. But look at me now. Who's a simp now? Look at that. That's me right in the middle. Oh, yeah. Even Fyra wants some. God damn. Look at that. Oh. God damn. We hawked up seven wives. Now that's a shot. <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Into the pub, boys. Into the pub. That's the shot. That's the shot. Oh, yes. This is how we close it. Oh, into the pub. Beautiful. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. We're on. We're on here. Turn the video off. Turn the fucking video off because what you're about to see is not going to be PG-13. Oh, yeah. That's a winner. That's a fucking winner right there. That's how we close it out. Just me, my seven hawked wives, just kicking it with Gaglash, down in some fucking brewskis in Lutgalane. Hell yeah, baby. Hell yeah. Oh, man. That's a postcard, yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm, lo I'm logged in. Time to die. <laughs> die. <laughs> <laughs> Help us! Time to die. <laughs> All right, dudes. We got it. We finally got there. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. <laughs> Even though there's all this spam. <laughs> that's. That's okay. <laughs> getting Drunsky. <laughs> getting Drunsky with Drunsky. <laughs> If I turn off, what if I turn off game chat for a second? Wait, I gotta, I gotta face this way. What are you buying? I will have a dirty martini, please. Um, chat jam mode. If I turn. Well, that's it. Now we just got to get the barb facing the right way. That was good enough. That's good enough, baby. Oh, that's perfect. That's fucking perfect. Everyone's lined up and everything. Oh, man. That's a, sh that's a shot. That's a shot. That's it. That's it. That's it. We did it. We got it. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Perfect. And look at me turning my head to the left, turning my head to the right. Oh, just looking at them. Looking at all of my wives. That's the thumb bone. <laughs> yeah, if you just turn into the stream. It's like, what the fuck is going on here? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> this is this just sort of ridiculousness that goes through my head, like, whenever I'm filming videos. It's just like, this is why I never release any videos. Because it's like, I'd film footage and I'd be like, Oh no, my cord is hanging out of my kitchen. We'll have to trash the whole video now. Oh my god. Thank you guys so much. Honestly, thank you. Fucking, these sources are just absolute goats. Thank you, dudes.
That's it. We got the we got the clip, man. We fucking got it, dude. I'm so happy about that. Those sources were so patient. Would definitely have an orgy with them again. Honestly. I had a really good experience. Like would would definitely go to harem level two again with them. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> Woodhawk. Woodhawk. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> yeah. That was fun. <laughs> yeah, I've lost my I lost my mind, Nick. But uh, I might leave it there. I I guess you've su seen seen behind the uh, the curtain with a bit of uh, how this video is gonna gonna unfold. We'll see what actually ends up happening. I don't know. I sometimes I get ideas and then it's like, oh, that doesn't actually work. Let's just scrap that. But we'll see. Great stream. Oh, thanks, man. Thank you, dude. <clears throat> Oh, I actually had an, an, another idea, Coffee. One last idea. Also, good morning. Yeah. Do, cause you, I. Wait, I think Ravenfrost did that. Actually, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I'll save that idea for a different video. We'll do it eventually in a different video. Um, you can't wait for the montage of Telly. It just looks like, it looks like flicker strike, you know? It looks like you're having a seizure watching it, so I just don't know if it'll translate. translate. Alright, peace out, dudes. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I've been rattling on for, um, for far too long. But, uh, I will see you in the next stream. Yep, can't wait. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. Welcome to the Hawk Nation. It's good to be here, man. Hawk Nation Destination Hybrids, baby. Alright, peace out, bros.